This is Pete. Pete has got high thirst, underweight, prone to illness. He's a smoker, axeman, brawler, fast learner, out of shape, and strong. I don't recall picking out of shape, but we'll uh, work on that. His skills. Well, his fitness is okay. His strengths are high. Axe and long blunt skills ready to go. So that's good. Uh, and yeah, I've never taken underweight before, so I'm just going to hope for some butter in one of these. To get us going here, get us rocking and rolling. We'll just take what we can get right now. We're in Riverside, and Pete's plan... Oh, look at this. Oh, that's a lot of good stuff. Yeah, Pete's plan here is to get all the way up to Louisville and work his way through each town along the way and get whatever's useful out of it. We're not going to clear every zombie or anything like that. Get rid of that pen. And that magazine, I guess. But we're going to basically stick around until we've got what we want out of the town. Got to take the river ducks. That's my rule. Oh, yeah, we've got a drink as well. Weird starting on day one. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Turn yourself down there. There's an apocalypse, don't you know? Electrician. Oh, how to use generators. Read it. How good is that for day one? Electronic magazine, we'll read that at home. This may well be home at first. A beat up car outside. Oh, we've got a satchel. And a fanny pack. And some clothing for some bandages. Well, no weapon, but that's a pretty good start right there. How bad's it out here? It doesn't look terrible so far. Oh, there is a shed as well. Oh man, this is annoying. Just slightly too many to deal with. Wow, that took some effort. Okay, we have a wristwatch. That'll do. We have a Louisville map. Oh, these jeans are actually better than what we're wearing. No key. Oh, here's the key. No gas. As you might expect. The Louisville map right there. Take the alcohol wipes, we'll take the torch. Regular tire there in great condition. This engine's actually in great condition. This car looks terrible, but it's actually not bad. I guess I'll use a boat icon because I cannot see a car there. I probably just can't see it. It probably does exist. Alright, come on, be good. We have a screwdriver. We have a wrench. We have an empty gas cam. Box and nails we'll take. And that's it. No weapon still. Let's get in here. Yeah, yeah, we're thirsty, I know. We have a cooking pot. And a griddle palm. In great condition. All the foods. A couple of magazines we can read later. There's quite a lot of zombies over here. Come on. Ooh. More than I realised. Come on, don't be dumb. I need you to speed up so I can kill you before they get here. Jeez. Hard work, eh? Oh yeah, we've got a weapon. What am I thinking? Guess we'll take the meat cleaver. Let's eat a whole thing of bread. And we'll chase it down with some maple syrup. Right, wait, it's going up. What do we want? Oh, 
Have a little drink. Maybe we better wear this leather jacket. It's gonna make us warm, but nice defense against zombies and whatever. No way in that way. We're in danger of calling over some zombies here if we're not careful. A magazine. Venture back up melee weapons here, I guess. Do we get desperate? Margarine, calories. Eat all. We're too full to eat, but we'll grab this better as well for the same reason. Right, good. Got a few down there. Oh, digital watch. Come here. Come here and tell me the date. You can have this one. Oh, this guy's got a duffel bag. Yeah, come here. Alright, duffel bag. Here we go. That's one completely full duffel bag. It's lightened our load sufficiently. Oh well, we're anxious. What's going to happen? We've got this smoker trait, so we just need to find some smokes. Uh, let's just dive in here quickly. Make use of the water. Yeah, we did that place. We haven't done down here. Right, I see a crowd on there. I also see this very overdressed lady. Come on. Nice, we piled those guys up. You gotta take the bears and the uh, video games. There's an acoustic guitar. Oh, there's a room here with curtains. We might stay here. Let's just make sure we close that window and close those curtains. Oh, yes. Oh, no. That was a roller coaster. Look at the condition on the thing. That's not even worth taking. Yeah, it's time to eat the butter. There we go. Now the weight's really going up. I mean, yeah, we're a bit depressed, but the weight's going up. We'll grab the scissors and the sewing kit and the thread. I have no idea what it's used for, but we'll take it. Try ourselves as well. Have all that milk. All right, well, we have this as a potential place to stay the night. We have a room with a curtain. We haven't got access to this garage, unfortunately. Ooh, there's an open one over there, though. Check that out. Ugh. The pinkest house I've ever seen. We have another griddle pan. Oh, can opener, can opener. Come back. You are essential. There's nothing we need there right now. Now, we could read this comic book. That should cheer us up a bit, right? Because we're feeling a little sad right now. Um, as horrible as this house is, could be even better because there's not even a window nearby here. Should be a little safer. It's horrible and pink, isn't it? I always forget to check the freezers for ice cream as well. Hmm. Okay. This way. Well, they made me work for that. Come on, Zomp. This way. Right, come on now. The hammer is good. So is the garden saw and the duct tape, to be fair. There's a propane torch. Yeah, we should really take that. Another empty gas can. Another pink house. Must be very on trend. Oh, we are drowsy. 8.30. Yeah, let's go to this place with the curtain overnight tonight. How's that? Let's sit in the ground. 
read some magazines here. We read a bunch of magazines. Uh, let's go drink and turn in for the night. Good night. All right, five forty a.m. Interesting. We are hungry. Wait, still shooting up. That's good. Eat all the cereal. Now, here's the thing. I don't want to go out with all this junk on me. We treat this as a kind of oh zombies outside. Right, come on, then. Oh, there's another one. Yeah, this shelf can hold a lot of stuff. We'll keep the gas cans. Dump all the stuff in here for now. All right, so we'll keep the backup melee weapons on us. All right, so we've got everything located in here. Nearly full, but that's fine. Right, so we've got a car that will work up there. Oh, dehydrated. We need a bottle. That's what we need. That's better. I guess let's come this way. Make sure we weren't followed, or we were. No one else following? Okay. Yeah, short blood's getting up there, you know. Should check of that car. Oh, this car, I've got gas. Yeah, I'm already happier with this as a way. There must be more going on. There's a holster we can wear. Why not, eh? Oh, wow. Didn't even see these guys. Okay, we have one zombie incoming. That took some doing. Right, that pan's broken. Time for another. Come here, Zombo. I just want to talk to you. Come on. Louisville map. Right, we do need to get into a house here because we are thirsty yet again. To the shock of absolutely nobody. Right, out he comes on. Another Louisville map. Right, nothing we need there. Uh, I guess I'll take foraging. Might get into that at some point. You never know. Oh, where that supply I come from? Do I want to know? Maple syrup and happiness, minus 20. Let's have it. I think we're not far away from being within weight here, so we probably want to calm down a bit on that, because I think we'll just naturally increase now. I guess that's another potential weapon. Could be stuck using these type of things for a while. Electrician volume 2? Sure, we'll grab it. Still feeling a little sad, eh? Anything here to fix that? No, just boredom and stress. A big crowd up the road here. Wow, what are you wearing? Is that a shower cap? Yeah, it is. Look at that. That's cool. Oh, we have two more inbound. Three more. Much more than I realised. Run! I've got no sheets. Okay, it's only the left hand. Where are my sheets, man? Come on. Play fair here. Got to put something dirty on because I... There they are. Look, right in my inventory. Man, that was annoying. Yeah, I know, I know. This will be my house overrun now. Let's try getting across this if we can. I think they've broken in already. Okay, well, that the safe house didn't last too long, did it? All right, one down, finally. Whoa, did not see that guy. Not having a good day here. Now this is a problem. Looks like they've all gone, but... Yeah, that was not ideal. 
Not ideal, that's all. We do have instant infection on, because I just don't have the patience to wait three days to find out. So we know we haven't got, you know, the zombification, at least. But yeah, that just uh, did not go according to plan right there. There's still quite a crew here. Looks like we got a couple incoming. Three? Okay. Man, not one smoker amongst them, eh? I like the story this is told. Quite interesting. One Zombrinos. That's another riddle pan broken. Denim strips. Okay. Well, let's see. Let's see if this car has gas in it for us. Uh, remaining 22%. Oh no, that's the condition. 0% remaining, okay. Never empty gas cam. Empty bottle? Don't think it holds much, but... Let's see if we can get away with checking this over here. 0% remaining in this as well. Although, this is in pretty good nick as well. Oh! Oh! Well, that's good luck. That's a gas can with gas in it. I've never seen that before. More nails. Let's see about looting this house, eh? I'll wear that beret. Oh yeah, very cool. Well, here's another one with a curtain. Good stay here. Oh wow, there's some sort of Car park back here. Interesting. Well, let's have a quick look over here. I was hoping for more cars, to be honest. Well, there's another empty gas can. No shortage of them. Got a jack. We already have a wrench. Annotated map. Rosewood. Oh, the key's in here. This looks in good nick. This could be our car. Engine 32%. Well, it's a start, isn't it? There we go. Day two car, how about it? We've even got another one that we can use as well. Oh man, I just saw a huge crowd down the road there. I mean huge. We know this is here. Make sure it's on our key thing so we don't lose it. Oh, it was with the Louisville maps. Right, did any of them cotton on? I want to show you how many there are down here. Well, it's not quite as many as maybe I thought. Still. Yeah, so I don't think we ever did get into this house. Keep getting distracted. Let's break in. Juice box. Uh, canned pineapple, sure. We'll open it. And canned peaches. Doing what we can. Cooking volume one, eh? All right. Now oh, we're full. Now oh, these boots are much better than what we're wearing. These sneakers. Right, this place is done. Right, let's see about checking some stuff in here then. Trunk only holds 36. Some things we can drop. Right, I'm just grabbing everything out of the house they broke into. I'm going to keep what we can in this car. Got all our worldly possessions stuffed in this car. That's good. Let's take electrician volume one. Let's go settle in for the night across the road here. Looks like we've got a couple of guys next door, but hopefully they don't wander over. Seems clear. Nice, every room's got curtains, that's brilliant. There we go, we've washed all our clothing. Sit on the ground and have a quick read. He made a decent dent into that. Let's go to sleep. Well, let's see what we've got to eat in here. Right, eat these canned beans. Remove this bandage. Is it healed yet? Yeah, we're good. Clean that rag up. And I think we're good to go. Now, we have got a car down the road just down here. I think it's got a crowbar, and I think 
might have a um, couple of pieces of duct tape in as well. Make sure nobody's... Oh, there's a few down there, but they should be far enough away. If I grab this crowbar... If I grab these duct tapes... If I drop these cans on the floor... Can I not repair this? Ah, I think I've just learned that a crowbar cannot be repaired. Well, still, I'm going to take this for today. Got a tiny, tiny bit of durability left. We're actually specced into long blunt a little. So I just think it would help so much. Let's go up here. The tippy top. Right, I can see a crowd up there already. Try and get a couple of zombies at a time if we can. There goes the crowbar. I find three is a really annoying amount to deal with. Now that made the frying pan look great, but that only happened because we wore them out so much with the crowbar. Uh, one of these guys dropped something up here. It looked like a welding mask. Let's have a look. Oh, it's a bandana. Yeah, looking good. Oh, maybe it was this over here. What is this? Uh, that's bandana for the head, okay. There's a lot of them over there. Oh, we got some smokes. Keep them in the fanny pack there. And we just need the matches now. And I usually find them in cars, I think. Oh man, they're so close, these guys. Right, at least we got him. If we stand on this one, and pummel this one. Okay, we should be leveling long blunts here soon, hopefully. Read that map. Check it back. Oh no, four. Oh, it's definitely too many. Five? Six? Oh, man. Hopefully I've lost some of them. Seems to have worked somewhat. Man, we must be close in this short blunt. Here are the other two. I think there was another one somewhere. We're getting a tad weepy here. Okay, it's not good. Uh, a couple more incoming. There's the sixth one from earlier. Wow, this is very hard work. All right, we got this over here. There is a window. Yeah, metal bars. Put that on our back, I guess. Oh, jeez. Oh, you come. Ooh, vitamins. Full bag, that's good. And some bandages. Oh, pot of stew, fresh and cooked. Well, give me that. That's an unhappiness like minus 20 or something. Pop that crowbar. You go in there. Stale cooked steak. Yeah. Check that out. Turn this on. Okay, just eat it all. We're trying to put weight on anyway, aren't we? <laughs> Although we're nearly not underweight anymore. I just want to sort out this um, unhappiness. There we go. We're back to a tad weepy. Come on, have some matches for me. Oh, there's a good battery, that's good. Maybe we'll take that for our car. There's no way into these. That's locked. Oh man. If one of these guys has matches, it'll be all worth it.
Metal bar feels good. It doesn't seem to last very long, but it feels good. Riverside map, okay. Come on, somebody have matches. Nope, nothing. Well, it looks like we've got a few zombies out here. Oh, thank goodness, a lighter. Muldra map. It's pretty good. Keys in the ignition for this. Again, this looks like a good car. Clearly no gas in it, but... Remember, it's there. Have that. We're gonna head back to our somewhat safe house. And we just gotta keep having these until this goes away. There we go, all fixed. We needed four of them. Things had gotten pretty bad. Is this where I am staying? I think it is. I don't know why I've left this door wide open. Uh, let's go down here. This battery's not great, but the 100% one in. I sit on the ground and read. I'll just read for a little bit. We're having to do that little bit by little bit. Let's sleep. Weight 74. We're still just underweight. Interesting. All right, it's a foggy day. Not ideal. Look at us. The only moodle we've got is that we're feeling full. That is an improvement. But this house, there were still zombies over here, as I recall. Aha. I was ready for that one. Oh wow, there's some stuff going on in here. They have a gun and stuff, okay. Attach that in your holster. Well, that's an unread magazine for us. I would read it now, but you know. There's badness in here. But that wasn't even the one making the noise. Mom! Wow, literally one in every room. Crazy. Take the battery and the torch, I guess. Now, what's this? M9 pistols. Take some M9 magazines. We'll take that duffel bag as well. Well, there's a key. We don't need that anymore, though. Come on, just give me a crowbar or a baseball bat or an axe. All I need. Well, it's another pistol. Grab the tweezers and we grab the pipe wrench. Uh, we shouldn't need the antidepressants, but we'll take them. Another pistol right here. In terrible condition, so I'm not going to take it. Uh, wow, okay. I feel like we have to take all this. It's going to be so encumbered. Very much a gun house. Oh man, there's so many. Oh, come off it, zombies. Oh, there's so many as well. I'm so slow. I just want to drop off some of this junk I've got on me. Right, there's a bunch of guns I just dropped on the floor here. This game always does that to you. Area will be completely clear the second you're over encumbered. A crowd of zombies will appear. Okay, so this is um, a duffel bag on the floor full of the stuff. Okay, we have a generator right here. Let me take this extra metal pipe. Mechanics volume one, that's a good find. You should already have a jack. I don't know what you do with spare engine parts. I could look it up, I guess. Let me have this. I'll come back for that in a minute. So I'm only taking the good quality stuff now. Now let's have this as well, see if it puts some weight on. We just need one more pound, I think, before 
We're not underweight anymore. Yeah, that's good. Have one of these for that. Get rid of the anxiety. All right, we're good here. Well, you know, you've got to have the ice cream if you find it, right? That's the rules. That's what we are trying to put on this weight. Well, let's grab this generator. We're just going to take it just roughly near where we're staying. We'll stick it there. Let me know exactly where it is. Use arms here to take out. So I have to quickly adjust myself there. While well, I've got a new pipe. Another bit of Louisville unlocked. Beautiful. Well, I'm not going to bother with the houses for the most part. I think most of what I need is going to be in sheds and garages. I don't see anybody back here. The barbecue there. Gravel bag. Nice some more great condition stuff here. We'll take this one. And these. A uh, box of nails. I'm going to leave it there for now. Oh man, there's a few zombies here. But this girl sees me. And so do two of the others, okay. So many zombies. We've got a cop car down the road there. Zombie right there. some fish and stuff right there. A uh, club hammer. We'll take the deck to tape, I guess. Poor condition metal bar. No, thank you. Another empty bottle. Good. Another Jenny here. Take the wood glue. Right, I've got Zed's inbound. And I'm exhausted because I just walked another generator home. This car is full now. Got our backup melee stuff in there. See if we can finish electrical. Are we staying in here? This isn't even where we're staying. Just where I'm hoarding my stuff for some reason. Yeah, we're staying in this house. Hey, look at that. Still showing us underway. Or it was. Yeah, I think that should disappear. Soon. Sit in the ground. See if we can finish this stupid electrician book. We did it. Drop that on the floor and go to sleep. Doing okay so far. We are hungry. Pretty much don't have any food in here. And it's raining, so I think we're going to go to the car. Actually going to use our car today. You know one thing we need to do before we forget? Get anything electrical out of here, because we've got the skill now. And this stuff's just taking up space. Step out of the rain for a second. And get dismantling. That's about half a level in electrical straight away. Pretty good. Oh, we're catching a show of some description. What's this? Hey, we got a level in carpentry. I always forget to watch these stupid TV shows. Yeah, we got some water. Let's go. I will go eventually. I just want to see if there's any food in this house before we do. Oh, the back door's open. What was that? Darn it. No food. All right. Oh, the car just stalled. The engine must be in a pretty bad shape. Oh, hello. We'll see if those guys catch up to us, eh? Yeah, this is where we got up to. All right, some shotgun shells and stuff in this car. Radio to dismantle, a pistol, some matches. Uh, they are kind of following these guys. Oh, got this girl here as well. Come here, girl. She's taken care of. Let's see what we can do about these guys. Well, that was a satisfying pile up. All right, let's get some food out of this house here. Come here, girl. Orange soda? 
Eat that corn beef, man. Drop this electrical junk out. Right, quick anxiety, go away. And then we should be fighting fit. Which we need to be. I've been in there, clearly. I think I remember those nails. And I've been in here. Okay. Right, we've got a cop potentially with a nightstick here. That's quite a good find. Yes. Okay, forget that for a second. She was sneaking up. We can switch to the nightstick for a little bit. A crowd there, crowd here. Okay, we've got these three girls incoming. And one guy there. All grey head. March Ridge Map. Okay, I'll read it. Ooh, quite a nasty tumble you took there. Quite enjoying these short blimp. I normally don't like it. That's why I specced into axes and, you know, long blunt. I'm quite enjoying this, this time around. I'll tell you this, there's not many smokers, considering this is like 1993 apparently. Never generator. Let's get out of that rain for a second. Um, nails and wood glue are good. Walding rods we don't have, but there's barely anything remaining anyway. Fertilizer. Empty gas can, sure. Man, that's a lot of them. I'd really like the key for this van. Oh, I pulled too many. What's this? Oh, hang on. That might be the key for that van. Uh, now I really regret pulling everyone. Wow, pretty hard work, but we did it. Well, hello, Zomb. Never Louisville map. We went a long way back there. Well, hello, where did you come from? Well, there's another lighter. That's something. A big crowd over there. Well, this is the van, okay, great. Well, that's in great condition. Three logs? Well, we could use them, actually. 115 storage, we're taking this. Check that pistol out. Taking the gas out of this, we're putting it in this, and this is going to be our vehicle moving forward, because it's got the storage we need. Good deal. I've just put everything on me. We can go and check it in here. Let's try and get rid of a couple of these guys if we can. Just checking. In case there's like an axe in there or something. Right, how many is that? Well, one of them's got a duffel bag. And it's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven of them. Okay. Right, I think they're dealt with. Now, where was Duffel Bag Girl? Oh, there's another nightstick. Yes, please. Check that gun out. Not a lot of watch. Grab another lighter. Oh, there it is, Duffel Bag. Oh. Yes. Girl had a bunch of cigs. 
Uh, pick up that duffel bag. Put it inside our duffel bag. For duffel bagception. We're up to 33 smokes now. Uh, here's a few that we somehow lost along the way. Hello. Oh, look, there's a two in short blunt. Pretty pleased with that. We've already read the March Ridge map. Do those gloves do anything for bike defense? No. They are pointless. Uh, Alright, we should probably take care of these three if we can. Never lighter. Uh, try driving this thing. Nice, it started. Let's go. Let's just say McCoy Logging Company. That's why it's got logs in the back then. Makes perfect sense. Oh, here's some zombies. I'm going to damage this car. It's in really good condition, I say, as I drive into a mailbox. And we'll leave it there. So if they come to the noise of it, they don't come directly to our door. Let's we'll see if we can take care of these guys. Nice. Okay. Good day's work. Grab some food there. Huh? And we need to go straight to bed. Good stuff. We've woken up, let's eat this. Wade's still shooting up, by the way. Alright, got a random zombie wandering down here. Hey, I like your hat. Far too cool for you. There we go. Not quite sure why I'm so encumbered the way I am, but is what it is. Let's just go. Back to work. Uh, okay, we're at the church. Ah, oh, it's too many. Right, dismantle a few things and considering the crowd that was over here we can be pretty pleased with this we well, think i see somebody with a hard hat over there we will have to ditch the fedora in favor of something that actually gives us some defense i think come here you but how many are coming out of there oh wow oh wow 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 oh man they just keep coming look at this One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I think that's like eight, nine, ten zombies maybe in there. I've never seen that before. Oh, jeez. This one frightened the life out of me with her outfit. Nothing. Wedding dress. Oh, man. Oh, there's a wedding in there. That explains it. Broken that nightstick. We have another, though. Quite liking the old nightstick. Oh, there's a wedding. There's no telling how many are in there, eh? I like it. They're all wearing the bow ties and stuff. That's crazy. This game's amazing. Oh, this is where we can find smokes and stuff. Offices. Matches, always useful. Carpentry Volume 1, we need that. Uh, we've already read that. Grab the garbage bag. And again. Oh, just a bunch of stationery in there. Bit of deck the tape, okay. We've got plenty of water. That's fine. This way. Here we're good. Nobody up here. Just a bunch of tables and chairs. 
Okay, a few more in here. Man, I can't believe there was a bride with a wedding dress and stuff and a wedding party there. That's so cool. She picked a bad day to get married. And here's this one in a mini skirt in the middle of the church. Hardly appropriate there, girl. Oh, wow. High Street. Okay, cool. Cool, cool, cool. Alright, I think the fire station and police station is down the kind of south there to the left. I think that's the direction we're going to go because there should be fire axes and there should be night sticks for us. Oh yeah, more smokes, there we go. Getting some more of that. Read that quickly. Dismantle the watch. We'll have to wear the hard hat. Because it actually gives defense. Fight defense 100, scratch defense 100, so. Hmm, I wonder how bad it's going to be around here. Let's take a little walk. Well, there's a garage over here we haven't looted to my knowledge. Oh, hello. Oh, I did not know they were all going to be there. That's bad. Nope. If they had another nightstick for me, maybe. Stop is right. Listen to that stop sign and stop what you're doing. See, this is where a fire axe would be lovely. We need some of those one taps. Whoa, one just came out of the trees there. Get rid of that anxiety for a second. Wow. I don't think we've been in here. There we go. We're not hungry anymore. Good. We're full. Found the rest of them. The night sticks feeling pretty good. Okay, I've just gone for a little walk down here. We only pulled a few with us, that's pretty impressive. There's a lot up there. Oh, there's the courts. It didn't look too bad. We could just rest somewhere. I right, get over there. We're gonna have to try and somewhat sneak back. Well, this is bad news.
Darn it, I'm just pulling more and more and more. No escape from this. Because we're high exertion and drowsy right now. And there's like just so many zombies here. I'm going to have to walk them around the house, I think. Oh, you stupid zombies. There's some in the trees, of course there is. I've had to do a bit of a tactical retreat and come back to the van. But yeah, I just couldn't deal with that many right then. I need to move that car, I've left it in the stupidest place. I think we, uh, we live around here. Give me a can of mushroom soup. He's up there, he hasn't seen me. Let's read Carpentry. So we're about halfway done with that. Let's sleep. We're out of shape because of this fitness. And that's going to take some time to level. We're doing okay without it. We've got two in axe, one in long blunt. They were specced in beforehand. And we got about two and a half in short blunt, which is pretty good. I'm happy with that. And we've got a can of beans here to eat. Weight is going down, actually, so we need to open this one as well. We're halfway through a carpentry book by the look of it there. So let's stick that in our duffel bag. I'm going to drop this bottle and this one. Now, we'll just go with two. And our van's down here. Uh, there's still some room in here. We're good, we're good. We need to take this van. And we need to clear a path towards the fire station. Um, I'm wondering if it might be best to do it from the south. Um, saying that, we've already started clearing a path this way. Let's just go this way. Look at these piles of zombies we've been taking care of. Craziness. Now, while I've got a second... Let me attach these up. There we go. That's out of the way now. And also, this wedding dress. I've been sold. It's a very, very rare find. So, we probably want to um, take this, right? It does give some bite defense and stuff, but not as good as what we're wearing already. So show me here, right, skills. Tailoring is 0 0.32. If I rip this dress. It does go up, okay. There's something to keep in mind, because I don't often keep a hold of the clothing. Which I probably should look into that. Let's keep going. Right, we want to just do this bit by bit if we can. But is it worth just throwing these things out on the ground whenever we come across them? I don't know is the answer. I guess I'll do it. What have we got here? Just a bunch of stale pies and stuff. Okay. Nothing for us. I think six days in, I think we're now past the point of um, being able to use the TV shows to gain skills. So yet again, I've let that slip by me, as I always do. There's the courthouse. We don't need that right now. Couple of fire guys. Hmm. Apologies for the view there. I'm trying to limit how many I take on at once here. Ah uh, man. I'll time him. Put those military boots on. Nice dick just broke. Not great. Guess we're gonna have to use the hammer. Come on, mate. And they're all stood so still. Got a nice little point in sneaking there. A little level. Nice. See, these are great for bite and scratch defense, but I don't know if they... Yeah, insulation's so high on them. They're perfect winter attire, really, aren't they? We've already got a pair of the pants, we just need a jacket, really. Which we'll probably find in here, to be honest. But nobody's sleeping against the walls, that's good. Well, the hammer's in great condition still. That's something. 
A couple of zombies coming around the corner here. Go back up here so we can take them on. All right, we've got these guys down here as well. Light footage just leveled, whatever that does. Don't really understand the difference between that and sneaking, to be honest. Nice. There's a good jacket. We've got to wear the firefighter's helmet, right? Beat his hard hat. Don't we look cool? Oh my goodness, it's open. Not the place I was expecting to find a lighter, but there we go. Oh, water dispenser. Hello. There's the key. Another Louisville map. Woo. Another one in here. Deal. That's a gas mask. I don't know what good that does, but I'll take it. Denim shirt? Give us a bit more bite defense. All right, here we go. This is what we're talking about. Got an axe, got a crowbar, got a lug wrench. Axe, get on my back. Two more axes in perfect condition. Oh, and we've got so many axes. This is beautiful. Where's my van? Oh, down there. Not good, you know. We need to drop these axes right here. Right, get rid of the anxiety. I've dropped all the axes right here. So we can fight. I'm thinking I'm going to use the long blunt. I want to keep things at pace here. I want to, like, I want to get to level three in short blunt and three in axe and three in long blunt. And then, you know, work on level four and whatever. Just so it doesn't matter what weapon we're using. We've got a good chance of being triumphant. Well, it's a lot right there. Come here, you. Oh, we need a place to stay. I've got all our stuff on us right here. We might as well just move into this fire station. It's one of the best bases you can get in the game, isn't it? We're going to have these guys following now. See if we can start this. Okay, good. Oh, man. More crowbars and stuff in here. Now we should be able to pick stuff up. No, we do need a shovel, I think. I think you need that for certain things. Oh, nice. Some actual things here. Alcohol wipes. Painkillers. Sleeping tablets. Beta blockers. Very good. Here's a lunchbox. Got a chocolate chip cookie we can eat. And a shortbread one. Nobody there. Nobody there. There's somebody in here, though. Whew. Well, there's another non-stale cookie. Right, nobody in here. Nobody in here. All right, I think we're good. Oh, foraging's going up. Hey, that's good. Wasn't expecting that. Right, there's some ice cream in here. There's some beef. There's a couple of cookers. This is a great base. Cereal. Eat it. Here we got loads of stuff here. Loads of stuff. It's not secure by any means, but quite secure if we come over here, I think. In the ground and do a bit of carpentry reading. Okay, 11pm. We're tired. Go to sleep. 7 a.m. wake up, all right. See if we can finish this book quickly. There we go, carpentry's red. Get in that bookshelf. All right, we're just getting a bit sorted there, a bit organized. I know what I'm doing with the storage now. Right, nothing on the TV, but I think we have past that stage now, which is fine. All right, so we've got spare axes and Shovels and stuff here. Alright, so that's all our weapons and stuff ready to go. 
Love that. Okay, we've got most of the stuff. Save a couple of bits. Try and get organised here. We can make a bowl of oatmeal. Let's do that. That works. Yeah, I think we're good here now. Might just read mechanics and then go to bed. Oh, we just leveled carpentry, I think. Must have just caught it in the background by accident. That's good. Just one in the morning. Let's get some sleep. 9 a.m. Not bad. Anxiety to get rid of. Make a bowl of oatmeal. Add maple syrup. Eat it. All my lovely weapons laid out, ready to go. Let's take this jack with us. I can go back downstairs. And let's go out today now we've all sorted out here. Couple of zombies there. We're going to have to work on this little area a little bit here. This jack can just go on the floor. And these empty gas cans can go in here. But as you can see, we've got some work to do. Oh, come on, zombs. Nice. Uh, they're far enough away for now. Alright, nice. Now that is a police station right there. That's got to be worth clearing out, right? It'd be nice if we got some nightsticks out of this as well. Pretty sure we've read the March Ridge map already. Ooh, pistol we'll check out on the floor for now. Decent quality nightstick. I'm enjoying the short blunt this time out, so we'll collect as many of them as we can. It's a good thing zombies don't know how to use guns because these guys are armed. Got a gun. Wear the bulletproof vest. Give me the nightstick. Another shotgun. Another nightstick. Beautiful. We'll just leave these shotguns here for now. They won't despawn. And I think there's a lot of them going in there and trying to come around by the looks of it. Yeah, which is not ideal because we want the key if possible. Let's see if the door's open. It is. Out you come then. Roplet shotgun. Roplet duffel bag. Yeah, let's check it out. Right, come on. Come on, buddy, have the key. No key. Right, these desks are good. Walkie talkies, radio, smokes. Hey, there's level one electrical, that's good. Vitamins, matches, always good. There's some cigs, some smokes. Be nice, we've got a water dispenser here as well. And this is just tables and chairs. Right, well, water dispenser there, we'll have to try and remember. Ooh, well, he's kind of stuck in there. Yeah, it's a shame we didn't get a key. There's a zombie. So no key, eh? Well, it wasn't a total bust. I would like the key, though. On you. Ooh, that looks like to be in good condition right there. Come on, please don't be dumb. Wow.
There's the key. Thank goodness for that. Is there a way to open this safely? Yeah. I want them to shut up. I don't think I have any food in me. I don't. Got some more stuff up here. We have the key now, so... Here we go. This is what we're talking about. Okay, we've got access to this. We don't need it right now. That's good stuff right there. Oh, there's a few of these cars about. Interesting. Oh, I do not know where he's going. Oh, we seem to be clear that way. Oh, we have a key for this as well. Unbelievable. Oh, is that not the key for this car? Interesting. So maybe for one of these. No, no. No. What? A level with you? I don't know what's going on. But here's a key. Well, this is in sensational condition. We've got the key for it. Brilliant. Check the trunk. Oh, it's got 99 capacity as well. Pretty nice. And it even comes with a free shotgun. In terrible condition. Oh, keys in this one as well. And fun fact, it starts. Another great shotgun in there. Wow. I do like the way they all come with walkie-talkies and stuff. Got guns and stuff now, that's fine. Um, Alright, so we have the key for these two. What sort of condition is this thing? Because it looks like it's leaning to me. Uh, the gas tank is not in great condition, but otherwise it's pretty good. Let's attach him. Oh, this pull's great. Must have really good horsepower. Pulls like a champion. They are detached. They're just there for whenever. Uh, we need to get inside here. Let's read Cooking Volume 1. Let's make a start on that. Wait to going down. Let's eat this ice cream. Happy days. Ah, there's that key, I think. That's the one I went missing. Oh yeah, nightsticks. There we go, the nightsticks fit on that table beautifully. I find this particularly satisfying, the way the handles go there. Um, I think we're ready for bed. Pretty late. We're about to hit level 3 in long blunt. Um, so, let's make sure we've got a couple of nightsticks attached. Stick us some belt left. We'll always keep this backup crowbar on us because it's a good thing to have. Oh yeah, we're hungry. <laughs> let's eat something. Hmm, should we have a dish towel? Do you know what we could do? We could make like a big stew of some description. Maybe I should hold off until I've read this cooking magazine, though, eh? Let's stop overthinking it. Let's just eat this. There we go. We're stuffed. Let's go. And let's take a can of corned beef for the road as well, because we'll probably get hungry again. Right, I don't see that we should need a car today. We just kind of want to work our way up the street a little and clear out whoever needs clearing out. I right, got the anxious moodle, so we'll get rid of that. The only way we know how. Right, there's long blimp. Next, we want to level short blunt. Quite a few over here at the courthouse. Well, oh, there was a couple here, but I think they... Oh, there's one. Mr. Beard. This truck is locked. Check the back of it here. We shouldn't need any more empty gas cans for now. nothing doing with that. I don't think the courthouse is going to have a great amount of loot for us. If I'm honest. Oh. 
We're in, just like that. Yeah, I think the main thing this would have would be like desks with smokes in and stuff like that, but I'm not desperate for that stuff right now. Oh, there's a proper flashlight, we'll take that. Yeah, it was like you making all that noise. Come here then. No key. Oh, look at this, see? More cigs. Oh, hello, zombies. An awful lot of you. But we just leveled maintenance, which is pretty nice. Man, oh man. Well, some interesting looking vehicles. I can see a couple of car keys over here, actually. I think that's what they are. You can usually spot them with this. They kind of look like, well, like that. I don't know how else to describe it. But they're definitely car keys, aren't they? Just for this, and... All right. There's some more zombies here. Okay, nice. Check that bag out in case we ever want it. And dismantle that watch. Now, what's this then? Oh, some sort of gated community over there, okay. Well, everything's got a key, it's crazy. More smokes. Oh, this has got a bit of um, juice in the tank. Interesting. And camera. Dismantle them. Walkie talkie. Dismantle. Thunder microphone. Disassemble. Dismantle the radio. And it's a heavy duty car tyre. Okay. What sort of condition are you in? You look great. I mean, the tyres aren't great, but we literally have just got a tyre in the back there. Otherwise, pretty fantastic. With 111 space as well. That's the helicopter. I've got the cooking magazine, yes! Okay. Oh, no, no, no. I was not prepared to fight then. Jeez. Well, hopefully I'm not too close to that corpse. Okay. This room's clear. No chance of corpse sickness. Sit in the ground and read your book. No idea how that zombie found me. We'll try this again. Nice, we've read it. And leave that here then. But get rid of the anxiety at the very least. Hopefully it's passed. I mean, I don't think it lasts this long. Uh oh. Yeah, this is the problem. Yep, let me past. Now we're tired and hungry. Yeah, it's not gonna work. It's pretty bad out here as well, okay. Hmm, is there somewhere I can lose these guys? Let's see. This is tricky. I'm picking more and more up. I hate when this happens. I think my only choice to now run to the van. And drive somewhere far away. Thank goodness we found this van. Because it's just crawling with zombies here now. If we can get back to the old house, maybe, that could be good. I think it's just up here, right? Have I missed a turn? Yes, massively. Okay, so that's a car park. You don't turn there. Like little ants all over the place. 
Um, that's not a road. You don't turn there. There's a bookshop there. Good to know. Ah. Turn here. This is where you turn. Now, this would have had an effect in pulling all the zombies in various directions that you don't want them being pulled in, basically. So what we do is we come down here and we hope this house that we were staying at hasn't been adversely affected by this. Quick look. Seems to be okay. Right, sleep. Not what you need. A very, very foggy day. Well, let's have this canned mushroom soup. Let's have this corned beef. Man, it's so foggy. We haven't done, like, down this street over here. While we're waiting for the fog to subside a little, I don't see why we don't do that. Yeah, we don't need no empty gas cans right now. Well, actually, maybe. We might need to fill up this van, I suppose. Fishing rod? Yeah, grab them. But this house looks like it's been pretty run through by the zombies. Fresh carrot. Fresh pear. Beef jerky, yes please. Get that mac and cheese. And grab a few cans of food. We're a little low. Right, I think I see a zombie. Through the mist. Uh, yeah, we don't need any of that. We can dismantle this. Whoa! Always gets me. Whew. Well, this is a nice house. Nobody about? Good, okay. Drink that orange soda. Hey, that's a volume one we don't have. Trapping. Guess we should. Disassemble beds and stuff. While we're out and about here. We do need carpentry too, though. I think we're done anyway. Now we can see again. Grab these generators, eh? Wow, there's a big crowd on there. We we'll probably just need to burn away from those guys and assess the situation nearer the base. Whoa. Whoa, whoa. Situation's bad. Situation is bad. Yeah, it's ridiculous. Uh, okay, we've got trees there that we can play with. I'm trying to get to some trees, but I'm just picking up more and more and more and more zombies. On my travels here. Yeah, this is just going to be like hundreds of zombies behind me right here. Hmm, this house might have to do. Some of them will get hung up on this. Where am I going, man? There's loads of farmers here. Well, I think... Bizarrely, this plan's kind of worked. Where am I? I've got no idea. Again, too many. I just want a fire axe, but they're all in there and I don't want to wreck my base in the process, you know? Hey, zombie, what have you got on you? Uh, nothing important. There's a lot of zombies right there. Oof. Right, these guys have somehow tracked me. 
Yeah, this is unworkable. Thank goodness that started first time. Yeah, we have no choice but to abandon this area. Helicopter events just completely ruined it. You know, as it's supposed to do, in fairness. It's a game mechanic designed to stir things up and kick the nest and make the zombies kind of track and move over from where they would be otherwise and all this sort of stuff. Just really annoying when you just can't get a foothold. I just want to grab an axe as well. I'd love to grab an axe. Desperate to grab an axe, but impossible. It just doesn't matter what you do. You can't. You pull them all away and they just seem to reappear. It is like an infestation. So what are we going to do? We're going to come back down here. Where it's relatively safe. Yeah, I've been through the helicopter event before. Stayed in my base pretty much. And nothing like this has ever happened where the whole map of zombies just seems to appear outside your base. We got some food. Eat that mac and cheese. You know what we're going to do? We're going to come back to this house and slowly go over there. And we're going to bit by bit reclaim it. We're going to take it out zombie by zombie by zombie by zombie. Until we're safe again over there. That's all we can do. Obviously, that'll have to start in earnest tomorrow. We can get these few out of the immediate vicinity. Right, that crowd's taken care of. Even if we've got anyone a bit closer, yeah, we've got a few more here. Right, I think that's enough for now. Why don't we level some tailoring then, just to uh, take some of these clothes off and try a bit of that? Really, it's probably a better idea to Grab all the clothes quickly and then get away from them. Let's see how that works. Well, that did next to nothing for tailoring. Ooh, an unread magazine. We'll grab that. All right. Disinfect these rocks. There we go, we got a ton of sterilized rags in us now. Okay, let's go to sleep. Alright, ten past nine. We're gonna work on a plan now. We are here at the moment, we wanna be here. We've got all sorts of zombie badness between here and there. We could just come down here and try and take it this way, but I wanna clear this. I don't want any of them hanging around like bad smells, so we're gonna start clearing a path through, coming along here, all the way down here. And we're going to do that methodically, bit by bit, zombie by zombies. Are we still got water here? Uh, apparently so. Let's wash ourselves. And let's wash our clothing. Let's read this engineer magazine quickly. There we go. Right, another day in the neighbourhood. Alright, looking good. Guess we'll take the car, or the van. It doesn't have the most gas in the world, to be honest, but... Maybe that's what we need to do. Clear a path towards the gas station. Give you an idea. Alright, here we go. Some action. These must have been wedding goers. Oh. Well, that's gone. Get the crowbar out. Here's a few to take care of. Looks like a weird mixture of a biker gang and some churchgoers. I do love that lava jacket. Oh, hello, church lady. All right, we've got these two girls coming over now. 
Oh, we've got more than just those two girls. We've got a whole crowd coming over. Oh, she had a little party hat on, so there's definitely been a party somewhere. Ooh, strawberry seed, hello. We need seeds. Don't remember if we've read West Point or not, so I'll read that. Hello, you. Coming from the church. It might be an idea to clear up this way. Oh, some smokes. Man, that got a little bit hairy. Came through though. Please tell me you have a night stick. He does not have a night stick. Nice. Three things to dismantle here. Thank you kindly, zombie. He's a random corpse. With a walkie talkie as well. More goods than an electronic store, these zombies. I don't know what that place is. No, I don't know that I need to find out, to be honest. What I do need to do is try and curve over to these guys. Show myself to them. Hope I only got a couple. Yes. Shotgun and pistol. But oh, we are exhausted, so let's go rest somewhere. We never even came into this house. Oh, you're kidding. Obviously not what I wanted to happen. Might be good, though. Should bring them all closer to that area. Make sure no one is seeing me right now. I think we're out of earshot of the alarm, so we should be okay to go in here. And have a rest. Right, just eating these things and then we'll be back on the road all right looking good we're rested we're fed how's our water looking could do a filling up one bottle of water let's do that quickly ah, carpentry volume one we need volume two man right, here we go here's where they start appearing So we've had an alarm and a helicopter just really stir up the population recently. Not good, man. We've already read that magazine. I see you. Come on, Zomp. You can do it. Work it out. Now, I think peak population is day 28. So there's a chance some of these are just respawns. And also, I did run a load of zombies into some trees a few days ago. There's every chance. What we're seeing is a lot of them now. Do you recognise any of them? Was that a lady with the grey dress and the black gloves there? It's all good anyway. This town's all about grinding our skills. Taking a bunch of vitamins to hopefully stave off that tiredness a little longer. Gonna go for a little walk up here whilst getting rid of my anxiety. Man, I do not like that angle. It's horrible. You guys know what I'm talking about with that? Oh, that purple dress lady was tough. Okay, it's not as bad as I thought it might be up here. Although these trees seem to be awful populated. Whoa! Where do you come from, girl? There's definitely some in the trees behind here. Give it a shout. Might regret that, but let's see what happens. Uh, run! Yeah, definitely regretting that.
Wow, pretty gnarly, eh? Stupid decision, really. Exerted and tired. But, I feel like we got rid of a lot of them. Uh, we live just down here, we might as well walk. We know where the van is. Uh, this is us, right here. I never know until I see that blue van for some reason. Alright, seems to be fine. Let's go to sleep. Fill that water bottle. Eat this mac and cheese. Our weight's about to go under again, so we do need to focus on that as well. But we really do need to focus on some fitness somehow. It's possible the electric just went off, or it might just be in the time the streetlights normally go off. I'm not sure. Here's where it all happened. Hmm. Seems I caused quite a commotion. Looks like it might be a bit of a foggy day. Where'd you come from, girl? With your fork in your knee. We're in now. Oh, empty cooking pot. We like them. Fresh grapefruit. Fresh milk. Oh, we're down to underweight again here. It's not good. Uh, farming? Sure, we'll take that book, I guess. Oh, hello. I've got a bit of a crowd in coming here. Got a few over here. Oh man, they've all spotted me. It keeps happening lately. Being careless. Alright, we might just want to pop into this building for a quick rest. That was a lot of work just then. Get ahead of the exertion, which was probably about to happen. Right, there's a big bookshop up the road. Yeah, that's more like it. We've got a few coming in. Nice, leveled long blunt. Yeah, anxious, so we need to get rid of that. Beta blockers. I'm saving them for when we need to go shooting. Right, come on, crowd. Interesting how they're all near the bookshop. Rosewood Medical. Okay. We're doing okay for med supplies, but good to know that's there. Another crowd just up the road. Alright, this is open. Quick walk around. We seem to be alone, okay. Carpentry Volume 2. Yes, Carpentry Volume 4 we will need eventually. Metal work, and I'm sure we'll want at some point. Uh, mechanics Volume 2, sure. Engineer Magazine, unread. Alright. We will read it then. I think we have Electrician Volume 2, but I'll grab it just in case we don't. Uh, Carpentry Volume 3. Brilliant. Already read, already read, and read. That's read, that's read. Here we've read most of them, that's good. If I can hear someone, I can't see them. Oh, right there. There's some apartments right here. I heard you. Oh! Didn't know there was two of you, though. Woo! Wearing matching outfits, that's kind of weird. Just want to run in and get some food because we're kind of hungry. Maple syrup, do you know what? We need to put weight on. Let's do it. Didn't even make it go up. Empty cooking pot we need. Peanut butter, eat it. 
There we go. Weight's going up now. Unread angling magazine. And a walkie-talkie. That was an unread magazine as well. But do you know what? We probably should have rested. Didn't need to. It's all good. We are drowsy though. Medical. I should have some vitamins, right? Darn it. It looks like we've got a couple inbound. Looks like we've got a zombie there as well. That's fine. Need to be aware of that. Right, we're officially tired now. Oh, what sort of hat was she wearing? Cowboy hat. With a cowgirl. Trying to get us. What can we do about this tiredness? We're going to have to try and... Um, oh, we could come down here. I think there was a convenience store of some description. And something has to have an open window for us. Oh, we're in. Quick sweep, some water bottles and stuff. That's all like candy and stuff, which is fine. I mean, we are trying to put on weight, so I guess we should grab all this sort of stuff. There's that generator magazine we've already read. Okay, no coffee. The last place would be Rosewood Medical. Darn it, straight away with the noises. Nope, nothing. There's no way we're doing this without coffee or vitamins, so I think we're going to have to walk back. Walk part of the way back. We have got a van for the rest of it, which we do need to load up. Right, much better. Right, we're back here. Even though we've moved into the fire station, we're still here. <laughs> we're ridiculously tired. I need to read these. Well, that's already read. We don't need that one. That's unread. And we need a book because it's too early to go to sleep. Really. So we might as well read for a little bit. We need a carpentry one, don't we? So carpentry volume two. Let's work on that. All right, it's like 10 p.m. now. We've read a few pages. We've read 76 pages. We were reading very slowly, of course. Uh, let's eat these two gummy worms. Man, that weight just won't go back up. All right, sleep. About to become underweight again, which is not ideal. Uh, seems to be going back up. Okay. But how are we looking? Okay. We're currently trying to work our way up this high street to get to this gas station. That's the current plan. We have got a um a base set up in the fire station. But unfortunately, we got pushed out of there due to the helicopter event. We're back over here, just slowly reclaiming it. We're not in a rush. At least we know the helicopter event's been and gone now. Hello, random zombie. We have one random girl there. Boom. What's our skill? Oh, long blunt's getting right up there. Yeah, we can drive a bit further up here. Oh, right, here we go. Here come the zombs. Quite right the crew. Quite right the crew. Jenny's table right there. Right, not bad. Quick read of the Louisville map, a cursory glance. I think that's like a motel right there. Don't need to worry about that, really. Wow, one shot. Pretty nice. Looks like we found a Spiffos. But they're all locked. That's fine. We don't need any more cars. We've got rotten things here, as you might expect. And ketchup, though. Man, that zombie was in an awkward place to hit. Uh, excuse me. Come here and take your medicine. There's the key. Get rid of that anxiety. 
There's a fresh onion. And some fresh processed cheese. Here's a bunch of meat. Ooh, missed it, hello. Fresh potato. Flour and yeast. Well, I don't have any sort of cooking pot, but I can throw this all into an oven, I'm sure. Oh, the bacon's burnt. Whoops. We'll leave that. Eat the potato. And eat all that meat patty. Desperately trying to put weight on here. That'll help. We've got some meat patties to eat now. Hello. Nice looking car outside Pizza World, but we don't need any more cars. Dismantle the earbuds, take the alcohol wipes. Wear the leather gloves. Very nice. And we will take the deck to tape. Right, what's this over here then? Ooh, we've got a little crowd over here. Right, what is this place? Oh, is this um like a garage of some description? Riverside map there. Uh, wait, evened out again. Give me another meat patty. I think we're gonna have to take this uh, jacket off. We're always roasting. Right, we're in. Turn um, pop for later. Hey, there's a welder mask. I think we need that later on. That's good. Let's see what this place has got. It's got spare engine parts, mufflers, an unread magazine, we'll give it a read. The performance models. Good deal. Where's this annotated map for? Louisville. The suspension parts and stuff, and brakes and whatever. Mechanics volume one we've already read. Ah, oh, here's the gas station. All right. Yet another Louisville map. They just keep coming. Some matches and such there. There's a couple of zombies up here. All right, no alarm. Hey, okay, wait, 76. Let's grab all this sort of junk. There we go. All the smokes you could ever want. Oh wow, there's an upstairs. This is someone's house. Eat all the cereal. Wait, seriously needs to pile on now. There's a DB shotgun. Some headphones to dismantle. And not a whole lot else. Some sort of alarm going off around here. Well, hopefully we're going far enough away where that won't matter. What are you doing following me? We might sleep here tonight, actually. Oh, that should be nice and full now. Did we bring any gas cans? Oh, yes. <laughs> we did indeed. Right, we've got seven full gas cans there. That's beautiful. I think it's time for another meat patty to celebrate. Ooh. Don't be outside. They're inside now. Ooh, hang on. He's got the key. So curious about this building here. Wonder if the key opens it. Don't understand what it is. Nope. He does not work in there. Oh, there's a little stock room back here. More goodies for us. Another map we've already read. Let's sleep in here. Oh, these people have an alarm. 
Of course they do. Get rid of the morning anxiety. Oh yeah, wait, 77 and going up. We've got one party left to have. And let's sit on the ground just for a couple of hours and read. We need to get through this carpentry book. Uh, we're about halfway through it now. A good start. Go have one of those. Whatever it is. We got another gas can filled. Because why not? Alright, now we need to start fighting our way back towards the fire station. We've cleared a path right up here. We need to make sure you know. We clear as many of these bozos out as we can. A few zombies in that area, but I'm not too interested in them. I'm more or less done with this town, to be honest now. I don't think there's too much else we want from it. But we do need to clear this area down here. So. Get that duffel bag out there. Yeah, we got some zombies over here. Up that fence. We've got some coming this way, some coming this way. That'll be fine. i surprised we've already made it back to the fire station. I thought it would be more of a fight to get here, but... I guess I did run a lot of them into the trees, didn't I? We have the attention of a few more. Groups in the field, of course. Well, quite a few here. Oh man, the crowbar actually broke. I touch it on my back. We've got a backup. It's all good. Now I know there's a lot, lot, lot more of them, but they might all be these groups down here. Yeah, there's a lot more over here, actually. You have this broken crowbar. We could do with a rest here. Rest by this bench. Get rid of the anxiety that's just popped up there. I have a bag of chips and some choco cakes. We should be good as new. A lead pipe, eh? Oh, that's a big crowd right there. We've got a group of them coming now. On this range ridiculous. Where is the farmer? Any seeds? Nope. Ooh, high end camera. Well, that group's just there, but I think we need to see what inside is like if we can. Hmm. Say what? Go around. We need to rest again. Man, this thunder's obnoxious. Ooh, broccoli seeds, hello. Come on. A big group down there, but... Let's try not to let that worry us for now. There could be zombies all over this building. It's 
So far, so good. Okay, it's got a VHS player, this TV. Worth knowing. Right, I think we're all set here. I mean, we're hungry. There we go, beef jerky. We're all good. How about that, eh? Finally back home. Sit on the ground and read your carpentry book. We're nearly finished. Leap it off. We're back over at the fire station. In terms of skills, making some good progress with long blunt. Um, I'd like short blunt to level. So, I think we'll be taking these two here nightsticks. Belt left and backpack. Oh, we've got metal pipes there for future, that's fine. Let's just quickly finish reading this book since we're so close. Let's dump. Take this granola bar. Wait, still shooting up. We've got a bunch of chips and stuff in our bag, that's fine. I think I'd like to come and check out this little gated community right here. There's a big crowd down here to take care of still. Let's see what we can do about that. Oh, there's a few coming over. Check that hard hat out. You know, any of these zombies have good condition jeans like this. I think we're going to wear because our jeans are a bit bust, I think. Yeah, we'll do that. Is a mold room up. Have we got more incoming? Any more for any more? There's a few in the field, but we'll just get them when we get them. Where did I park my van? Genuinely do not remember. Thought it was somewhere around here. Oh, there it is up there. I see it. Hmm. This might be a few too many to deal with with short blunt. It's quite the crowd. My goodness, that isn't even close to all of them. Well, let's rest. And get rid of the anxiety. Ooh, zombie. Nightstick's nearly broken. Crowbar's looking okay. Yeah, but I know there's more of these guys. We had a crew following us. It's a case of where I lost them. Oh, well, maybe that was everyone. Okay. Well, that's some good work right there. Let's go to the van up here. Ooh, police officer. You might have a nightstick. Sadly not. Right, just give me one of those gas cans. Is this weather ever going to let up? And we're going to go and fill this thing up because, frankly, I want to use this as my main vehicle, I think. A little bit more nimble and a little bit quicker than what we have been using. Well, it's very quick compared to what I have been using. That's the problem. Getting used to dodging things in the road. 
Whoa! The thing just flipped onto its side. I've never seen that before. But there was a couple of cars. Was this the one in good condition? Yeah. Pretty excellent condition. Cars refueled. Gas cans refueled. Good stuff. Hopefully it's not storming tomorrow. This weather's a bit of a drag. a good few of them out there. Yeah, we're at a short blunt three, long blunt four, axe two. I'm holding off on the axes because it's so powerful. It's less important to level it, if that makes sense. I want to collect axes, and I want to enjoy using them at a later date, but I want to kind of grind up other skills as well in the meantime, while, while we can. Sorry about that. Let's equip the good night stick. Nearly back. Just don't want these zombies hanging around if we can help it. Oops, potato seeds we'll take. I right, check that gas can in there. Let's just make it our job today to fill up all the cars with gas. Ooh, a few zombies here. Look at the crowbar. Probably a fight I didn't need to take, but you know, we are tired and everything, but it'd be good if we could just clear them out, you know? No, that was bull. Don't even know what happened there. That's the stuff that annoys me about this game. Well, what is it? Laceration. But it's just like, you feel like you lose control sometimes. Street lights are on. We are, what, 15, nearly 16 days into this, so... I anticipate they'll be going off any day now. Well, do you know, have a look here. Skills. We're at 3,005 XP for fitness. Let's do... Do 30 minutes of sit-ups. 3059. It's going to be a slow thing. But if we do that every day, we can probably do it. Let's sleep. A dirty bandage there. Remove it. And use a sterilized rag. Yeah, we should probably do the exercises to start the day, right? At the start of every day, we'll do half an hour of sit-ups. Drop that. There you go. Rest. I'm going to equip that duffel bag on your back. Give ourselves a quick wash there while we still got the water on as well. It's 2 p.m. Kind of, you know, not enough time to do anything here. Now let's go take care of these zombies by the van. 
gonna go get this van filled up. Then that'll be all four of our vehicles all set up and ready to go. Hello, zombie. I've taken a wrong turn, but we can jump out and take care of you. There we go. That's nice and full now as well. And looks like we've got some friends to take care of here. We never did look inside Pizza World, did we? Ooh, I can see your car key. Yep, it's for this one. Oh, wow. <laughs> Looks like we got another car. We don't need one, but this is in great condition as well, so... You just tell by looking at it. Let's pop the hood. Sensational. making the most of having power at this gas station We've got loads of gas pumps filled up let's uh get these attached yeah these zombies are all migrating to that gunshot noise that we just heard come on i don't know why that one doesn't see me over there that's weird there you go you figured it out clever girl Shot blunt is working out pretty well for us, it's got to be said. Yeah, we don't need that stuff. Well, lighter. We go to take some pepperoni and cheese that we found. Yeah, there's nothing here. Uh, excuse me, zombie. Where did you come from? There we go. Let's get a new car taken. Oh, wow. This car's like not capable of pulling it. That's interesting. Ah, this van's got like no horsepower. That's why. It's actually going to be better to do this the other way around. This has like a fair bit of horsepower, I think. Hello. Yeah, this has 420 horsepower. So hopefully this should pull a little better. I assumed it was going to be the way around. Yeah, look at that. Straight away, much better. I mean, it's not high speed. But we're going to get there. Might have a trail of zombies following us because they're walking about as fast as we're driving. I think that van just ran over a few of them. Unintentionally. I think we are going to have a lot behind us here, because this is so slow. I'm going to get to the bottom of this road and I'll be happy. Right, that's going to have to do. Wow. Quite the welcome home. Look at the crowbar. Ooh, this guy's got a crowbar as well. Woohoo! Oh, man. This is an awful lot of them. Oh, wow, I think they're respawning is what's happening here, because these are all firemen and stuff. One dumb zombie. Man, that's so many. This area's kind of cursed. Right, crowbar man's there. It looks like we've got a few more I want to join in over here. That's fine. Oh man, there's a whole lot more here. Oh! Where are these guys come from? Yeah. 
Yeah, yet again, this is unworkable. It's a little disheartening that this keeps happening right by my base. Come on, just please start. Yes. Right, we're going to have to go and find a quiet place to lay down for the night. We'll see if the original house is... Oh, yeah, it's really respawning over here. That's what's happening. So we're going to have a fight in our hands no matter what we do here. But you'd hope this will be a little less busy than um, the fire station just was. Right, get rid of that anxiety, man. Oh, beautiful. Timing on the streetlight. Yeah, I think a lot of that has to do with peak population. I'm gone. See if we can just pull a few of these guys because we really need them to be gone. If this girl sees us. Okay, we're now exhausted. Kind of to be expected, I think. Ready to sleep. I say, why don't we drop these bags and do our morning workout. We're trying to just slowly level this fitness so uh, we can lose this out of shape trait. So we're doing 30 minutes of sit-ups every day. Followed by some rest. There we go. We go that's our smokes and our fanny pack and then um, duffel bag full of goodness. Uh, food. I like all this meat we could cook up. We could cook up a storm right here. Let's do that. There we go. We just leveled cooking, I think. Good, dead. Look at this. We've got a full steak. Yeah, our weight's going down, actually, so let's eat that steak. A full to burst him. Quick wash. Remove this bandage. Ah, oh, we're all healed. Now the small matter of trying to take back our base yet again. Second time we've been pushed out of that area due to it being overpopulated, but this time I think it respawned. Because respawns off, but peak population is day 28. So we will keep seeing more and more zombies, and some of them were firefighters that have never been in the area before. Interesting. Hopefully we can go and uh, take care of them bit by bit. Kind of just want to take care of anyone I see along the way as well. Guess we'll try a bit of short blimp. Eat that sausage. Hey, level two electrical. When it gets to level three, you can pick up like cookers and stuff, which is great if I decide to you know, move to a different base or something. I don't think there's much value in leveling it beyond that. Ooh. Hello, friends. I see one. I see this girl here. I'm gonna sneak up. Naughty. I'm trying to use the short blunt on the smaller groups. Just so we can keep leveling that. That's going to serve as well. Hey, dummy. Oh. You nasty thing. Whoa. Sneaky zombie from behind. Where did you come from? Here we go. that engine off. Right, eat the bacon. Ooh. How many is that? Enough for the crowbar, I think. Now, these should be attached. Let's detach them. Oh, 
shotgun and pistol. Okay, already we've kind of broken the group down a little bit, I think. But they were just one huge mob yesterday. And that front door's wide open. Not good. Yeah, I can see firefighters in there and stuff. They've broken this door as well. Alright, we're suffering from a slight bit of exhaustion here. Do you mind? Let's go into this room full of chairs. There's no way in from outside. Let's rest. There we go. Well, let's go looking on the back here. There's a guy we need to check over here as well for a crowbar. There it is. That's in decent condition. Cabbage seeds. Ooh, a Henson knife. Rub it. Farming magazine. I'll take it. We're getting tired now. I think I'd like to take care of some of these zombies in the fields, if possible. All right, let's see. I think that's like a girl in a dress and a farmer guy. Tricky thing is we do need to take care of them. Strawberry seeds, tomato seeds, very nice. Second hunting knife right there. Radish. Yeah, I think these groups are far enough away for now. Probably don't need to worry too much. Get these cars parked up. Okay. A lot of stuff I need to take. I first, of course, need to double check that upstairs is safe. There shouldn't be any in these rooms, but I wouldn't put it past the game. Seems to be okay. We've got most of out of this van. Let's fill these two empty cooking pots. There we go. Got the water ready. All right, it's one thirty a.m. Let's sleep. So morning routine. Up this. Up this. Thirty minutes of sit-ups. Rest, touch the duffel bag, and smoke bag, finish off this ham. Put some bottles of water on there, ready to go. I'd like to try and level some short blade today. Never ever used it. It could be a disaster, but I'll give it a go. We've got the crowbar with us. Man, there's a car lot out here. We've got a few zombies up there. Let's take the car around, start moving up. See how this works then. Yeah, it's not too bad. Don't think it'll be great with big, big crowds. But one or two zombies, we should be okay with this. Oh yes, some police have respawned. Chance for night sticks. Come on you, come on. Nicely done. Hey, a nightstick. And a double holster, we'll wear it. We'll throw that revolver down, I guess. Now, we did take a fast learner, so we do learn things slightly quicker than the average bear. So, short blade's already gone up a little bit. 
think I had a window break. Nice. Oh, quite a bit of crowd on here. Yeah, I don't think we're using the knife effectively on these guys. Not bad, not bad. I don't hate it. Let's see if we can get up to that gated community. I don't think it's much of a community. I think it's quite a small place from what I remember. But they were kind of up and behind this courthouse, weren't they? Hmm. Yeah, they're up here. That's where I was contemplating going. Oh, tree. Darn it. Taking such good care of this car as well. Okay, let's park up. Short blades nearly at level one already. Got a crew there, crew up here. Nice one. Oh, another hunting knife. I'm saying, that, I think my hunting knife's broken. So. Switch out to this one here. Beauty. I was saying that, I think that might be my hunting knife stuck in that zombie. I think that's what just happened. There goes short blade. Just leveled maintenance as well. Each house has got tons of zombies in. This one's not even going to have anything in it anyway. Love that animation. Um, yeah, because it's for sale. We might have a few on the way over to us. Nice. Hello. Yeah, that's definitely what happened. But I just got that hunting knife stuck in that zombie as well. Well, if I look through a window here, yeah, nothing in there. Absolutely not worth the time to loot it. Any windows? Ugh! Jeez. Give me my crowbar. Wow, that one properly got me. Can't even get in there either, so. Unless I've got a sledge. Wow, I think I've just pulled all these guys. We got any food? Uh, yeah, we got chips. Right, here they come. Nice. Oh, two high-end cameras to dismantle there. Very good. Well, we might as well finish clearing these guys over here. Take them out.
There's some more beta blockers for us. I'm hoping we get a survivor house up here somewhere. That'd be good. The door's open. All right, here we go. A whole lot more of them behind here. Robot time. We are tired now. Just want to make sure that we've cleared this. At least the outside of this house, you know? Oh, propane tank there, I think. Seems to be clear now. We can come and do this next time. Remove propane tank. All right. That's how you do it. Pretty heavy. Uh -oh. oh man, what of all these zombies out here? They're wearing little eye hats. No! Ooh, that was so close. Where on earth was the party supposed to be? Yeah, like a party hat right there. These guys have all just appeared like this. Really weird. I really didn't need to bring the car today. Just around the corner. Alright, come on then, Zombs. It looks like there is a few over there. That's okay. Hmm, that's more of a problem right there. Have they seen me? Don't think they have. We might get away with it if we just jump in. Oh man, this is what I was scared of. Fuck, this zombie's just spawned in down here. Up more there. Probably want to deal with these. But yeah, I think it means they can still respawn up here, which is exactly what I'm terrified of. Opening a door, absentmindedly, and not expecting a zombie in there. Hey, drop this propane tank. Get to bed. Sleep. We're pretty darn hungry. Open a can of chilli. How's our weight looking? 79 going down. Hmm. We need to try and do something about that, really. Get rid of that anxiety. We've got one bowl of water. Let's fill that up. Uh, while it's still relatively early, let's grab one cooking pot of water here. Right, let's add these beans. All right, so add a can of corn, the carrots. Well, it won't add my tuna. Okay, well, this'll do. Turn this on and wait for this to cook. Turn that off and then this. 75 hunger right here. So we eat half of it now. Yeah, still hasn't done much for our weight, but there we go. What can you do? Got tuna for the protein. And I guess we'll throw this in the fridge. But I've read the farming magazine. Didn't go in the bin. My hunting knife isn't going to last much longer. Hopefully we get another one today. Wow. In a war zone not here. Oh, and there's more that have arrived. Okay. Yeah, definite respawns, I think. Oh, I just realised I haven't done my exercises. Okay, I think it's time to switch. I tried to use the knife, but it was just taking far too long. Nothing in the bag, I don't care then. What are you doing all the way over here, eh? Come on, you filthy zombs. All right, let's go to that gated community around the corner. We found a bunch of zombs. There's quite a few over here as well, to be fair. 
might be worth switching to the crowbar. Nice. Come here, there's Umbrinos. My knife is broken. Throw it out. How's the crowbar? Pretty bad shape, to be fair. We have got another hunter knife here we can use for now. And we have got another crowbar in better condition. Okay. We're okay. Okay, we're in. Make sure there's nobody in the immediate vicinity. Okay. Dismantle the CD player. Oh, wow. Fresh broccoli. Fresh orange. Crazy. We'll maybe use a bit of that in cooking later. Any ice cream? Oh, you know it. And a steak. Let's cook that steak. We will eat the ice cream while the steak is cooking. I know it's not the right order. <laughs> That's how we're going to do it. We got that's one cooked steak. And that's evened our weight out as well. Now we don't need dog food. Grab this stuff. Oh, sugar and sea bags and stuff. Ooh, box of nails and some deck tape. Not bad. I think we do need a sheet. Ooh, a little study area. Very nice. Cooking magazine to read there. Uh, metal working, I cannot remember if we have or not. Same with foraging, same with farming. They're all things that are useful. Let's go upstairs. All right, I think we have a minute here. Drop that duffel bag. Drop that fanny pack. Got to get today's setups in, man. And get the rest. All right, good. Oh, there's another shotgun. Crazy. Oh, painkillers is a good find. Ooh, a baseball bat. I'm here then. And I think it's time we head home. That place is done. All right, I can't see that we were followed. Nice baseball bat there, ready to go. Ah, the broccoli's already stale. I'm going to close that there because I'm often stood here. So hopefully that should block their view. All right, we're good now. Let's get some sleep. And we're awake. Let's do it now before I forget. Duffel bag, fanny pack, both off. Exercise, setups, 30 minutes, go. Rest, equip them back, wear on front, and get rid of that anxiety. Quite the morning routine. I mean, I am noticing the fitness is going up a lot quicker now. So I think this is working. Just going to take a while, that's all. Uh, let's have that soup for breakfast. Good stuff. Let's go. But hopefully no big cleanup job out here today. So far, so good. All right, we're up here now. And so, we're a ton of zombies, by the looks of it. Are you wearing an apron? Yes. Yes, you were. Come on, zombs. Let's be having you. Whoa, that was close. Nice, hence a knife. Still quite a few over here, isn't there? Ooh, did not see all them. Come 
Man, that crowbar's good. You obviously have to get a little bit closer with the short blade. That is generally comfortable, but I'm liking it just fine. Oh, yes, survivor house. Beautiful. If we can do these two houses now, then that should be a beauty right there. Let's not be dumb. Let's go for a walk into the backyard. I think there's a zombie up there. There you are. You must have broken a window up top. Jump down. Cooking pot of water. Well, that's a good start. Grab that. We'll make something quickly. Oh, look at that. Coffee, fruit jam, cereal. That's great stuff right there. Take it all. I don't know if we have a bowl. I'll take one. Right, so this should be pretty filling, this soup. See here? Minus 78 hunger. I'm going to have all of it. There we go. Weight is going up. And we'll take that cooking pot home as well. Ah, it looks like the water's finally gone off. Okay. Let's have a full cooking pot of water. Just because that's going to be needlessly heavy. Right in here. Yeah, there's nothing there I want. Oh, some smokes. Some chips. We're having a party in here. I hear somebody beating a door somewhere. Gotcha. Just making sure. Take another sheet. Take all that junk. Come on, we've got to take the shotgun shells, right? First aid kit. I'll take it. Hmm, I saw a zombie over there. Quite a few there as well. This is the one I saw. These two slackers over here. Well, I don't know, I think it might be a smart play just to... Stir them up in there. Maybe take care of these guys if we can. They should be far enough away. Ice cream. Come back for that. Make sure there's nobody wandering about. Seems to be good. There we go. It's shooting up again. Hey, there's the key for the car outside. Ooh. Not going to lie, that startled me. Nice, it's a level of carpentry. Oh, wow. Another baseball bat. Oh, yeah, magazine, we don't know. All right, it's pretty late now. Ooh, this starts. Yeah, some pretty, pretty great condition. 420 horsepower. And what's our little vehicle up here got again? I know we could leave it here and maybe drive that back tomorrow. Well, this has got 480. This thing's a beast. Nice three-point turn there. Well, if we can do it in one trip, we might as well. We'll just need to take this up to the gas station to gas it. We might even do that tonight. While the power's still on. Wow, this thing's great at towing this police vehicle.
Nice. Yeah, let's take us up the road. Get it filled up. I like to hoard the cars, if I can. Ugh! Jeez. Find a life out of me. Yeah, we seem to be okay. Yeah, we're like very tired, anxious, making sure no one's done here. All right, away we go with a full tank. Nice, quite the collection. Add a sheet to that window as well. well let's have some chips. Get rid of the anxiety. Let's go to bed. Wait, it's shooting up there. What you like to see. We're not doing great in skills here. We probably just need a couple of days in which we um, read all the skill books and stuff. We do need to do our daily workout. So let's drop our bags on the floor here. And we'll do our usual 30 minutes of sit-ups. And rest. It's slow going, but we'll get there. I think we're pretty much ready to go already. We've got bits and bobs on us. We're fine. Water bottles are about to run out, but we can fill these up in the road. Ah, yes, the car lot. There's a couple of zombies straight away. Good deal. I don't see anybody else. Keep going. Ooh, bit of a crowd over here. A lot of a crowd over here as well. Right, we're going to need our long blink game here, I think. Oh, a lighter. Always good. Ooh, this one's got an axe. Very nice. It's a Louisville annotated map. And a pretty good condition axe. We'll take it. There's a few more zombies just there. A few more there. So this is where we're interested in. We just hop over. Um, a zombie. This guy must have swallowed my knife. He did. All right, we're over here. There's a key for this van. Some spare smokes. No gas. Some welding rods. Oh wow, we're actually in. We need to try and clear it first. They must be upstairs, then. That's one down. Okay. Well, that's weird. They've got canned food up in the uh, bathroom here. I think you need a mirror, don't you, to be able to cut your hair and whatever. Anything in these? M14. Oh wow, axe, bad condition. Baseball bat will take. Oh, sledgehammer. Or better off. I think we have a shovel already, right? Alright, point three oh eight rounds, I think, is what we need for the M14. The rest of that stuff I'm happy enough to leave behind. 
Well, hang on. Leather trousers? They're like the best things you can wear, aren't they? Yeah, because they um, give so much bike defense. I've never seen them before. I've heard about them, but I've never seen them in the game. Guess we'll take this volume five. Enter knife and a crafted spear. And do you know we kind of need to grab these sheets as well and make some sheet ropes? And now we've got the sledgehammer, we can actually secure our base, which is nice. We still need to check out downstairs here. Booking volume three, carpentry volume five. Yeah, we'll take a, any and all books. I need to kind of just work out what we have and what we don't at some point. Picking up this TV and I guess the table. Oh, machete. We do need to work on our um, long blade, I think that comes under. Tell you what, watch out to your back. Then we've got a crowbar ready to go in the bag if this breaks. Oh man, so much good stuff. Fresh peach and a fresh grapefruit sounds good to me. Right, and with that we're done. Right, let's go. Ooh. Nearly crushed it, nearly crushed it. I don't see anyone. Right, it's 1.30 a.m. We need to sleep. All right, it's morning. You know what that means. Drop your bags and do some sips. Oh, there's some zombies in the area. Time to try out the machete for the first time. It's pretty powerful. Where do you all come from, eh? If I had like a pile of clothes, could I make some sheet ropes now? That's something that you can do. No, apparently not. I see a zombie. These can both play videotapes, so I'm thinking we can double up some skills at some point. We have a skill day. We just need to find some VHSs first. Uh, this all needs sorting out. Right, before I can demolish these stairs, we need to go get some sheets and craft some sheet ropes. There were some sheets over at that survivor house that we were at yesterday, so we'll go over there. Here's a shotgun. A few coming out of the trees over here. Right up the road and over here. Zombie out there. We have sheet ropes crafted. Remembered about that shotgun there. Pick up these shotguns as well. We'll have to remove the curtains first. Why can't I add a sheet rope to this? Add sheet, close window, climb through, walk to, sit in ground, carpentry, investigate, disassemble. 
I'm getting no option for sheet ropes. I really want to add sheet ropes. Okay, just looking this up online, I might just be missing nails. Oh, that's it, that's going to be really annoying if I can't do this otherwise. Oh, there we go. So it's just me for getting nails, fair enough. I'll stop crying them. There we go. We want escape ropes on every window. We need three more sheets now to cover the windows. Where did I put that sledgehammer? Let's go celebrate by demolishing some stairs. I once had to abandon a save. Well, I didn't have to abandon a save, I could have carried on. But I demolished the stairs from downstairs before I placed the sheet ropes. And I didn't have the required levels of carpentry. And I didn't fancy grinding it out without all my stuff. So I chose to uh, leave it. Now let's just nip in here. Pick up that. Can I pick up this table as well? No, it's too heavy for inventory, it says. There you go. Stick the water dispenser down there. Drop the sledgehammer on the floor. Okay, it's late. Let's go to sleep. 6.50 in the a.m. Usual routine. We're going to do another day because two of these days are going to be quite slow uh, base work and stuff. Do our exercises. Right, we've done some rearranging. We've got these tables out. Might want to move this one so it's here so it's just like all in a row. That could work. we also got this one moved over there. We are thirsty. Let's fill our water bottles. And we're hungry so weight is going down so we can eat some chips and stuff I think. We're getting bored then, so let's go out. We need um, three curtains. Well, there were some zombies down there. I don't know if they're going to follow. Whoa, where'd she come from? One. And two. And three. I think that's all we need. I hear the zombies. We passed on the way up. I'll dismantle your high-end camera. I think I saw someone. Ooh, there's a few someones down there. Okay, what's interesting is this does have an area we could do like a rooftop farm and put a generator and stuff. That's pretty cool. Need to remember, a bit deeper in we need to put a hole in the wall. I believe we left some shotguns. I don't know if it's shotguns or just shotgun shells. We left some stuff over here, either way. Come here you. Yeah, here we go. 0.308, that's the M14, right? Get up there. Grab the nails. There we go. Oh, okay, you cannot walk on that. Noted. That's a bit lame. That's where I was going to put the generator. Guess I'll have to construct my own floor out there then, that's fine. Shouldn't be too much of an issue. Alright, we've got another table here. I've just been um, sorting out all my stuff all day. Taking some time. All right. We have our water set up. We've got our various boxes of ammo there. Shotguns and M14. We've got long blunt, axes, and miscellaneous over here. So that's spears, shovels, sledgehammers. Over here we've got kind of short blunt things. And assorted tools. Like so. And it's pretty late. I'm pretty pleased with how that's gone, to be honest. It's all organised and it's how I want it. Right, let's eat this corned beef and this carrot. And we're good to go. Let's go to sleep. Okay, let's do our daily exercise and then I'll talk to you about our plans today. Right, so while we're resting here... Right, so we have got a generator. We have got the means to hook it up and stuff. I would like to come down here to March Ridge. I think... I want to say it's this right here, or it might be like this. Somewhere around this general area is a VHS store, and I want to loot it. We might spend a couple of days around here, uh, but the main thing I want is the VHS store. And it's only around the corner, so we just go along here and then down. So that's what we're going to do today. 
last episode, we took things a little slower. We've got all our stuff organised here, short blunt and tools, axes, long blunt, miscellaneous, firearms, ammo, water. But yeah, it's been a long time coming, but we're finally sorted. And we took the stairs out and have a sheet rope way in and out now. So that's good. Fill our water bottle. In terms of weapons, we've got... This machete, which is in pretty good condition, this hunting knife's about to die. But we've got more where that came from, that's fine. We've got a backup crowbar and a backup nightstick. That should be fine, I think. In terms of food, we've got chips and chocolate. Maybe we'll take like a couple of cans. Let's open a couple of cans of sardines here. Alright, let's go. We'll take this police truck. Yeah, so I've looked at it, and it seems the easiest way to go is just to the very top over here and check a right, and then we'll get to the crossroads, and then we obviously take a, a right turn again. We're not going to stop for all these zombies unless we see somebody with, like, an axe stuck in them or something. We might stop them. Or a big hiking bag. We haven't got one of those yet. That could be one right there. Mm, no. Whoops. Oh, I'd left enough room to bypass him, but clearly not. Yeah, I'm keeping an eye out for big backpacks as well. Let's have a can of sardines since it's sitting there open. Happy days. Ah, damn it. Whoa. Leave some room, zombies. Leave some room. And they're all going to that gunshot, which is like down there somewhere. There's not many meta events on this road. Gotta be said. Ooh, big, big, big crowd there. Have you got anything of interest? No? No big backpack? Well, what good are you anyway? I tend to have all burnt out cars and stuff here. It's the easiest way around this, do you think? Ooh, loads of police. Chance for nightsticks. Alright, we have got a lot of zombies coming in here. I was hoping I'd gone far enough away. In the words of Smash Mouth, they don't stop coming and they don't stop coming. We're good for a second here. Yeah, machete held out pretty well there. Nice, hen's a knife. There's a key for one of those cars up there. Good quality nightstick. Oh, one nightstick. Better than none, right? Check these shotguns we just picked up in here. Oh wow, another M14. Oh, a police motorcycle helmet. Kind of like that. Unlock that trunk. Hey, more smokes. Another shotgun. Duck the tape. And 308 rounds. Yes, we need to come down here, but we need to take a right turn to get to this road. I know what I mean. Let's get rid of that anxiety. But here's a fun fact. I've never, ever been to March Ridge in playing this game. Have they got anything? Nah. I've never been to Louisville either. I mean, I haven't been playing the game that long. On and off for like a year, but I've never had a playthrough go longer than like 30 days. But this is the one. And I don't like driving at this angle because it's quite hard to see down here. But if you have to swerve or whatever, I find it quite jarring. But I guess we're taking the right turn then. Yeah, I saw a sign for March Ridge there. Means we're on the right track. This should be it. Uh, can I just drive through that? Yeah. No biggie. We're going to have a bit of a fight on our hands here. Uh, ooh, wow, that's a busy neighbourhood. Man, what's the spawn multiplier in this place? Well, there's the church. 
I wonder if there's been another wedding. They all certainly look well dressed, don't they? I think, yeah, I don't want this turn. I want this turn. There's a gas station. Ooh, there's a car wreck. And it's all happening here. I think this is roughly... Yeah, hit vids. Here we go. Oh, man. Okay. Get out of the car. Well, so many. Yeah, this may well be a um, walk them around and lose them situation. Hey, guys. We're all still following here. Right, tons more just came out of that tree. As you can see, quite a few have followed. Now, here's my plan. But they're all on the other side of that now. This should be a lot more manageable. Go on, you can all stop noticing me now. Oh, jeez. But now we're tired. Man, oh man. Found a rhythm eventually. Well, a lot of them got hung up by the car for some reason. It was uh, very good for me. Very, very good for me. There they are, look. And this zombie's been trying to break into that laundromat since we got here. Give it up, girl. Never gonna happen. Jeez, man. There's another hunting knife for the party. But high exertion, I'm very tired. See, we can rest here. We're still moderately exerted even after resting. We might need to come back to this. If I take this car, drive up right against this, I should keep it safe, right? Zombies can't. Yeah. It looks like we're sleeping here. In the middle of a high population city but i just want to delete that video star but i also don't want to be absolutely exhausted try and sleep okay must have done a decent job of clearing this place out eh a big big crowd over there i don't think anybody over there sees me Right, quick sweep. Make sure our water bottles are filled up here. And this will be what? 
that goes through to another place, I guess. Okay, well, do the front first. Oh, uh, there's Woodcraft. Exposure, Survival. The Cook Show. Chasm, that's the one I really want. To get that mechanic skill up. Minus the grinding. Exposure, Survival. Woodcraft. Uh, same chasm we've already got. Got another cook show. Oh, stop giving me episode one of Carzone, man. You need to give me more of the series. Good electrical skill right there. Carzone episode two, finally. Well, I'm just glad we managed to get what we got. Right, what else is in this little area then? Oh, what? We just got a couple of these guys. This way I can work on my long blade. Vitamins! A few more than I would have liked. There's a family medical centre there. Oh, that's more than I wanted. For sure. Come here, girl. Come on. Go at the front. Walk towards me, that's right. Just want to talk to you zombies. Shetty is pretty darn good. Well, we kind of got what we came for. Well, where'd these zombies come from? Yeah, let's get out of here. Stupid zombies. Yeah, so there was the church, so we're going the right way. The car's parked weirdly, isn't it? That one there. Well, this should be the way out then. Man. The plane in the road, zombies. No, I don't go that way. I don't come this way. I come this way and then it's straight up, isn't it? Should be a left turn here. Any second now, here it is. Well, we are. Unpleasantly hot, apparently. I'll put the aircon on. Right, here we go. We've been here before. Let me have a quick look at my map. Yeah, there's a right turn here, which I think goes to some warehouses. I'm trying to see how busy it is over there. We need to get rid of the anxiety. Right here. Look at them, like little ants everywhere. Oh, we're cold now. And the <laughs> this guy can't make his mind up. Uh, there's a big crowd of them around here. Hold all. A little backpack, nothing crazy. Khaki there. Yeah, it's fairly populated. I think this is the next place we're gonna loot. I mean, not today. It's late. I just wanted to get it on my map. We can get some great gear out of that place. Ooh, was that a big backpack I just saw? Stupid zombies. This right here. Yes, it is. Well, I want that. How many have we pulled up here? Is it worth it? Is it worth the effort to get that one backpack? And see the guy right there. The one that's not moved. Oh, and a crowbar as well. Hmm. Get out, get out. Just taking some beta blockers. There's our man.
But he's dead. He's there. So, theoretically, if I can walk these guys away, I can run back and get his body. Just going to take a little patience, that's all. Oh, man. A menu popping have nearly completely killed me. Ooh. Don't want to call these guys over. I think it's time to make a run for it. I seem too bad over here. But where's his body? Seriously, where's his body? Oh, man. I can't find his stupid body now. That's such bull. It's definitely on this little piece of grass. Let's stick this open. Oh, more crowds. This is like totally not fair. It's disappeared. Whatever. What a big waste of time. Let's go. I hope to goodness I review that footage. And I see it and go, oh yeah, it was just me being dumb. I killed him in a completely different area. Then, that's fine. But if that body's just despawned, I'm furious. Because that was just so annoying. When it's something you need, it's always when it's something you need. It's not like, oh, okay, he's got a crowbar. I've got 20 crowbars, but, you know, I'll, I'll come back for that. Guaranteed, I would have found that no problem. The second it's something I need, like, you know, a big backpack. Yeah, that's when it despawns. Sarcastic round of applause goes to you, game. It's just my luck. Enough ranting. Let's drive home. Back to Rosewood. The town where no big backpacks ever spawn. But you know what? I spotted that duffel bag and won it. Keep my VHSs in. In the base. Alright, we're back home. That's all ripped sheets in case you're wondering what that is on the floor there. Yeah, don't see anybody. Nice and quiet over here now. Home sweet home. So just by the TVs over here. We'll put this duffel bag with all our VHSs in. Right, it's pretty dark. Put our drinks up again. Let's go to sleep. Oh, I almost forgot. We need to do our morning exercise. Rest. Get rid of that anxiety. Yeah, we're making a dent into this fitness skill now, which is nice. Little water bottle. Uh, we need this crowbar. We're going to need that crowbar when this machete runs out. It's nearly broken as it is. Well, the weather's kind of lame today. Maybe today might be a good idea to start a farm with it raining and everything. Look, we've got plenty of seeds, so we might as well. Yeah, we've got to come out this way, haven't we? Have a look around. Yeah, it seems quiet enough. I imagine out the back here is going to be the best place. See, that's enough to be getting on with. I like to leave space to stop them uh, spreading diseases and whatever. There we go. Nice big farm. We'll come back and check on this. I don't know, every few days or so. If I remember it's there. <laughs> I might forget all about it. We need to read a farming book as well. Pick the shovel down. Pick the seeds away. This counts towards cooking skill, believe it or not. So that's why I'm putting it in a bowl first. Farming volume one. Let's read it. There we go. Red. We need to read electrical... Volume 2 as well. Looking at this. We'll get started on that. Eat the cereal. Get rid of the anxiety and let's go to sleep. That was a productive day. I want to come back here today, I think. To this um, big warehouse area. Unfinished business up there. Let's do our morning workout. Good stuff. Not resting as long after that anymore. That's nice. Oh, we're finally getting a little bored. Took some time. Fill that water up and let's go back to that warehouse. 
like I said, we've got unfinished business over there. How's this car looking? Engine 88, engine quality 87. That's pretty good, right? It's higher isn't the best. We'll be okay though. Let's go this way. Oh, apparently I have the uh, crowbar equipped. We don't want that. We want the machete. For now, till it breaks. Oh, stupid zombie. Hello. These mannequins could be cool to take so we can put our outfits on them. You know, our winter outfits, summer outfits, whatever. Probably want to clear a bit of a path on the way up there as well if we can. Wow, this thing's like one shot in now. With these smaller crowds, I really should be using my short blimp to try and increase that. Okay, yeah, there's short blade going up. That's nice. Switching over to this hard hat here because the police helm actually has a speed modifier on it of some description. I think that slows me down. Combat speed. Right this way. I had a knife broke. Switching over to another. Got two in axe, five in long blunt, three in short blunt, two in long blade, two in short blade. None in spear, but we will work on that. I want my maintenance to be higher first. And chips. Have some of that. Man, we're not making any progress here. I was gonna try and take out every zombie on the way, but that's just gonna take far too long, isn't it? We'll take out some zombies on the way. Yeah. This should be worth my time over here. Switch to the machete. Vitamins. a crowd I want the crowd to stop yeah I'm just gonna go down towards the place now taking too long to clear everyone on the way unfortunately oh hate doing that oh man I thought I was avoiding them this is why I want them clear stupid zombies here we go all right this is us oh, we need to smoke actually do that. What have you got stuck in your zomb? And a knife? Yes, please. More vitamins. Yeah, this machete is about to break. What a shame. Right, we're back over by the car. I have some chocolate. Here's a crowd over here we should probably take care of.
Beautiful. Small group here by the diner. Darn it. There goes the machete. I know I can repair it, but... I'll miss that durability. Whoa, where did you come from? Man, oh man. Oh, they got some smokes. Yes, can I help? Yeah, I think a noise has just caused a bit of a migration. Uh, we're exhausted anyway now, so... We'll head back, and we'll come back tomorrow and finish this off. Unless there's any way we can stay here. Mm, that's a bit too risky. Stupid zombie. The car's going to be wrecked by the time we uh, finish doing this. Right, this will be our turn then. Oh, sugar. I thought I could make that turn. I'm driving terribly today. Good thing I've got so many cars, eh? It's a lot of crashes I've had today. Run over a lot of zombies. Oh, yeah, we've lost our hood, pretty much. Well, maybe we'll take this car tomorrow. Broken machete. Stick it there for now. Let's open two tins of sardines. Let's have a party about it. Fill your water bottles. Can I read? We can read for an hour. Oh, that'll do. Sleep. 7 a.m. Big book, isn't it? I'm gonna see if I could read it now, but yeah, we'll save that for later. Right, morning routine. Let's do 40 minutes of SERPs since our regularity is getting up there. There we go. Rest. Rest is done. Do you know we could take a shotgun today? The one here in tip top condition. Try that. How many shotgun shells are in a box? I want to know. 24. Probably want all these then, right? Fairly heavy load, it says. Yeah, we're just overweight. Let's just go. Guess we'll take this car. No sense in wrecking another one until we have to. Couple more zombies here. Keep it going. Oh, where are they all coming from? Oh, we need to eat. Darn it. It's so annoying. It's quite hard to judge it sometimes when you're going quick. At this angle that they make you play at. Asymmetrical driving. It's so strange. All I could do there? It's a much longer drive than you think it is. Stupid zombie. Well, here we are. Here we go. Oh, here's the problem. We're going to pull them out of the trees and stuff. Well, they're coming far and wide, aren't they, to see this? What we're doing here is we're just pulling more and more and more zombies from the trees which is kind of not what i want to be doing as you can see they're like little ants all conversing around oh yeah i should be taking beta blocker shouldn't i maybe do that
Hey, reload and leveled. No, run! Jeez. Some zombies just seem to have some sort of invincibility cloak. Twenty-three shells left. Then we're back to melee. More beta blockers. Okay, that's it. Bite to eat. Back to work. Okay. There's like about three or four zombies tied up together there. Man, that was hairy. I didn't have to stay and fight them all. I could have run them through the trees, but it became a point of principle after a while. I don't know where I am even. I think we've earned um, a smoke break, don't you? Now here's a few we seem to have lost. We're going to have to take some precautions here. We're going to have to sit down for a bit. We've still got high exertion no matter what we do, it seems. All right, best I can do is get down to drowsy with high exertion. It's not going to be ideal. Pretty sure I saw a tree move down here. I did. Oh man, there's so many of them still. I think we might be best cutting through the trees a little here. Okay, we made it all the way back. Man, we did some work today. Oh, there's my turn. Reverse. Yeah, we're over here. I think we've earned some rest. And sleep. Make sure it's filled up. Oh yeah, we need to do our daily exercises as well. I've got all sorts of junk in me. We've got those cigarettes right there. We might as well have one. A shotgun. Yeah, last episode we actually went shooting. But right, aiming up to two, reloading up to one and a half. That's pretty nice. Uh, we used all our shotgun shells. I think we did a pretty good job of clearing out around that warehouse. I hope we have anyway. But we're doing 40 minutes of sit-ups now, because our regularity is getting right up there. We need to eat. We also need to rest. Here we are. 11.30, let's uh, take a drive. Fog should start subsiding soon, I think. Man, there's a lot of them around here. Go away. Yeah, the fog's definitely letting up a bit now, which is nice. It means we'll actually be able to see what we're doing over there. We should start seeing the body soon. 
I remember these crawlers. How's that crowbar doing? Doing okay. Right, we probably want to take care of these guys if we can. Not as hard when you're uh, not suffering from complete exhaustion and tiredness and anxiety. Ooh, nearly flipped a car then. All right, here is where we want to be. Oh, it could still be absolutely infested up here for all I know. Probably wise to take a few out right away. Bit by bit is the best strategy. Around here, I'm pretty sure, is where I got a zombie with a large backpack and then the game just despawned it. Unless I'm just missing something. I reviewed the footage and I definitely went back over the area where I got the zombie. One of those things, I guess. Man, this crowbar is powerful now. Come here, girl. Come on. There's a few more over there. Oh, there it is. Large backpack. Thank goodness for that. Uh, drop that out. Gas mask. And go in there. I will eat the beef jerky. We will equip this on our back. All this stuff goes in here. There we go. Much, much better. Yes, that is the whole reason I had a grudge about this place and wanted to clear it out. Come up here and get these guys. I think like day 29 or whatever we're on. I think that's the latest I've ever had a large backpack. We give all this junk to the zombie. I don't want it. I just want the associated skills. Ooh, how best to do this? We can pull a couple. I think that's more than a couple. Oh, maybe not. That's right, come on. No, not all of you. Darn it. All right, well, that was a good few of them. Get rid of the anxiety and pull a few more. Beauty. More smokes. I feel like we're just getting the same three Louisville maps all the time here. Surely there isn't much of Louisville left to discover. That's basically it, isn't it? Hey, there's a car key. For this one. Come on, you lot. Oh, hello. Very nice. Let's check out this one first, since we're right by it. Getting pretty late. No gas. Let's go around the back of the building. Pick up any stragglers. Oh, you're kidding me. Well, we'll be back here tomorrow. We need to get to the car. Yeah, this is why we need to get to the car. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, thank goodness it started. Right, we're out of here. We will uh, reconvene here tomorrow. I was thinking of staying over here tonight, but that alarm stopped any thoughts of that, eh? Oh, unavoidable. Wow, they're coming from a long way, aren't they? This is so far back in the still tracking towards our alarm. Bad news, ma'am. Really don't want to go all the way back. But anywhere between here and there that we can stay the night. Kind of clearing here we could check out. These guys can't all be tracking towards that, surely. It wouldn't travel that far, would it? That's just coincidence, right? Right? What's down here? No, I just looked up on the uh, map thing. There's nothing down here. Waste of time. Hello, zombies. 
Wow. Skidded to avoid the car. Hit the zombie. We're hungry again, you know. Oh, we got that beef jerky. Eat it. We'll probably take care of these guys while we come. There's quite a big crowd right here. Oh, hands and knife. And I like that jacket as well. I'm sick of this being in my way. Let's move it. Good enough. I don't know why I turned my engine off. Oops. Well, yeah, another avoidable collision. Uh, I do kind of want... The mannequins, if I can. Oh, check all that stuff off it. Right, we've got four mannequins. Score! Well, this is a problem. Oof. The place there, I can't really see what I'm doing with them right now, so I think straight to bed. Well, that's another foggy day in paradise. Okay, so. Ah, right, okay, so you got like. You have the things here. And you can put jeans on them, for example. Gas mask. Leather jacket. Very cool. There we go. We have jeans, leather jacket, gas mask, fireman outfit, leather jacket, and police helmet, and a wedding dress. <laughs> Just because it's like a bit of a rare item. I like that. Pretty cool that you can do that. Right, let's have a can of chili. Make sure our water bottles are filled up. In the ground. And read this book while it's all foggy and stuff. Well, it's got to 3 p.m. I have read that electricity book, thankfully. Well, that made me jump for a second then. I suppose that's the drawback, eh? We have metal working. Yeah, I guess just read this. So late in the day, we might as well just write today off and uh, do it tomorrow. Happy days. we just eating, drinking, managing some moodles. Uh, let's quickly do our exercises. We haven't done them today. Let's do 30 minutes. Here we go and sleep. Time for more exercise. And 50. We're in danger of becoming unhappy because we're so bored. I'm feeling a little sad now. I just ate a bunch of beans. Apparently that makes you sad. Clearly this character is not British. Bowl of water. Why do we have a bowl of water? That's weird. Oh, bowl of beans right there. Uncooked. Ah, uh, eat it. Why not? Then we've got three cans of open tuna. That we can have out on the road. Right, let's go back to that mess over there. No longer feeling sad. We won't feel bored as soon as we see a zombie. Right there. Let's go. Why is there so many zombies right there? Well, this rain will be good for our farm, if nothing else. Yeah, again, there's quite a few of them right there. Let's maybe take care of them. Wow. But pedal to the metal then. Yeah, we're getting there now. Careful. I said careful, zombie. Let's just ease our way up here. Get 
Okay, these zombies will have all been stirred up. I'm wondering how bad it is over here. Since they would have been called in that direction. There's a few all down there. What's this? Oh, nothing crazy. Over you come. But while there's only a few, we should really be using our secondary weapons. Also saves in a bit of exertion as well. I'll take like crafted spear. Wow, keys everywhere. Kind of crazy, isn't it? That's for that actually over there. You over there. There's a few over here. Nice. Well, that looks open right there. Yep, one or two zombies in there. Sometimes you just got to take care of business. There isn't much here, to be honest. It's more of a car workshop. Ooh, that denim shirt we should take for one of our outfits. Ooh. Did not see you. Well, they're all over the place, aren't they, out here? See if we can just get in here. A quick rifle through. Propane torch, I guess, is pretty good. Here we go, a couple of cans of pop. Alright, well. This place didn't have too much for us. Wait, I thought I had the key for this car. Was it this car? No? Okay, I don't know. Not important right now. This is what's important right now. I'm trying to deal with this mess. Damn right. We are just slaying with this crowbar. Let's take a walk up. Oh, this is what I was afraid of. This down here. To be honest, that didn't even look like the good place. Oh man, everywhere. What was that? Get your knife. No run. Going on a nice leisurely walk with my zombie friends. Here they all come. Right, run. Close up behind me. Open up in front of me. Well, I figured we might as well. We have high exertion right now. Uh, yeah, it's in pretty good condition. We'll take it. Hopefully those guys are all over there banging on that garage door. We're going to have to duck out again. Getting late and we're exhausted. This level of fitness can't come quick enough. Whoa. What's this one zombie doing here? Quick, quick, quick. Weird. Left my lights on. Have 
quick walk around. Uh, the flourishing. Okay. The garden's doing okay. All this rain. Doing a world of good. These things keep making me jump. Can you put a denim shirt over a wedding dress? Does that work? That ain't that. Yeah, this one needs a shirt anyway. Stick it here. We're hungry. We never did eat those tunas. We'll have them now, shall we? Well, I'll wait to plumb it in again. It's not good. We might need to take a break from trying to clear those warehouses out. We will loot them eventually. Bad time. Weights getting close to underweight again. So, recently, we have been trying to clear out these warehouses up here. We put a good dent into it, but we need to refocus today. We're here, and there are some houses just behind here. I don't think we've ever done these houses here at all. And you never know, there might be a survivor house or something there, but we just need to go over there and get some food. Hopefully it's some stuff with high fat content so we can put some weight on. But first things first, drop those bags and do some exercise. Get yourself a little rest. I'd say we're about, oh yeah, we're a third of the way there. 6,000 out of 18,000, that is a third, isn't it? All right, we're good to go here. Get rid of that anxiety. Let's drive around the corner. This car needs shifting out of the way. There we go. Yeah, so down here. This is where I don't think we've done much looting, if any. I think we have been in this one before. Yeah, there's another water bottle. Might as well grab it. And we'll just grab a ton of canned food if nothing else. Eat those sardines. There's an exposure survival. We'll grab it. A couple of empty buckets. Go on them. We might as well work on our carpentry and stuff here. While we're doing this sort of day to day. Oh nice. It was tough to dismantle. We love it. Tailoring, I don't know if we have that. We'll grab it. Rubber duck, you gotta take it. Wow, I never called this phone. People were obsessed. That one is done. There's no one back here. Smash that window. You stop that Canix Volume 4, eh? Now, where was I? Nothing. Rotten ice cream. Yeah, everything's rotten. Yeah, I don't want to go upstairs. Not worth my time if it's not a survivor house. We're really only here for food. Wow, there's some nice cars here. Some smokes. A tire. Oh, wow. Got all this fun stuff out for us. Does mean likely a party house. It is worth checking every cabinet in these places, actually. Because you can... Find a car key any random place. Hey, more sardines. I really need to craft a uh, rain catcher, don't I? Right, another couple of cars here. I was really hoping for a survivor house somewhere. Oh, it looks like they came out the back of this place already. This is home. That's our farm right there. Let's quickly check on our farm, shall we? Since we're right here. It's well watered, that's about as much as we know. What about this? Cabbages. Okay. Well, we know we've got a way into this one. Propane torch, nice. Walden rod. I think the metal sheet's pretty good, right? Scrap metal, isn't that good? The stuff. Uh, box and nails we'll take. All right, we can make a rain collector barrel at Carpentry 4. Good to know. Cereal. In fact, 
Eat a lot of it. Right, weight is maintaining now. Now we just need it to go up. Stop that rolling pin, because you, don't you need that to make bread or something? Right, we're now running out of space. That's fine, though. Better. Eat it all. I've been thinking about it. Wait, shooting up. That's what we needed. Sarah's completely dead, though, isn't it? More smokes. Oh, here's the key for this one. No gas. I'm not having very good luck with the garages. I'm finding the best stuff there. But we know we got this van here. Oh. Yeah, I saw some movement up there. This car's locked. Boots open with nothing in it. All right. Excuse me, Zomb. We've nearly cleared this town out, it seems. I thought there'd be a few in this neighborhood because I've never done it, but I don't know. They must have moved towards me at some point. Zombie right there. Oh. Someone else somewhere said, oh, wow, quite a few of them in there. Where can I shot up a bit? Walkie talkie. Where did these guys all come from? They must have been in this bathroom here. Quickly dart in here. Nothing in there. Give me that. I think we need to go. We're drowsy and we've got a fairly heavy load. Main thing is our weight is going up significantly. That's what we need. That was the whole purpose of today. Because we couldn't just keep fighting and fighting up there, losing weight and getting skinnier and skinnier to the point where we're underweight again. We needed to make a sensible decision here. Let's drive around the block in case we can scout out any survivor homes or anything. Nope, no such luck. And this was my starting neighborhood, wasn't it? Oh, here's a few zombies. Whoa, where are you guys all been hiding? We should really take care of them. Well, we'll see how we get on with the nightstick. No, because we're tired, it's not going to work. But nothing great. Oh, maybe some smokes there. Not that we need them. A few more over there. It'd be a shame if we left them. Interesting. Unfortunately placed cars right here. I don't know, we might be able to get... No. Attach them. Oh, we've got income in here. Off we go. Key right there on the ground, but it's just for a car that's mostly broken. And we're back. Mission accomplished. Right, it's ever so late. Let's have a bag of chips before bed. And sleep. Okay, well, we've just woken up to the sound of machine gun fire. Must be time to do exercises. Rest it up. Get rid of your anxiety. Eat a can of spaghetti bolognese for the road. Yeah, it waits. We're in the right direction, thank goodness for that. Water. Uh, we could do with filling one of them up. And we're good to go. Okay, don't see anybody out here. Let's get back over to those darn warehouses. Maybe we can loot one today. Whoa! Hold. Where did they come from? Yeah, best take care of them now. Come on. Here come these ones. I feel like there's yeah, there is more of them. I don't know. 
Who do they think they are? Repopulating over here. Well, here's a few more. Nice, never hit a knife. Not stopping for anyone else now, let's go. Those guys were close enough to home where it you know, was worth doing. Right, we're back over here, second home. Wow. I forgot how busy we'd been over here. Okay. Okay, okay. Get out before it gets too much worse. Using the um, short blade and smaller crowds just to Try and level it a little. What's over here? And also, it doesn't take as much exertion as the crowbar. Ooh, this looks interesting up here. I know there's a couple of warehouses in this area. Oh, yeah. I was going to say this one doesn't look as well guarded, but it does. Focus on one thing at a time. We'll come back to the one we've been working towards. Do we need to take care of these guys? A knife. Give me our best condition one. Hey, yeah, nice. Darn it, still carrying around those stupid empty buckets. Good condition hunting knife right there. Well, this is the place that. Yeah. Look at all those zombies on there. This is the place where the alarm went off. That's not what we're here for, really. It's more this place up here that we're interested in. Goodness knows how many are actually in there as well. The problem. Oh, much bigger crowd than I realised. We just need to get in there though. We can just get these ones over. Hello. Hopefully they get a hint now that they come out this way. A few more up there. I'm going to quickly look in these boxes if I can. Oh, he's nowhere near me. But a quick look through. Nails and wood glue rolls good. Oh, I'm going to say I could definitely hear someone. You swine. Watering can. Darn it. Really hoping for some, like, good weapons or something out of that. Absolutely tons of logs, I would tell you what. Another hunter knife. And there's the key. Nice. Oh, there's a shovel. We already have one. A paint torch. Crap metal and metal sheet, I guess, are good. Welding rods and more of this stuff. There's a old muffler here. Take a look up here. Oh, I just got tired, damn it. We're in this place. Oh, crowbar, it's in pretty naff condition. We'll take it though, you never know. How desperate are you going to get? Ooh! I don't know why my alarm keeps going on. Is there a hotkey for that I keep pressing by mistake or something? There's nothing in this place anyway, it's garbage. 
All right, so we've just got the other place to do. We might want to stick around and um, dismantle some storage boxes in the other place because there's a lot we couldn't reach. I can find somewhere safe to park this. I would totally sleep here. Let's see how secluded that diner is down the road here. A couple of zombies there. It's just such a huge pain having to come back all the time when it's so far away. This guy sees us. He's coming over. Watch this place be alarmed now. No, we're okay. Let's make sure it's empty. Perfect. Sleep on this chair. Yeah, so we're currently trying to level our short blade to get it to three to match the short blunt there. Let's quickly do our daily exercises. Let's go. Equip this with our back. Wear this in our front. Have some chips. And rest. Weight's going up at 80, so that's good. Let's fill that empty bottle up. We will get rid of the anxiety and then we'll be good to go. Fighting fit. So we should explain really. We're over near those warehouses we've been clearing out for days and days. I decided to sleep on this chair overnight just to you know, try and get somewhere. Uh, looks like, yeah, we have got a broken hunting knife there, so we need to replenish it with one that's not broken. We'll get the crowbar out for the time being. Ooh, duct tape. We can hear someone. Oh, there's a few over here. Thought I'd try and be clever and take a shortcut. As usual with Zomboid, being clever is not your friend. Beautiful. Short blade's certainly feeling a bit better. I have to be at this angle though, is the only thing. If I'm facing down like this, I really struggle with it. But just such a better way to conserve your stamina. We are hungry again. Right, here's more. There's a few up there as well. I don't see anyone back the other way. Do what we can here. Well, the crowbar had to come to our rescue there for a bit. It's good to have as a backup. Nice. Still a few down here. Right, more chips, I guess. Right, this looks a bit more like a crowbar situation. Unless I can get a couple over at a time, that'd be good. We'll see how he gets on with the hunting knife. I love it when you get a few in a row like that. Come on, Zomb. Give me back my knife. We've got a few more over here. Got them. Yeah, we've got a few more down here. Oh, it looks like a car key over here as well. I'll take it. Right, so I'm guessing it's this taxi right here. Yep. Oh, there's a lighter. Another broken hunting knife for the party. Hmm, there's a lot of zombies over here. All right, probably time to tactically switch to the crowbar. Man, that crowbar's good. Letter opener. No, thank you. And another letter opener. I was hoping it would be another hunting knife. Yeah, I kind of need this area back here to be cleared up somewhat. Ooh, is that a hand axe? 
try that out. It should be a little bit less intensive on the stamina. It's got a decent condition on it as well. Some over there. Hmm. That's way more than I wanted to pull. Alright, hand axe is pretty good. Seems to remember they're not very durable though. Hey, yeah, we can only be happy with that, I think. Right, where on earth did I park? Down here. Well, honestly, we might have done enough there to um, have a proper look through some of these boxes. But you just can't get to some of them. So we drop things on the floor here. Well, there's more propane torches and welding rods right there. A chair right there we can sleep on. Hey, broccoli seeds. Hey, a hand axe. Well, let's try and catch some sleep on this chair over here. Man, oh man, that's a long sleep. Uh, yeah, I'm pretty happy I've checked most of these now. There's another hand axe. I'm happy with what we've got out of this. I'm really hungry though. But I don't think there's anywhere to grab food around here. I saw your zomb. This way, arms. You idiots. So dumb. Oh, I'm right here. Got to do something a bit risky here and run through. No. Darn it. This is annoying. There we go. So open two doors for them. Idiots. Woo. Man, they're everywhere in here. Oh, don't be doing that stupid gunfire. I'm literally only coming in here in the hope that somebody's left some chips or something in a desk for us. I mean, we'll take them. Not what we want, though. More smokes. Bit of mins, that's a good find. Okay, water dispensers have to go down there because there's a zombie on me. Yeah, me back my head and knife girl. Water dispenser in the trunk over here. That's a ton more water for back home. Right, we have got a little bit of food. I think, yeah, we've got chocolate right here. We'll have a bit of that. I think these were offices over here, right? We need to get rid of our anxiety as well, of course. I see some zombies. We slept in there last night. Were they in there the whole time? Jeez. Terrifying. All right, here we go. Come on. Got some pop. Oh, chips, yes. Well, that's the hunger gone. Oh, look at that. Can of oats. Wouldn't be better. Take this stuff as well, I guess. More pop. Rotten, rotten, rotten. Water bottle. Alright, that's us sorted. We've done this over here. Oh, hello. This equipment is hand axe. There's a lot of zombies over here, isn't there? I don't even know where we are here. Man, the attack speed on the axe is nice. Okay, yeah, I know where we are now. Kind of where we want to be, actually, I think. Uh, 
Uh, some zombies breaking out of there, that's fine. Oh, wow. Did not know they were all there. What you doing, zombie girl? And fork. What good are you anyway? Come on, back out this way, zomb. Well, this is kind of what we're here for. Oh, look at that. Yes. Beautiful find. Exactly the sort of thing we want. Another hand axe. Have we got a pipe wrench? Don't know that we have. Holy propane torches. Save seeds. Fill our water bottle. Let's get out of here. I think we're done with this area now. Got as much as I want to get out of it. We might come back again, but I think it's good enough for now. We need to get back to our base. Yeah, I thought I saw a zombie. We grab everything there, apart from the water dispenser for now. All right, just coming back out for this thing. Water dispenser. Oh, don't forget about it. I've also dumped these buckets here for now. Not that you can see very well. And there it is. Lovely. There we go. Hunger's gone. Let's go to sleep. So last episode, I think I just ended up, yeah, dumping a load of stuff here because it was so dark, I couldn't see anything. Uh, let's have a bit of a inspection of our gear here. This crowbar's not going to last too much longer. We've got another one here. We've got some hunting knives. We've nearly hit level three in axes. We've almost hit level three in short blade as well. How are these crowbars? Uh, they're not great either. Oh, this will be fine for today. And I need to arrange these and sort them out at some point. Fill up our water bottle there. Right, do you just want to have a quick look around the corner? See how these crops are getting on. Uh, young potatoes, okay. Young cabbages. Okay, so nothing's quite ready. Young tomato, okay. No worries. I just didn't want to uh, miss the boat and them, you know? Let's quickly check the condition of this police car of ours. Yeah, the hood's gone. Engine's still in pretty good condition, so we can still drive it. We'll just run it into the ground and then start up with another car. Right, today, we haven't actually visited these houses over here. Or this school. So that's what we're going to do today. Oh, hello. What are you doing there? Well, there's some of them in the tree still, I see. Let's throw that leather jacket out in case we need it later. Let's shout. If there's zombies in those trees, I want them out. I think it was just him. We're going on a little adventure down here. There's some zombies. Quite a few in the trees over here. We've definitely never been over here, have we? Wow, it's a lot of zombies to be contending with. Looking okay behind now? Good.
My, oh my. It was hard work. Camera. We've run them all the way back to the base here, which is ideal because I do need some food. Meat cleaver. All right, let's have some food. How's our weight? 80 and going down. Okay. We have high exertion, so we will rest it off. All right, 4 p.m. now. All right, so now we just need to walk back and just check these bodies quickly on the way. We cleared out a good few of them over there, though, didn't we? Little bag right there. Oh, a nightstick. Gimme. Another shotgun. Throw it out. We'll pick it up later. Uh, I don't know what this zombie's doing over here. Another camera. Come here, girl. Come on. She missed a party. Yeah, we certainly did some work over here. Time to do some more. Okay, well we leveled short blade finally. Up to three in that, that's nice. Another nice stick. Click that gun out. Do a quick walk around this building. That's why. Oh, hello, zombies. What the zombie pile we built up over here? Well, well let's loot this one. Oh, alarm. Okay, well, that's not the end of the world, actually. Might be an idea just to kind of ditch this area and come back tomorrow. Uh, where did you come from, zombie? Yeah. I have ditched my car over there, but that's fine. Not a big deal. You know, one thing I do want to do is build a floor over here. Let's see if we can do that. Let's grab these logs. Just darn it, I want to get my stuff sorted up here. I want a generator and whatever. Uh, let's drop these logs. Sort all the logs. Drop some nails. Yeah, I can't actually see it, but I know it's there because I can stand on it now and I couldn't stand on this stuff before. Now let's pick these planks up. Okay, I think that's fine for now. Let's see this tuna. Let's drop this backpack. I'm going to do our exercises now because I forgot to do it earlier. Sit-ups. We'll just do 30 minutes. Go. We'll do them first thing in the morning, so there's no point putting them back on. Let's sleep now. 6 a.m. start. Sit-ups, go. Rest. Grip us on our back. And wear the snuff run. If you're interested, our fitness level is 7,634 on the way to 18,000 for that level. And then we should no longer be unfit. Fill our water bottles up. Mmm, a can of potatoes for breakfast. What could be better? Well, these uh, skills are coming on nicely. So we could do with um, using an axe a bit today, actually. So we can get that leveled up. Let's grab a good condition one. Yeah, we've got a backup crowbar there. If all goes awry, we've got night sticks, we've got hunting knives. Now, I did see a zombie down here last night. Yeah, there she is. You get out of here. Okay. I'm going to take this generator. Take a gas can. Here we go. Generator's there. Add fuel. Connect it. Turn it on. Alright. Look at this. Yep, the ovens are working again as well. Empty gas can can go there. Alright, so that means we can cook and stuff. Don't see the point of having it on right now. But I do see more zombies over here. I think a few of them followed me up. After that alarm. Alright, we seem to be good otherwise. Let's make our way downtown. Hello, zombs. Animal print bra and underpants. Very classy. Oh, hello. Right, this is the area that's going to be crawling. All right, another hunting knife bites the dust.
Got some more coming over from that house. That's going to be a pain to clear. Man, look at these guys. So many. Beauty. Spear with screwdriver. We'll take it. Man, look at that donna. Yeah, that's probably too many. Man, the axe is so much fun. It's hard not to just use that, but I want to be wary of just relying too much on axes this time. Which is why I'm leveling everything. The knife's honestly pretty good though. This is where my impatience comes back to bite me. Hopefully not literally. Surprisingly large amount of zombies down in this little area. You know, this part of the map. Oh, there's that exertion. What are you doing, you idiot? Another hunting knife gone. Running out of them. See if we can't rest up here. Right, rest. Here we go. Eat that fruit cocktail. Eat that pineapple. Well, after all that, this house had nothing. We are drowsy now as well. But hopefully we've done, you know, the bulk of our work here now. One would hope. There's no point going for that for sale one. Never anything in them. Where are you going? Running away? I see some trees over here moving. And where did you come from, Ponytail? There's my car. Girl, what are you doing? Did she have a... Yes, she did have a digital watch. Oh, we've got some sheds to break into as well. That was good. That's locked. Hey, carpentry leveled. Hey, there's a car key. No gas. Quick look through in here. We'll take the, like the tape and wood glue. Right, back home. Put some work in over here. I think I saw some zombies coming out of the trees. There you go. Could do without them following us back to the base, so. Want to take care of them now? Why not? Cool, let's go to bed. Oh, it's so much nicer when we can see what we're doing. Let's grab one of these cooking pots that's filled with water. Uh, let's cook something. Uh, we'll use dried black beans. One of those cubes, stock cubes. Show sure, we'll a bit of tomato paste. Split peas. Black beans. And can we add anything else? Like if we opened a can of corn? Yeah, can of corn right there. There we go. That should be quite a lot of goodness for us right there. Let's throw this in the oven. Turn it on. Here we go. That's 72 hunger. Okay, let's drink half of it now, and we'll have to have a half later. Throw it in here. And we might as well leave the generator on all the time now. One of these wasn't quite full. 
Grab this one and fill it up. Fill our water bottle. There we go. All as I like it. Get the light turned on there. And it's strange because I put water and everywhere here so it should be okay. I might turn it off while we're away. Just for now. But I do need it on all the time soon because I want to freeze my vegetables from my garden. Speaking of, see how they're getting on. Ooh. Darn it. You scared me. Right, these are looking good. These are ready for harvest cabbages. We want them to be seed bearing, I think. And we want it to say seed bearing cabbages. So we're nearly done. Probably another day or two. Uh, this axe is still in pretty good condition. We're fine. Although, if we've got an axe on our back, you'd really have a nice stick on the belt right. Yeah, good spread of weapons there. Good. Let's go. We're going just down the road to the um, neighborhood we haven't looted yet. There's a lot of zombies we killed last episode. A lot. Down zombies. Hey, I was at this house last episode. Where'd these guys all come from? That's a damn thing. I feel like I've lost a couple of zombies somewhere here. Yeah, nothing in there at all. Quickly check this box. Yeah. They never leave anything behind these people. Right, so we should probably take care of these garden dwellers. Woo! Stack them up. Where are you going, guy? I saw a zombie in there a second ago. Where's it gone? Right there. Right? I hear you. Oh, you're right there. Man, this house feels ropey. Oh, a disc. But uh, we should definitely take that. And the margarine. Take away any canned food we can get hold of. Oh, yeah, this stuff's all good right here. Well, so this house was full by the looks of it. We might need these hinges and stuff. Yeah, this house seems like it was crawling with them. The alarm that we set off the other episode called them all out. Sleeping tablets. I can't remember if we have any. All right, that's done. Oh, this is the one that's down like a big dirt road, right? Two mailboxes, two houses down there. Well, I might take the car, honestly. From memory, it can get quite busy down here, though. We'll do this one first. Enter knife. Good stuff. Go walk around. I like these um kind of French windows they got here. French doors. Well, black dress girl was pretty tough. Took a lot more shots than all the others. I do like this. Oh, it's not even openable properly. It acts as if it's a window. Oh, hello. And just scary dudes coming out of the woods. Big garage there. Ooh, somebody in there. Vitamins. Oh, is that bag full? My, oh my. Right, so where's the garage? Shut up. A little bit of duct tape. It's a bad denim shirt right there. We have to grab that stuff. Marshmallows? Come here. Love that corned beef. We're a bit lighter now. Now down to this one. Ooh. 
Isn't this fancy? A zombie right there. Seems strangely quiet just here. We don't need any more empty gas cans. Yes, I'll take the nails. That's it. Yeah, not much going on with that. I see a zombie right there. I think they were here, were they? Yes, indeed. Come on. More nails. Yeah, we don't need any of that stuff right now. Nice. Brand new crowbar. Perfect condition. Crowbar's been carrying us. Carrots and tuna. Yeah, that's decent stuff there. We are going to start cooking more now we have the generator. Knitting needles. Never seen them in the game before. Hmm. Just spotted something. Big old propane tank. Let's just drive home. It's late enough. I don't think I did my exercises this morning, so we need to do them when I get back as well. We are still working on our fitness here. We hit 8,000 now, just 10,000 more to go. I'm just to take a drive up here just to see. Get a bit of a spoiler. What's ahead? Mm, nothing mind-blowing. Once we've done the high school and these houses, we've finished this area. Nothing more to do. A quick glance around. Can't see that we've been spotted. I've just managed to reduce the large backpack from carrying 20 worth of things to 10 because there's a lot of duplication there that we didn't need. Uh, let's just go into here and grab our soup. We'll eat the rest of this. We'll drink it as it says there. Now we can sleep. Hmm. I love waking up to the sound of gunshots. Not. Let's drop these and do our exercises today because since I completely forgot to do them yesterday. There we go. Rest. Right, we should be good to go now. Turn this on. Grab a cooking pot. Well, let's get cooking. Okay, so I've opened all these tins of food here, so let's just... Let's add the can of peas. The can of potatoes. The canned carrots. The canned corn. The canned tomato. Add some kidney beans. Let's add a stock cube. Some salt. Let's cook it. There we got it. So that's 109. Of half of that. Put the other half away in here. The cooking pot can go here to be collecting water. Let's check our farm quickly. Namely these things. Uh, ready for harvest still. So we still want them to say seed bearing, don't we? Back to it. Whoa, a lot of zombies right there. Where's my hunting knife? I must have reattached it after the last one broke. Oh, nice, another hunting knife. Man, we've done some work over here. Look at this, it's crazy. Saw a guy come in. Right, done, done, done. So, whatever's next up here. We certainly haven't been around this way. Good stuff. There's one lone zombie all the way up here. Okay, it doesn't look like a too much of a busy neighbourhood. Let's get behind this house and we'll work our way up. Take a hike, bozo. I think that's a line from Terminator 2. Right, let's get the axe out. 
Wow, a checkerboard. I've never seen this before. Drop that. It's got to be like a decorative piece, right? You know what? We need to read a carpentry book. Zombie was not expecting that. Pretty disappointing house, that one. Basically nothing of worth. I see a pink shirt guy up there. A few up there, but that's fine. Sewing kit, eh? I think they're useful. Volume 4 cooking, I doubt we have that. More canned goodness. Some dried split peas and chocolate. Bunch of rotten junk. This mantle that CD player. Here, detect the tape. Oh, we'll take that umbrella. Random zombie walking up the fence over there. Don't know where they came from. Don't know where they're going to. They're still walking. We probably want to take care of these guys in the yard over here. What's this? We can put up water. Ideal. Give me that. It doesn't make much sense that you can put that in your backpack without it spilling, but hey, we'll suspend our disbelief. Cereal, eat it. Never have the jerky. And the chips. No, it's still not going up. Crazy. Now we'll grab that beer bottle. And we'll grab some pepper. Volume 5 tailoring. I feel like volume 5 is quite hard to come by. Ugh. Ugh. Girl, you frightened the life out of me. Ooh, look at all this. Beer and chips. Ooh, the tree's moving. Whoa, there you go. Where do you come from? Right, some more houses to get. We've got a burnt out one here. Come here, girl. Oh, look at them all. We're on the back. Whoa, random firefighter. Oh, yeah. We're supposed to house is on fire. That's pretty awesome. That they uh, have that level of detail. Game always surprises me. Whoa. Chill out there. Yeah. Whoa. I honestly don't know where they're coming from. I'm just dealing with them as best I can. Alright, quite the crowd. Dealt with them all, with the knife as well, which is pretty cool. Empty cooking pot, we like them. Nothing else. Okay, well we can go over that way next time. Probably time to head back. Oh, there's a zomb. Gotcha. Ah, it's nice coming back to a bright kitchen. We can put a water here. Nice, look at that. A little checkerboard. A couple of chess pieces on there as well. Right, what do we need? Carpentry volume three, I think. Yeah, for five and six. There's my soup. Drink it all. Wait, still not going up. Uh, we won't have time to read tonight, but we will do our exercises to make up for the fact we didn't do them the other day. Take that on. Here we go. Exercise done. We've got to take this stuff off, so I just ended up being very encumbered doing it, but that's fine. Let's sleep. Now, what Pete likes to do at the start of every day is some exercise because he's still out of shape and he will remain out of shape until we can kick this up to the next level. Only 10,000 more XP to go. Let's do it. 40 minutes of sit ups. Let's go. Rest. Our axe is in good condition still. That's good. All right. Take a walk over to our generator. Fuel 68, condition 100. Fine for now then. Give me one of my cooking pots. And let's make today's monstrosity. Right, let's add beef jerky to this. Split peas. Kidney beans. Open various tins of tomatoes and corn and carrots and stuff. Hey, I think we just leveled cooking. 
All right. Are you in here? Yeah, we need to read another cooking book and another carpentry book. Good stuff. I will eat half of it now. Which was 83 hunger, by the way. Good deal. Stick the other half in the fridge. Looks like we're getting a little bored. We do need to have a day of reading and stuff, though. So let's get Cars on episode one here. And let's get, I don't know, let's get Woodcraft episode one as well. Try. I've never done this before. I've never tried to min-max like this. So Cars on goes in here. Woodcroft goes in here. Turn on play. And read. Okay, nice. Carpentry is red. So we're back to getting boosted on that now. It's nice. Let's take the other half of this. Let's drop in more cooking pots and stuff outside. Waiting for the rain to do its thing. All right, let's go back to bed. We'll quickly do our exercises and then we'll uh, head out and do something. Um, I think I've got a random can of corn on me. Yep, yeah, let's just eat that. And it's about time we deleted this stuff in this bin. There we are. Good stuff. Well, we of course now have level 2 mechanics because we watched Car Zone finally. All of which means we can now hotwire cars, should we want to. I'm going to have a quick look at the farm here. Right, young potatoes. Right, ready for harvest cabbages is what it says. I think we got to wait for seed bearing. So yeah, these are going to be a little while longer, that's fine. You know what we do need to do? We need to set up a generator up at the gas station. We'll just take this van since it's in that already. Drop this gas can as well. And we'll be on our way. Yeah, this van's kind of a piece of junk. Got no power. It's a backup. So we should really take the police car, shouldn't we? That need refilling. All these other ones I'm pretty sure are full. Yeah, let's do that. Take generator. Right, that's in the police car, because yeah, we're down to about halfway gas on this. Just realised I haven't brought a gas can with me, but I can siphon it from this, that's no problem. Because we can immediately refill it anyway. This is not the gas station. This should be the gas station, right? Yes. Ooh, some zombies in the area. Alright. Have some of that zomb. Goth girl up there with a leather jacket. We've got Farmer Boy. Cabbage seeds, win. Ooh, those military boots are in good condition. Take them off. And mine is slightly worn. Got some more than just him. Yeah, right down here. Come on, zomb. Ooh, stuck in its head. Nasty. Now, I did wonder about this. Oh, never zombie appear. Oh, okay, so if I can back over Wild and Mask and Propane Torch, I can get into this. I wonder what they're hiding in there. Where'd I drop you? We have got a gas can. Perfect. Get the cars filled up. Three gas cans filled up. There we go. Gas station set up. And while we're up this end of town, there's a couple of places I never did go and see. They could be crawling with zombies. I think they're behind here. No, no, they're back here. Okay. Well, to be honest, we've never looked at these places either. I don't know what you can expect to find in these places. Right, gas cans are in the car. I see you. Over there. Yeah, nice try, girl. Well, it's great for the carpentry skill, this place. Let's do a bed disassembly montage. Anxiety, go away a break. Hey, there's a level. Carpentry 5, not bad. Whoa. I just swung out of habit there. Did not actually expect a zombie to be in there. 
She <laughs> that made me jump. That's why it's good practice to always swing when you open the door, eh? But not much here. Well, we got a level in carpentry and we got a huge jump scare. What more do you want? Get these chips. Yeah, so back here is like an area we've never been to. Oh, wow. Nice looking truck there. A kitchen knife. Benton knife. That's more like it. Well, here's a key of some description for this car right here. And no gas. Doesn't look to be in great condition either. Nothing. Right, so just along here, yeah, like a bail bonds place. Some sort of tavern or something. Let's get the axe. Oh, that place is alarmed. Well, it'll be interesting to see how much attention that draws in, to be honest. The area feels pretty dead now. Hello. Where do you come from? Yeah, it hasn't pulled, like, zombies from miles and miles away, has it? Oh, nice. Some, uh, some rainfall. Fill up our cooking pots and, uh, look after our farm a bit. Right, there's a few more trickling in now. Well, definitely a few more. Wow, they were just on a bit of a satellite delay, were they? Excuse me, zombs. Don't know why they're hanging around my car. That's not cool. Right, please start, please start, please start. Man, I did not want to start. All right, see you later, losers. Yeah, it's kind of cool the way they all kind of creep in slowly over time. It's amazing how far that alarm sound travels, really. There's some in the uh, fields here as well. This area's been stirred up a little. We'll try and take care of what's on our doorstep here. Yeah, you're attracted to that generator, aren't you? Come on, that's a fair few over there. Ah, oh, we're too tired, really, to be taking them on. Yeah, they're not following, that's fine. Give me two gas cans. They're filling up nicely. There we go, generator now has 100% fuel, and it's conditioned still 100%. We'll leave it on all the time. It's nice to have a light in the base. Let's have some lovely cold canned vegetable soup. Oh, let's go to bed. Good stuff. We're going to do an extra day here because the first day was obviously just reading. Not very interesting. Let's get our sit-ups in. Now we are going to have to be careful jumping out of this window in a minute. Because there are a few zombies in the area and they are going to be attracted to, you know, the sound of the generator. Let's eat this fruit jam. <laughs> Why not? Give this puts weight on. Oh, it evens us out. That's good. Oh yes, that's good rain. Yeah, nice full cooking pots. Okay. What do you think you're doing? There's a few down there, a few over there. Okay. Still gradually leveling our um, short blade. All right, looking good. Show me my cabbages. Check these first. Still young potatoes. Still ready for harvest cabbages. They're not seed barren yet. Okay. I swear I just heard a zombie. I know, right? In this game, I must be mistaken. Well, let's go have some fun up yonder by the bail bonds. Ooh, that alarm has shifted them about a bit. There's only so many more times it can happen, though. There's only so many zombies they can send to me in this area. How do you like my hunting knife? They're big fans, clearly. Right, I can't remember the way exactly. Will it be the left of... Look at all these windows in the bank that have been broken. 
That must have been crawling with zombies that place. Go along here, right? No. Maybe. It's the um, other side of this, isn't it? Let's take care of these. Yeah, just around here. It might be an idea to not just go charging in there. That girl had vitamins. Hey! Electrical 3, we can now pick up appliances and stuff. Pretty good. This whole area is going to be pretty compromised. Oh, hello, hold all. Nothing in it. Man, this place has been smashed up. Oh, yeah, there's a few I ran over, wasn't there? Have some of that. Oh, we seem to have lost a few. There's a lot more than this. Just walking around the buildings, making double sure. Now, this was the place that actually had the alarm. So there could be a few of them that have gone inside. Potentially. Ooh, hello. Let's switch to the axe. It's getting a bit hairy. All right. More vitamins. A man, was that really just a bread knife? Got excited and thought maybe it was a machete. All right, quick anxiety, go away, a break. Here's a good few of them. But you can brum. Any more for any more. Yeah, there's some in there as well, like we thought. Another hunting knife bites the dust. Seems to be pretty cleared out now. Have a quick snack. One zomp. I saw you. Where on earth did you break out of? Right, run him. Lunch bag. Has a granola bar. And a shortbread cookie. Bourbon and stuff here. Take a couple of bottles of bourbon and we'll bother with the rest of it, I don't think. Here's some peanuts. Some smokes. Some pop. Good stuff. Yeah, some darts there. Some more beer. Pool balls. Okay. Bail Bond's place. Don't know if we can expect to find anything here. Ah, oh, man. That would have been the thing. Hot sauce. We're fast running out of places to go in Rosewood. Been almost everywhere now. We have been um, alive for one month, 12 days, so. Not a bad run so far. Oh, hello, Zom. Wow, that's where they all went. I knew there was a 10 more of them. We put our axe to use. A few of them have seen me. This is why I've been resisting the axe, because it's so powerful that I might as well level some other things just to make them at least feel useful because, you know, axes run out. There's not so many of them in the world. They're quite rare compared to other things. What's an axe for? So nice. I might just give a little shout. I thought I saw a zombie down here. Alright, I think we've um, re-controlled the area. Yeah, once we've harvested this farm, we might well relocate to Moldra. Let's get the axe. We've got some fools in the field to take care of. Ooh, big crowd over there.
Oh, nice. This one brought me another Firex. Thank you kindly. That's the problem over there. Look at that. Huge crowd. Think about taking an entire bottle of vitamins here. Okay, we're no longer tired. I'm hopeful this means we can deal with these guys. That's a big crowd to have near the base. Ah, just another kitchen knife. Come on, Rick Grimes. I'll take your nightstick. Grab those cooking pots. Okay, turn you on. And turn you on. They're tainted. That's not tainted anymore. Good. Same here. Lots of cooking pots ready for lots of cooking. Have a bit of that. Canned chilli goodness. Well, this axe is about to break. Place that on the table. And this one that we just got from that zombie will stick on our back. Uh, condition on the generator, 99%. It's fine. But we might do some more exercise just to get a bit exerted so we can sleep. Those vitamins did a good job, but almost too good a job. A full hour of syrups. There it is. Drowsy, excessive exhaustion or whatever the hell it said. Hey, we just hit 9,000. Halfway there to uh, not being out of shape anymore. Let's sleep. Let's do our morning exercises and we'll get moving here. Get our rest in. Get our bags back on. Good to go. But how's our inventory looking? Not bad. Haven't got many hunting knives. Spare crowbar. Fire axe in good condition. All right. Now we're a little hungry by the look of this. Let's grab a cooking pot filled with water. Let's get cooking. We'll add the chili, the canned tomato, canned beans. Stick some split peas in there, sure, why not? Stick some more of them in. Bit of salt, bit of tomato paste. Getting all fancy up with this. And then uh, let's stick it in the oven. Chuck away these cans. Get our water bottles all topped off. Good stuff. 93 hunger. Eat all of it. Did nothing, but we are full. Right, let's get outside. Drop that cooking pot. Oh, seed bearing cabbages. Has it finally happened? Are they all seed bearing? Yes. Okay, what about these? My potatoes are not grown. So it's just the cabbages, but we can harvest them. Let's do it. All right, there we go. One and a half levels of farming, I think, from that as well. We've got 48 cabbages and 144 cabbage seeds. Don't think I have any way to... Yeah, I can only do it with my hands. I'll have to dig more furrows at a later date. We can bungle these cabbages in the freezer. That's a beautiful thing. Just grabbing a garbage bag here. I'm just getting all my gardening stuff into a garbage bag here. And just so I can see it, we'll drop this right here. That's got all my seeds in, ready to go. Should probably bring a shovel down as well for that very reason. There we go. Shovel and seeds right there. A random doorknob in my bag, throw that in here. Now what do we want to do with the rest of the day? It's kind of late now. Maybe head around the corner to some of those houses that we were looking at previously. Could be an idea. Man, it's messy here. So many zombies. Hello. Yeah, we need to follow this all the way around. We got some more friends over here. Cool, another hunting knife. Because they do not last long. As we just witnessed. Yeah, it's gonna help you. Take that stupid zombies.
Ooh. Where do all these friends come from? Ah, stupid kitchen knife. Oh, is a darn kitchen knife. Another crowd up the road here. Oh, alarm. That's not good. This isn't that far from where we live. Well, here's where we haven't been yet, anyway. We'll see, I guess, if um, the alarm really affects us over here. You're kidding me. Two in a row? <laughs> I've literally never had to happen before. Okay, well, let's shut up now. Now, what else is going to have an alarm? Not as bad over here. Ooh, crowbar. It's never a broken hunting knife. If I can quickly grab one, I will. Yes, nice quality crowbar. Go on then. Yeah, should be a few on the back here. Called in by the alarm as well. Yeah, we've still got a few like milling about in the trees and stuff over here. What's the bet in this alarmed house won't even have anything in it? We might need that actually. I'm not too bothered about leveling electrical anymore. Because we've got the one that means we can pick up appliances if we want to in future. Farming volume 2, we might need that. Oh, perfect quality leather jacket is a good thing to take. As is duct tape. Oh, we've already got all that stuff. Ooh, we can see somebody outside by the shed. Excuse me. We're looking for me. Some good can stuff right there. There's a few zombies on here to take care of. We are pretty tired, but hopefully we can take care of them. Let's eat something, actually. Eat that kind of corned beef. Beautiful. Oh, hello. Creepy lady coming out of the trees. Yeah, this is that burnt house that turns the zombies out of last time. Zombies just love hanging around here. Right, let's go. Where did you come from? I cleared this out ages ago. Well, hello. What are you two doing here? Uh oh. Yeah, there's a crowd. Kind of what I was scared of. Oh, do the worst parking job ever. Yeah, some more over here as well. Ben show losers. Definitely saw some walking up behind as well. Ooh, hunting knife. Carrot seeds. Okay, we otherwise seem to be okay. 98% condition, 77% fuel. It's fine for now then. How will this mannequin look with a leather jacket on? Pretty cool, pretty cool. <laughs> I think it's deleted the wedding dress. Oh well, I was never going to wear it anyway, it was more a decoration piece. I'll stick the leather jacket back on there then. We will need that in the future. Very tired, let's go to bed. Nine AM, not bad. Time to feel the burn. Grab a cooking pot of water and do some more cooking. Oh, there's the wedding dress. Can go back on, okay. Grab a cabbage. 
So I don't know if it's because they're frozen I can't do anything with them. There we go. Now they're fresh. There we go. They go beef and vegetable stew. Mainly cabbage and tomato. Let's cook that up. Good. Wait, still going down. Right, they don't eat half of that this time. Should make it last a little longer. Right, let's go put the wedding dress back on the uh, mannequin over here. <laughs> the weirdest sentence ever, but there we go. And the leather jacket. I'm very tidily go on the floor. Right, I see more zombies. More firefighters. Where have they been hiding them? These military boots, we probably want to wear these. We'll keep ours, but... Straight away with the zombie. You can see a few just dotted around the field and stuff. Oh, goodness. There's a big crowd right here. Time to get the axe. Oh, man. Well, we might want to take a beta blocker here, honestly. Come on, we might as well collect you as well. All right. Come on, gang. Make sure there's no one behind me. Let's go. I was not expecting that many so close to home. I'll take your strawberry seeds. Right, it seems clear again. Right, I don't know what I need to really use metalwork in. I'm going to bring a welding mask, a welding rod, and a full propane torch. Or two. Right, we're going to go check out the house with the alarm quickly since we've lost a lot of this day thanks to big crowds of zombies and fields where are you all going where are you migrating to well there's quite a few in the trees over here still oh, i'll take a night stick and I'll drop you in nine mils out on the ground in case I ever want them. Where did you guys come from? Right, just you go. All right then. Another hunting knife bites the dust. Ugh. Hang on a second. Spear with scissors. All right. Yeah, you have the broken hunting knife then. Just trying to level short blade here, people. Shout these guys over. Well, here's where the alarm was, right? Yes, indeed, I would say so. Man, that axe is good. That alarm really didn't call too many over. Some can things. Yeah, the house really was not worth alarming. No vehicles in this car park? Well, that was a quick walk on the block. Nothing much going on. Nip and appear quickly. A few friends over here. Right, I'm just taking a load of vitamins right now. Because it looks like I've got a much bigger fight in my hand than I was anticipating. Now we're not tired. Let's give this a go. There's a few over there we shouldn't have to be concerned about. Well, there's quite a few in the trees over here. Shut them over. I want this dealt with. In the meantime, 
Give me some light over here. Right, that door's open. It's just bathrooms, isn't it? After all that curiosity, it's just bathrooms. Let's go. Right, get up here. Eat the other half of this soup, why not? Drop this on the floor so we don't forget to throw it outside. Let's get some sleep. We are currently trying to work on our fitness skill here. Over halfway there. A long way to go still. But we're working on it. Rome wasn't built in a day. And a level of fitness wasn't gained in a month. So let's uh, exercise. Sit-ups and we're doing 40 minutes worth. And then we're resting. And then we put the back pack on our back. Obviously. And this on our front. This just carries our smokes in case you wondered. So let's try cook something up here. Let's grab a cooking pot. Just the one. And we've got three fresh cabbages. Good. Okay. Let's use uh, three lots. I think you can use three lots of things. For um, it starts having a negative effect on the food or whatever. The three cabbages there. We can't go any more than that. Let's see what else we can put in here. Beans. Tomato paste, salt. Now oh, we'll use a bit of butter. Sounds revolting. Throw it in. Right, there it is. Grab that. Turn you off. We'll have half of that now. Mmm. Straight from the pot. The other half in here. So we have got butter right here. Once our weight does drop below into 75, then we'll eat the butter. I think that's the plan. Our axe is almost broken again. Let's grab a good condition one. Actually, no. Let's stop with the axes for now. Because what's our skills up to? No, it's okay. We can use them. I just, yeah, we'll keep using the axe until we've overtaken long blood and then we'll switch back. I think that's fine. Let's attach that to our back. And this broken one. Place this down here. Until our repairing skills are a bit better. We have a night stick. We have a hunting knife. Pull that empty bottle up. All right, we're going on a little road trip. We're going to go north. I think there's a double warehouse somewhere roughly here. We're going to aim for. Because I do enjoy a good warehouse, so we need to throw this cooking pot outside as well. Just so we can collect some water for us. Right, north we go. Oh, hang on. I see a couple of cops over there. They might have nightsticks. Wow, this is repop- Wow, it's really repopulated. Nice. Nightstick. Yeah, we can't be having these guys hanging around. Come on. Over you come. Sit down. Shotgun. Drop it. That's fine for now. Yeah, short blades coming along. The cold air on. We turn it off now before we start getting cold. Take care of you. Ooh, crowd. I think it's straight north we want. I don't know that we have to mess around with these guys. I think we just keep heading north. Ooh, zombies got something stuck in them. It's always. It's not a katana, though, I can tell you that much. Clearly wasn't a katana, so it's not essential that we stop for that. It wouldn't be a katana yet, anyway. We haven't been alive for 60 days. Anxiety. Anxiety alert. Have one of them. We're fairly populated up here, isn't it? Considering there's like no buildings. What were they all doing up here? I think we follow this kind of dirt road around. And hopefully have the wherewithal to stop. Before we're right in the middle of a huge pack of them by the warehouse. That'd be nice. Man, it's hard to see with these trees. Oh, I think we're here. We are indeed. Well, this is eerily quiet. Anybody in there? No. Uh, empty jars, I feel like, uh useful for something later. Can't think of what. Fishing stuffs? Yeah, we'll grab. Wood glue's always good. Don't need any of them. 
I was expecting a big fight up here. Oh man. Jackpot, I guess. Oh, hang on. No, we're not as uh, in luck as I thought. This is all rotten food. <laughs> so this would be amazing day one, right? Okay. This does nothing for us. Double check that they're all food. Yep. Well, you win some, you lose some. Same story with this one next door, I imagine. Yep. Broccoli, lettuce, peppers, eggplants. Yep. Yeah. Fair enough. Rake. Uh, some more seeds and stuff. Okay. I've already read that. We'll grab the farming volume too. I don't know if we need it. Bit of a burst. There is another warehouse around the corner, but I'm thinking it's probably going to be the same thing because it's surrounded by farmland. We'll go check it out though. All about exploring. A couple of zombies right here. There was a key for one of those cars, but they both look absolutely beat up. Right, we can get around that quite easy. A few more zombie friends. Right, so I think we come up here. Stupid zombie. But right in the way. Whoa, big crowd. Big, big, big crowd. So I think it's a right up here and a left. Whoa, turn, turn, man. Turn and circle of a cruise ship. There should be some warehouses, I think, other than this right. There should be some warehouses at the end of this. Maybe. Yeah, I think so. Around here somewhere. Yeah, right here. These look suspiciously farmy, though, don't they? If nothing else, there are some houses to loot down here. Ooh, a zombie. And yeah, and they are more farmer stuff. Well, the good news is, we've got the key. And the also good news is, um, there's a chair we can sleep on right there. So that's fine. Looking at the positives of the situation. Of this granola bar. Seeds. I can't imagine this one having anything different. Nope. Cherries. Yeah, okay. Same stuff. But like I said, there are some houses down here that we can check out. I am surprised at the complete lack of zombies. Any of these survivory houses? There's a burnt out one. Here we go. Chili, beans, peaches, some good stuff right here. Do you know, I don't think I've brought my tin opener, which is a bit silly of me. Not the end of the world. I've got food. I've got chips and stuff. Speaking of, bag right here. Waste not, want not, we'll grab that. I've already read this. This area's deserted. First water bottle up. Oh, run. Made me jump, but I always swing when I open the door. There we are. Water and pestle. Yeah, we'll grab that. Sounds interesting. Hey, more chips on the floor. Love it. Okay, we're all good. This is a good place to sleep, actually. This room is no window and there's a bed back here. We'll come back here. Oh, an alarm. Darn it. I was not expecting that. Probably should have been, right? Hey, we just got a level and sprint him. Is it safe to come in here? If I just stand in the corner over here and wait. It seems quiet. I haven't got a book to read or anything, unfortunately, so we're going to just go straight to sleep in this chair. All right, good wake up time, 7.30. We'll finish looting these houses, eh? First, doesn't matter where we are. We slept in a plastic chair in a cold warehouse. We're still doing our exercises. Rest it off. I can't believe I haven't brought my um, tin opener. I never take that out of my inventory. It's really strange. I think we've got zombies outside. Yeah, down there. Yeah, this area has been stirred up. Right, let's see. Well, that was the house with the alarm, right? So remarkably quiet, considering. We'll have a little walk around, just in case. Oh, there they are. Hand axe, is it? Indeed. Come on, then. Ooh, 
there's somebody in the corner over there. Hey, I can't open a... Open the... Beans, open a potato. Open the tuna. Fill that water bottle. Yeah, these houses are kind of lame. Let's see if there's anything nearby we can go and mess around with. Yeah, I've just looked at the map. There's a place called Doe Valley. Just around the corner. I say we go check that out. I saw that tree, but it was too late. Yep, this is the way I want. Across this dirt road here. Actually, is a dirt road this time. And there's all these little tiny trees growing in the way now. Which is causing this to happen. Get you really bogged down. Oh, crowds starting to appear. And here we go. Good old tarmac. I think our destination is up here. Well, here we are. Doe Valley. <laughs> Hard to know where to start, really. I guess this is as good a place as any. This is awkward now. For some reason I'm tired. I'm not even exerted, I'm just tired. Seems really bizarre to me. So, gonna have to try and kite these guys whilst taking vitamins. Because I need to be able to you know, take these guys out. Here we go. More like it. Now we're exerted. In the car. Drive. How did he... Darn it, man. I was in the car. Sterilize rag. Well, do you know what we're going to do? We're going to take a drive. Okay, well, we're no longer exerted. Is there anything down these kind of little ways here? Oh, yeah, some residential. Okay. Nice big lake. Ooh, survivor house. Well, this is kind of what we want. We want this turned round and facing the right way. Mm, yeah, I think I'm going to get out. Darn it, we're tired again. Just trying to kind of walk them around a little strategically here, if possible. I'm going to shout and hope that these guys move away from my car. Exerted again. Ah, oh, darn it. It's so annoying the way they just don't let you get near your car again. Drive. Get in, pl Oh! That's the most irritating thing in the world. Just let me get in my car. I have to patiently walk around. I'm not a patient person. Right, run. Engine's on, so it's fine. Been caught out enough times before in the past to know. Okay, so this place is really populated. 
I thought it was going to be like a little sleepy you know, village town type thing with not much going on, a few zombies to take on. It's just absolutely packed. It's more packed than Rosewood ever was. We need to just slowly ease our way in, don't we? Basically. Let's go. Move. That's what we've got to do with this area. I'm trying to avoid the zombies. I really am. So many crowds, like, in the roads in the middle of nowhere. I don't understand that. I mean, these are just, like... This is a road with nothing around it. No buildings for miles and miles and miles. I don't get why there's huge crowds of zombies everywhere. But this is looking more like it. Okay, anybody following? They haven't started appearing yet. Here's some sort of farmer's market with loads of rotten fruit and veg, okay. See, this should be the area that's populated. It makes no sense. Oh, and here's some, uh, some sort of business. Any houses? Nope. All right, looks like we're staying here. Pick up that chair. Thank goodness for that. No alarm. Oh, no. Here they come. How many of them are there? And that is why we can't stay over there. Fighting, because it took four shots to get one weak zombie. Ooh, empty cooking pot. We like them. These big freezers are quite good. Probably get one of them. We'll put the chair there. That's where we're going to sleep. Can I pick this up? Yes, I can. Oh, there's my can opener. It's in my car for some reason. That's weird. We've got another one now anyway, that's fine. Um, popsicle fridge in there. We'll take that home with us. Nice find. We're going to take a chance to sleep in this chair, even though there's windows everywhere. That's not ideal. That was a gunshot, bringing zombies to this area, no doubt. We'll give it a chance, and we'll wait and see. Let's get rid of that anxiety. Okay, so I'm just going to eat a bunch of stuff here. Let's slow down that weight loss. Scratch is infected, that's fine. Sterilised rag on it. The scratch was a bit BS anyway, if you ask me. I was in the car. don't understand how they got me. I didn't break the window, so... Don't need these scrap electronics. We've got so many of them back home. All right, just waiting for like 10 p.m. There we go. Asleep. We are from a town over here somewhere. We're from this town. And we've gone on a little journey, and there's this little town up here, which is called like Doe Valley or something. Uh, we're down here at the moment because it's pretty darn packed, this place. It's crazy. So I thought it'd be a fun project just to try and clear this little town out. It's not a huge town by any means, but it's packed with zombies. So we need to, first of all, do our daily exercises. Here we go. Rest up here. Yeah, so it's pretty dead around here. We've got a popsicle fridge here as well. I'm just moving stuff from my backpack into the uh, car here. All good. How's our weapon? Axe is looking in good condition. Yeah, we just come up here and we need to ease our way into this area over here. Let's do it. Okay, starting early. New hunter knife. Spear with butter knife. And a bread knife. Okay. Oh. Got some stragglers. Alright. We should be good to carry on. Let's keep moving, baby. Ooh. More friends. This way, zombs. Oh, let's stick us now. Belt left. It's uh, going to break pretty quick, that one. My hunting knife broke again. Yeah, that's fine. This will probably break after a couple of swings. But they're pretty common to find on zombies, so it's all good. Hey, where did my uh, little bandana I had on my face go? It's going to be a process. It's not going to be quick. Yeah, that, that goes. Oh, 
Oh, the knockdown on the baton is so good. One of my favorite weapons to use these days. I used to hate it. I used to hate all things short blunt. I used to just be axes and long blunt only because of the reach. Ugh. Careful there. We have the anxiety and we have some zombies coming over. Never load your ability hunter knife. There's one up there, but we can jump out and deal with them in a second. Never broken a knife for the party. Check on the zombie so it decomposes with the body. We need to eat something. Ah, oh, the bag of chips. Have a seat, chimp. We're going to be thorough about this. Ooh, one behind. Whoa! Whoa, whoa, whoa! I don't know where these guys came from. That's kind of terrifying. I guess it was just a big crowd in the trees there somehow. Yeah, I don't think so, zombies. More friends. Wow, radish and cabbage seeds. Zombies really spoiling us. Keep it moving, baby. Yet another hunting knife gone. We are down to our last one. Oh, we're so close on the leveling short blade as well. What did that girl have on her? Scissors. I was hoping she had a hunting knife stuck in her leg. More friends to play with. Well, that looks like a potential hunting knife up there. Yeah, the hunting knife's really not that bad once you get in the rhythm of it. It's a kitchen knife, it's a trowel. Another kitchen knife. I ain't using no kitchen knife, let me tell you. What have you got? Scissors. Oh, lot of scissors. Bunch of farmers over there. Hopefully they go, you know, the opposite direction to us. But we are tired, so we probably want to consume some vitamins. We go down to one bottle of them now. Is it this can of tomatoes? Bit weird, but there we go. Back to the grind. How close are we? We're about halfway there. Uh, we've got a few here. A few there. Just kind of want to get an idea of the scope of the problem. It's pretty big, isn't it? Yeah, pretty damn big. That's the town right there. That's where we want to go. So what we'll do is we'll come all the way back down here. We want to start heading back that way anyway. And let's use the axe. All right, the rest of them seem to have lost track of us. That's good. Have a quick look through. Oh, more vitamins. That's exactly what we need. More vitamins. Need to remember that guy's there. 
potentially has a knife of some description. Come on. That's just a better knife. What good is that? Have some of that. All right, well, that's some great work right there. Probably time we turned around now. We are moderately exerted. Axe is still in pretty good condition as well. Because we're using it sparingly. Back down the road here. Range of these zombies suddenly appeared here. Right, get rid of the anxiety. Making sure nobody's following. Okay, let's try and get a good night's sleep here. 520, still getting to be daylight, but we still need to do our exercises, so we'll do that now. Here we go. Rest. Oh, that looks like a very foggy day. Not good. Hey, we passed the 10,000 threshold for uh, fitness. That's good. But here's a problem. We've got basically no food. I can't see any zombies there. Yeah, no food there. And we have got some chips and stuff, but we don't want to use a whole supply, do we? Right, what's down here? Oh, Ooh, survivor house. Well, that is interesting. I was just hoping for some food from one of these houses. Another house down there. I'll tell you what. Stir them up in there if we can. Leave them do their thing over there. I right, go quick walk around. I don't see anybody. Could be people upstairs, of course. What do we got? A load of rotten stuff. Here we go. Open a can of beans. Open potato. Open tuna. We will save the peas for later. Eat all these. All right, nice. Orange soda. Grab that. Fill our water bottle. Oh, can of, that's perfect. Sort of stuff that puts weight in here, which is what we want. I think we have got zombies in the house. I can hear them. Ugh. Went past it. Sit down, you. Ugh. What are you all doing in there? Don't answer that. Anyone else in here? Now look at the clothes all strewn about. <laughs> this game does tell a good story. You've got to give it that. Oh, more vitamins. Yes. I don't think I need anything else from here. Uh, let's see how the zombies are getting on at the survivor house, breaking out. Doesn't look like they've made much progress. I mean, I didn't want to be messing around here too long. There's a lot of them out there, you know, or in there, I should say. Right, let's unbarricade it. Drop the plank. Out you come. Okay, that's unbarricaded now. You don't seem to want to come to that one window. All right. Man, I do not like this. There we go. I still hear more zombies somewhere. Right, we're eating this butter, by the way. We're about to drop to end away. Eating the butter. All I did was stem the uh, issue. Oh, look at that. Two axes, two more hunting knives. More food. Hey, our weight's finally going up. Okay, so there's, there's guns and stuff here, but I haven't got really got room for them. I don't really use guns very much, which I know. This sacrilege to some people. Oh, machete. I've never been happier to see a machete. That place was a great find. My machete's going to be attached to our back. Right, food and a replen on our weapons. It was a very good pit stop. Right, back to it. Oh, hang on. Gotta get rid of that anxiety. Right, machete's out. Very nice. A skill of long blades too. All right, girl, what you got there? Another hunting knife, I'll take it. 
but we've got some coming out of the trees over there. This girl down here tracking as well, trying to get us from behind. Don't think so. Use me, zombos. Look at this pile here. Amazing. Oh! Please! Woo! Seems a bit unrealistic that the car would flip there, but okay. Alright, some more friends to play with. I think there's some more coming from over that way as well. Yep, there they are. I don't know how many they are in numbers here. Quite a few. Oh, no. That wasn't even very bad. Nearly got stuck in the middle of three of them. Why are we tired? It's only 1pm. Guess it wasn't a very good night's sleep on that plastic chair, maybe. That would make sense. Take a bunch of vitamins. There's a few more than I thought here. Got a good few to play with here. Hmm, that set them all off walking. I mean, it's good for those guys over there. Yeah, some of them are coming back. Very nice. There's so many seeds from these farmers out here. They've all moved on a bit. Okay, I think we can push forward a little. Oh, okay, we're at the town. Good stuff. Walk down here a bit. Go, where are you going? Come here. Yeah, we should be okay from here. Should not have people behind us. Very nice. More seeds. Machete's nearly broken already. Right, put an axe on my back. That way, when this machete breaks, we're ready to switch. Take some vitamins. Get rid of that tiredness. All right, here we go. Hungry. Eat half that can of oats. Is this a house right here? Yes, it is. Okay. We might be able to stay here. <laughs> Maybe not. Why is there so many here? That's crazy. See what we can do. Alright, the tiredness is back yet again. Ooh, it's a survivor home next door. That's a pretty lucky find. What isn't lucky is that all these guys have just spotted me again. A big old party house, that one. Considering that's a survivor home next door. Get out of there. Corn beef, spaghetti bolognese, good stuff. Can of oats, cereal, maple syrup. You have to take the rubber ducks when you find them. I don't feel good about staying around here. The front and back doors are both broken off that. We made a hell of a good inroads into this area. Let's go back to um, the weird little store we've been staying at. A quick look around. It seems to be clear enough. Right, weight is maintaining at 77. We burnt some calories today then. Eat the rest of this can of oats. 
Going up double time now. Yeah, that machete. Well, it's holding on okay. We did just get another level in maintenance, which is really nice. These melee skills, I'm really pleased with these. Spear's the only one, but I'm not doing spear until we've got much higher maintenance, because they just break so easily. We're just collecting what spears we find. We're going to you know, work on that slowly over time. 10 p.m. Let's sleep. Pete has got a pain in the neck from sleeping in a plastic chair repeatedly, so we need to fix that. Wait, 77. So we need to try and find some more fattening foods. Yeah, we're in pain. We're in pain. We also need a haircut. Darn hippie. Why has my strength just gone up one? Didn't know my strength wasn't. Kind of maxed. Yeah, we do need to do our exercises, actually. I'm gonna come around here just in case they do break in. We've got some time to react. Right, do those sit-ups. There we go. And rest up. And your favourite chair. Looks like the pain's gone now in the neck. That's good. Right, get that machete. Whip primary. We've got the axe ready to go because this machete is about broken. There's our car. Let's get back up the road here. See this kind of peas. Good. So we have made some pretty nice, pleasing progress. Getting into Doe Valley. Now, there's always a chance more zombies will appear on this road. Because, you know, these fields are just filled with them. Here's one right here. Whoa. Yeah, this is our big, big pile. Hey, zombie. Come on, idiot. Oh, there's a trowel. I think I'll take that. Let's eat this whole cut of oats here. That'll put some weight on his right. Yeah. We've got two arrows pointing upwards. Come here, farmer. I respect your profession, but I'm afraid your zombie status means I must destroy you. Oh, here we go. Let's step back a bit. So I can keep track of um, who's new in these piles. Come on, zombies. Quite a few of them coming down, haven't we? Any more? Catch my eye there, zomb. These little trees growing. What happens? So we've already checked that one out. We're interested in this one right here. I'm turning the car off. What kind of weave between the zombs? Very nice. We've got a million shotguns back home. I haven't got room for shotguns right now. Tomato seeds. Very nice. Right, survivor house, come on. Show me what you got. Jeez. Painkillers. And large backpack. Nice. Some good stuff in there. Use me, zombie, this way. Zombie's right there. We good now? There's a water bottle. Lots of good food. We'll leave the dog food. Garden fork, two hammers. Coming out here so I can keep an eye out while I get rid of this anxiety. You know, there's a lot of zombies coming. That's a civilian bulletproof vest there. Another one. I think we've got a bit of a problem out here. As long as they're over there, that's fine. Crafted spear. I mean, it's not even in good condition. 
Wow, this is one of the worst survivor houses I've ever seen. There's more down there. More zombies, that is. I don't know if it's worth checking out down here. I mean, we could always drive down and drive back. Yeah, that was it. It's not one other house, okay. Tells me everything I need to know. More seeds. Turn that car off so we don't have a nasty surprise waiting for us. There's a ton of zombies in the backyard over there. Beautiful. Big crowd over there. More there. Can't believe this whole little town so populated. It's like a proper little one horse town. I know I'm tired, by the way, but I feel like tiredness is manageable with this amount of zombies. I want to save my vitamins for, you know, a big fight. I hear a zombie. Somebody outside. Where the hell did they go? There they are. It is kind of chilly, keep that weight on. All right, we've done this little area. Oh, we are tired. I am tempted to stay in the survivor house because it's, you know, pretty well barricaded, apart from the fact it hasn't got a door, which, you know, admittedly could be a problem. But here's some zombies. Darn it, there's a few over here. Hopefully be the worst of them. Oh, them smokes. There we go. I put this couch in the way of the door. Hopefully that holds it. Put a chair in the way of the door as well. So this beef jerky. Wait, stop going up. There we go. Machete is about broken. The axe is in good condition though. No? I'm calling this a good time to go to sleep. There we go, no pain today. Some quick setups. Some quick rest. Nearly 11,000 for those skills now. The classic cereal for breakfast, I think. It's quite hard because we're trying to gain fitness levels and gain weight. And uh, they don't work hand in hand so well. There we go, place that down. Fill that water bottle. Disassemble that couch. Right, time to move forward. There's another survivor home I'd like to reach at the other end of the town. I think that's a fairly reasonable goal. Man, this rain is not good for videos. Just as well I play with this outline on. Okay. Yeah, this is not going to be a quick thing. Not bad, not bad. Still got the machete, haven't we? Yeah. 
Equip it till it don't work no more. The first part of them's all dealt with. And there's a big crowd over there. We don't have to necessarily worry about them. Huge crowd there. A good book. Uh oh. We're stuck in a stupid tiny tree. Yeah, I'm more interested about up here. I mean, the police station could be good. There's a rural supply. What's this? Oh, I made a mistake of getting out now, haven't I? Yeah, this place is just crawling with them, isn't it? Need to see what he's got on him. There's quite the crowd to take him for a walk, let me tell you. A small window, small window. No! Ah. I started trying to drive before I'd even started moving. And it cancelled the animation. A little bit frustrating. Especially because I've got this big crowd, big conga line of them coming. And they don't stop coming now, of course. The car's ready to go. No! Oh, I was so lucky. I was running the wrong way. Right, there's nobody by the car. Make a run for it. Run for it. That's a scary sight, isn't it? Try and lead them around the building if we can. Oh, tool shop. That's what I want. Right, so we've got a tool shop there. Good to know. And we also had a survivor home. I can't remember exactly where that was. Was it down here? It was by this big lake anyway, wasn't it? I remember this. Was it down here? No, it wasn't this lake. Turn. Yeah, yeah, zombs. For God's sake, move, drive, drive, drive. God's sake. Oh, there goes the machete. Look at these stupid zombies. They're all the ones from like earlier, I'm sure. Okay. Well, that could be a good thing. Casually have a smoke while we're just walking them around. I don't want any of you hanging around the car like idiots. Oh, get away from the car. For goodness sake. Guys are obsessed. I've just tried to sell them all a big dummy. Yeah, it hasn't really worked. They're all still coming, but... I pulled them away long enough that I should be able to hopefully get off this stupid little tree. Onto the tarmac, please. Jeez, that was irritating. I'm incredibly confused about where that survivor home was. There's the tool shop. I think it was past the tool shop, right? Down here? No, because that's the gas station. It was definitely like a little street next to a big lake. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And now I cannot find it for the life of me. 
Down here, maybe? Yes, this is it. Let's get this facing the right way. Alright, how many are following? None so far. There's a big crowd there, though. I say we go and head them off if we come. Any food? Any food? At least we're not hungry anymore. Got a hand axe of that guy. There's a few more down there. I see them. If we can loot this survivor home, then I'm happy to drive home, I think. Back to the original base. We need to, you know, make sure it, the generator isn't going to short out or something. It's been a few days now. Come on, please, zombies. Absolutely nothing good in there. Right, nothing there. I've never seen those sneakers before. Oh, sledgehammer. Already have one. Already got all those things. I eat the corned beef and the beans. Not in that order necessarily, <laughs> apparently. Yeah, we do need that sledgehammer, but I'm going to, you know, not take it straight away. Already read that. Well, well, it's you know, not the worst survivor house I've ever seen, but certainly one of the worst. We don't need another sledgehammer, do we? I'll take it. I mean, I've got no room. I think I just need to bite the bullet and go home here. It's 8 p.m. anyway. There's a tool shop I would have liked to have uh, gotten to, but I think we can be proud of our work over at Doe Valley. Hello, zombs. Look at them all over here. Idiots. Yeah, what a busy town. Strange. The number of zombies far outweigh the number of kind of businesses and residential homes. Well, let's see if I can find my way home now. All right, so dropped in a bit of cheese, pausing the game while looking at the map. Looking at this. Where do we live? Yeah, we live here, right? Yeah, that's us. Not far away, really. Just need to get into this road or this series of roads here. I'll just keep driving and see where it takes us, eh? Right, let's try turning down here. Turn here, then. A lot of zombies in this bit of road. Ah, you stupid zombies. There's that anxiety. Okay, we're back in Rosewood now. It wasn't too bad. Now, how populated is it going to be by our base in the uh, few days we've been away? All right, looking good. Actually. Take a few of them. Yeah, 89%, 25% fuel. Turn it off. Fix it. Turn it back on. Let's drop those electronics there. That's all it's ever going to be used for. There we go. Scrap electronics here. We got 100% fuel. We need to go get gas next episode, so I'll keep this gas can on me to remind me. It's 2.40. We need to go to bed. Uh, let's do our daily exercise and we'll uh, get to work here. And rest, my friend. All right, looking good. It's 12.30 p.m., so pretty, pretty far into the day here already. Now, one thing I do want to do is pick up this popsicle fridge and put it down somewhere. There we go. We have a freezer there. And I'm thinking that's where we put our crops. Speaking of, have we still got soup in here? Fresh, yes, eat it. We made that so long ago. Good. Ooh, we've got a few zombies in the area down there. Interesting. Pop the cooking pot and let's go take care of some business over here. There we go. Those idiots taken care of. Oh, this the knife is dead to me. Oh, let's get rid of these broken ones first. 
It looks like we have got a few more down here and up here. Well, let's get the attention of these few over here. As long as it is just these few, it'll be okay. Come on, dummies. Oh, there's another one coming out of the trees over there. Damn. Here's one. And they're just dotted about really awkwardly, aren't they? He was a bit squishier than some of the others. Garden's looking promising over here. Seed bearing potatoes. Young broccoli still. And seed bearing tomatoes. Good. Not all of them are seed bearing. Look at this. That's still young, that one. But yeah, most of the others seem to be ready. This one says disease. Yes. That makes me think maybe we leave that particular one there. Let's see what's the difference. So I don't want to risk these particular potatoes here because they were diseased. Maybe I'll just drop them out on the floor here. I'm just quickly coming back because these are very heavy. Man, these are heavy. Millions of seeds in there. Let's get the tomatoes in here. There we go. Put them all here together. Cabbages, potatoes, all that stuff. Let's make a bowl here. There we go. So three tomatoes, three potatoes. It's 45 hunger. Do we eat that? Vegetable salad. That's really filling. Great stuff. Well, I've got a little bit of time here. I did say we need to go and fill up these gas cans. I was saying that. I've got a bunch of full gas cans right here. The one in the van. I'm pretty sure we've got a zombie in there. I keep hearing breathing when I'm going past it. All right, good. We've got plenty of gas there for the generators for now. 8pm. I guess we could just do a bit of reading here. We need mechanics volume 2, I think. Yeah, let's read that. Alright, 10 pm. I'm gonna call that good. I'm gonna head to bed here. I might do some more exercise before bed just so we can actually sleep. Well, I don't know. Should be okay. Let's try and sleep through. Nope, that did not work. Got any sleeping tablets? There we go. Very tired again. I took a few too many, I think, because <laughs> we've overslept. Right, morning exercise done in the early afternoon. Let's make another salad. Wow, 51 hunger from that one. Let's eat this full cabbage here. Then eat this. Yeah, we're going to be overweight before we know it here. And we're eating good right now. You know what I might do? I might take a little trip down to the farms down below. Pulled a load of zombies over there previously, so I'm just curious to see if they're still there. I need a sledgehammer. So I'll just use the poor condition one. Well, there we go. Nice big opening. Let's put the sledgehammer in the back of the trunk over here. That way, if we need to utilize it on the road, we can. Got to be careful of big crowds and tiny trees. But here we go. Look at this. Here's a bunch of zombs. There we go, that's how we take care of those guys. Nice shotgun there. Okay, we've got more down here. Well, there was one right there. 
otherwise we seem to be okay. We'll take your canned carrots. Oh, this is good stuff right here. Okay, let's pour the pot of stew out onto the ground. We'll take the cooking pot though. Everywhere we go, we disassemble beds. We have arrived at another area. We're so close to level in short blade here. There it goes, that feels nice. Long time coming. So now we're four on short blade. I wanna try and get short blunt up. Back to the nightstick. Ooh. Hello everybody. <laughs> I didn't know there was a party back there. And now we have anxiety, of course. Well, let's do this. I say, I don't mind this uh, nightstick at all. What is this idiot doing here? Axe out. Right, we'll try and quickly loot this one house, then we'll drive back up. Corned beef and pineapple. That's good stuff right there. Chips. Oh, jars and lids. Again, I can't remember why they're good, but I've heard they are. Oh, nice. Pipe wrench. Vitamins. Very good stuff right there. Perfect condition leather jacket. And we'll dismantle those headphones. All right, I think we're done. Let's drive home. Home sweet home. Oh, actually, empty cooking pot down. Right, let's defrost some potatoes and cabbages and tomatoes ready for tomorrow. We shall eat this corned beef for the time being. There we go, now we're tired. And we've woken up at a reasonable hour. Getting back on track. Exercise. Right, where's our bowl gone? Let's make a salad out of these things. That's hunger 53. Got another bowl here? Yeah, might as well just make another one right now. There we go, that's vegetable salads. We'll eat one right now. 53 hunger, is crazy. Alright, looking pretty good. Since this is a three-day affair, I'm tempted just to take a little drive up to Muldra and just assess how long it's going to take us to get there, so it's 20 past 12 now, and see what it holds for us, really. See if it's worth our while heading up there. Wow, we've got a lot of zombies at the top of the town over here. To the point where a bit of axe is probably warranted here. Uh, well we could try short blunt until we can't manage. Gotta say that short blunt's pretty damn good. Little hand axe, why not? A few 
few more just down the road here. All right, we're on our way now. New night stick. Right, let's shout these two over over here. Good. Well, there's another crowd taken care of with the handy little night stick. Love that thing. The dream is just to have a nice big clear road here one day. I can just speed down without worrying about running over a group of zombies. It's getting there, it's much better than it was. Has he got scissors? Yeah, scissors. Wait, where's the idiot I shouted? Come on. Time for our vegetable salad. Uh, excuse me, girl, where are you going? That's all I wanted. Excuse me, gentlemen. This way. That guy had a butter knife stick in him. What a way to go. Anxiety. What's this item here in the ground? Vitamins. Take them. Like one left in the bottle. This must have been where I did a huge fight. There's one going that way, so just give him a quick shout. But right, we're getting somewhere now. Pretty good. Um, right here. That is just such thick forest right there. Ah, oh. use me zombos. Zombies meet nightstick. Right, probably time to turn around because just down the road and up is the way to Muldra. So we've done a nice job of clearing the path there. It's going to make life a lot easier. Less running over zombies on the way and stuff. Right, back in Rosewood. Stupid bread knife. We should have a couple incoming. Get your hands off me. And we're back. Let's get a few of these potatoes and cabbages and stuff. See if we can get them in here. That way when we use them for cooking tomorrow, they won't be frozen. In theory. Take one sleeping tablet. There it goes. Tired. Very tired. Just do some running on the spot sometimes just to speed up that process. 
You know the drill. Let's get our exercise on. Rest off the exertion. Looking good, looking good. Right, what sort of condition is our axe in? Pretty great. We're looking good. Grab our cabbages, potatoes, and tomatoes. Right, let's eat one of these vegetable salads for like 54 food or whatever it is. So we've got two bowls of vegetable salad. Put these in our backpacks. Treat the anxiety. Here we go. Three full water bottles. Right, today we're going back up here along here. And this right here is Moldra. As you can see, we're pretty close to it, really, in the grand scheme of things. It's just a straight drive in the nap. Uh, we've cleared this road yesterday. Whether it remains clear is another matter, but we've done our best there. Then we're going to just start poking ahead into Moldra, I think, and try and scout out somewhere to live over there, maybe. Uh, this car's possible. We may as well run this one into the ground, eh? Yeah, we got spare nightsticks and stuff. We're good. It is kind of dangerous driving this fast in this game. If I'd have crashed into those cars, for example, good chance, you know, you could end up with a critical injury or even worse. And it's harder to dodge zombies as well. That's why I made a point of clearing the road. Just so we can try and get backwards and forwards between Moldra and home quite quickly, in theory. All right, I'm going to start taking it easier down here because we haven't actually visited this part for a long time. We're past the warehouses now. Then it'll be a case of chucking a left up. Let's take care of who we can on the way. We're currently leveling short blunt, I think. So let's get the night stick out. Nothing I want. Uh, yeah, there'll be a left here. We're basically in Moldra now, I think. So we probably do what we like to do. And let's be methodical in clearing this out. Hello, buddy. Red knife. One day it's going to be a machete. Can't see anybody up the road yet. But it's going to be very, very busy, so... I don't want to ease on into it if we can. Mulder's a nightmare on this road just because all the zombies coming out of these trees. Creeping on up there. Make sure I am on the right road. Yep, certainly am. Bit random, dead body. All right, here we go. Check this zombie while we're near it. Beans are in good condition. Come on, zombs. Alright, we're good to creep up a bit more now. Okay, and let's just ease on the gas here. Slowly, slowly. I have done a save in Muldra before and... This very road was the death of me. This is the problem with this area. They do like to come out of the trees. Come on, Kurt Cobain. Yeah, at least it's opening up a bit here. I like that. Excuse me, Mr. Handax. Oh, here we have a few. All right, we got them. A few more over here. Just feel like we're getting close to the town now, where the population's ramping up. Very good. Very short drive up the road. Come on. Oh, we've got one behind as well. Just spotted them. Let's not get ourselves in the pincer movement here. Three idiots. Yeah, definitely close now. Let's kill the engine. Oh, 
You're so agile with the night stick. It's really nice. I think maybe we leave the car there. Right, nice stick's dead. Getting a new one equipped. Put the broken one in this zombie. Hmm, we're gonna have to drive up a bit more, I think. We're not as close as I first thought. We're gonna be too far away from the car now. A good time and we're hungry. And we have the anxiety. There we go. Another pile of fools. Let me guess. Kitchen knife. Red knife, yeah. We've got little crowds up here. This way. We have another meeting of the minds up here. I like when they're all in a pile, I guess. It makes it a lot easier to loot them. Okay, again, we're at a stretch of road here. No zombies in the immediate sight, so we'll drive up a little further. Quick look at the map. Ah, I'm not on the Muldra Road. That's why it feels weird. How do I get... Ah, I have to go up there. Okay. Interesting. It's quite a lot of clearing I didn't really have to do, though. A little bit annoying. I see where I went wrong. I took the first turn when I should have taken the second turn at the crossroads. But in theory, that should stop them coming over from this road to that one. Should stop some migration, hopefully. That's the dream, anyway. Well, let's drive home. Nothing ventured, nothing gained. A few here we need to get rid of, actually. Oh, thank you to those who told me as well. You gotta wait for that slam. Well, you know, the door's closed. I think a few episodes ago had some sort of issue where uh, a zombie hit me while I was in the car. Apparently it's a, it's a thing. It's intended. Fair enough. Man, where were these guys all earlier? I give up now. I'm driving back. It's taken much too long and this is not the area I even want to clear. Yeah. Yes, avoided them. Pedal to the metal. Let's drive home. I think I will stop for any zombies on this road. We do need this to remain clear. Make life easy. Or easier. Mourning the loss of its fellow zombie. Look at you guys. You get to die twice. Here's a couple of friends for us. Get them in a little pile off to the side there. Hopefully it stops me flipping my car on them. Okay, we are tired now. Using the nightstick. I always want to call it a baton. Using the nightstick, you definitely notice like an improvement in stamina. I'm not getting winded all the time. Big crowd here, but hmm. If I'm gonna get them, it's gonna have to be quick. Just come over. Getting very late and dark. There's still a fair few over there, but got rid of a good amount of them there. We'll get the rest tomorrow. Oh man, we've had some sort of 
migration over here. There's a few of them. Sorry, about four or five zombies just then. Hopefully that's enough to keep them at bay. We're hungry again. Right, let's get some sleep. Seven AM, not bad. Alright, we need to do our exercises, but before I do, just realized we need to we need to eat this. And we need more veg out of the freezer. Two cabbage. Two potatoes. And two tomatoes. See how we get on with them. While they're defrosting, let's do our exercise. And we're going to need somewhere to rest, so let's come over here to do it by the sofas. Quick check of the generator. Fuel 38. All right, so we need to refuel them. Now let's do this now, while I'm thinking of it. And you off. Give me a couple of gas cans. There we go. She's the best part of two gas cans there. Don't know how many scrap electronics it takes, but let's just put a few on us. And let's fix the damn thing as well. Turn you back on. Electronics back in that bag. Look how organized we are. All right, exercise time. 40 minutes of sit ups. Now, rest. Strength is always going up and down one, it seems. Not much I can do about that. This is, ooh, 12,000 out of 18,000. Two thirds of the way there. Nice. Right, is our veg defrosted now? It is. Make some salad. Alright, what I've learned is two bowls worth, which will get me through the day, is two of each vegetable item, so that's good. Uh, we need to fill an empty bottle here. How are we doing with this? I uh, still got quite a lot of water in there, that's good. Alright, back. Moldra. No immediate zombies here. Okay, well this one's got much better tyres, but we should hopefully get away with driving this one again today. Actually no, while I'm thinking of it, is if I don't do it now, then something will go wrong. So let's go and grab a lug wrench. Probably have one on the floor over here. No, apparently not. Definitely have one over here though. Right here. And we have a jack out here already. I've taken two tires off this. I've put one of them on here, and this is the broken one off there. And I'm missing a tire. It's really weird. Reverse, there it is. Yeah, that's the decent condition one. These two tires were kind of shot, so just wanted to make sure they weren't about to go bang when I was driving around, you know? You stupid zombies, what are you doing there? Ooh, hello. My axe there. Wow, there's a lot of zombies around here. Been a while since we've had a crowd this big in Rosewood. Well, the whole reason I stopped is this zombie up here looked like they had a fire axe on them. Yeah, decent condition. We'll take it. Come on, boys. What are you doing over there? Right, we should have a few down here to take care of still. Might even just be a couple. Oh, wow. Um, excuse me, girl. Where are you going? I'm right here. Come on, dummy. Can I get in my car? No. Bad zombie.
Go see some down there. Come on, zombies. Play fair here. This road was clear. Rosewood was clear. Don't think I'm getting some older today, judging by this. Hopefully they're far enough away now. Get back to the car. Smoke break. Yeah, there's a few zombies on the road, but it wasn't big crowds or anything. So this is where we went wrong last time. I say we. It was all me, obviously. Right, so we want to come up here. It's going to be a bit of a pain, isn't it? Okay. We worked around it. And up here will be Moldra. Yeah, this is the road that gave me trouble in the past. Yeah, let's back this up a bit. Oh, come on, let's have a nightstick battle. Well, that's why you didn't win the nightstick battle. None of you have got nightsticks. some interesting stuff there. Let's at least see if we can have a look at the start of Muldra. Before we go any further, we're hungry. Eat that. We're all good now. Yeah, wait, it's dropping again. That's fine, we've got like six pounds to play with. Alright, here we go. Reverse, reverse. Wow, got no control over that reverse, it feels like. Okay, yeah, we're going to turn around. <laughs> good. I always check these in case they've got vitamins or anything on them. Right, we'll walk, I think, for now. Just so the car can stay with the engine running, so we need to make a swift getaway. Hopefully we can. Right, I've stirred up some trouble here. A bit further up the road. Let's a quick look at the map. Yeah, we're basically there. This is where the gas station is. All right. That means it's there for the taking next time then. But we do need to head back. We just hit tiredness and... I want to save my vitamins for a full day's fighting, you know? You can foresee us needing to use the axe and stuff. And that does take a lot out of us. But remember, there's a police block down here, so we need to not be going full speed. There it is. Yeah. Alright, and then this is a bit of a pain. I want to be on that side, really. Ah, damn it. It's doable, just a bit of a pain. But let's go. Pedal to the metal. We will end up setting up, like, you know, a safe house in Muldra, but it'll be a while before we can do that, I think. That's why I haven't replanted the farm back in Rosewood. Because I think we'll move to Muldra full time as soon as we find a suitable base. There we go. Rosewood, sweet Rosewood. Gosh, damn it. Fairly certain a car would not react like that. Deary me. I enjoy the realism of this game. Please don't make cars do somersaults when uh, they slightly rip up against a corpse. We are back. Alright, sleep time. Maybe somebody tried to hit a door or something. Hey! Alright. 
Let's grab some veg out of here to defrost. Drop your stuff. And start the day with sit-ups. Hold by a rest. A well-earned anxiety go away. And let's see if we can make up our solid jet. Yeah, these things are fresh. There we go. So exactly two potatoes, two cabbages and two tomatoes in each dish. And it equates to actually two units of each of them as well. We will eat one of them right now. We shall stick the other one in our bag for later. Right, let's get moving. See if we can get towards Muldra today. Whoa, more zombies over here. This area is pretty bad for them. It seems to be arriving from somewhere. I cannot think where that would be. Yeah, there's still some up there. Okay, I think we're good to carry on here. Well, we're less than half a tank of gas on here. Need to fix that. Have my broken nightstick, zombie. A gift from me to you. Okay, it's a few more taken care of. A lone little zombie out here. Uh, go on, stupid. This way. I'm trying to keep the middle of the road re, so I can just kind of safely drive down that. Man. You just keep appearing. Guess that's the nature of a zombie apocalypse, eh? No, I'm fairly certain this girl here has been here every time I've gone past in the last few times. About time I uh, stopped that zombie. She was feasting on that corpse there. And I keep pulling her backwards and forwards in the same spot of road every time I drive past. Here we are. The Moldra Road. We need to bring a propane torch and get rid of those wreckages at some point. So we've been here, clearly. And this will be where the start of the population is ramping up. Okay, big crowds. I'm seeing big crowds. Kill the engine. Um, zombs. I'm going to do a little shout. I'm probably going to regret that because it's going to pull these over here as well. Oh, and those down there. No, the ones down there have stopped moving. Okay. Just pulling a few from that road down there as well. Wow. Well, let's have our salad. We're pretty hungry. Nice, rewarding salad after burning all those calories. Mm -mm -mm. What a reward. Let's have some dessert with that. Well, let's get these guys out of those trees. You think you're so smooth hiding in the trees? I see you. Now you're just a big pile of losers. Right, come here, buddy. Ooh, where did you come from? That was creepy.
Well, let's explore this um, EOI then. Got a diner right there. Ooh, big crowd right there. Right, we're exerted, so I'm gonna make the strange decision to switch to the axe, but that's just so we can hopefully just get rid of them quicker. Alright, nice. Quite a bit grouped on there. Wonder if I can get in that diner to rest, and then we can clear out the rest of these bozos. Yeah, there's a zombie in there. I think we just drive back at this point and pick this back up tomorrow. Which will be the same episode for you guys. It's a good start. Let's get down here. Right, back on the road home. Oh, sugar. Alright, this car's had it now, I think. No actual injuries, but that took a ton of health off me. Absent-mindedly kind of cruising home. Oh, come on, those zombies. Well, I think this car's had a good run, but... Probably time we retired it now. One too many big hits, I think. Now, before I forget, I'm going to take, like, a couple of propane torches. I don't know if we need to rot. Full disclosure, I don't really understand what they do. And the Wilder's Mask. We'll take all that with us. And we will dismantle some of those wrecks at the crossroads. Get to sleep. Oh man, that's not a good time to wake up. We'll do our exercises, but yeah. We did not get enough sleep there, I don't think. So what will happen is we'll get tired a lot earlier. How's our weight doing? Still 80, that's fine. Let's eat a can of oats and take another one with us. Yeah, why don't we take this car over here today? Make sure there's no one trying to sneak up on me. Uh, what have we got in here? Not much useful. Grab this gas can. We'll throw it in here in case we break this down on the road. We'll have a gas can. All we have to find is a working car. We've got a 43 size trunk, but we're not going on a big loot run. This will be fine. Why isn't the engine starting? That's all in good nick. You know what I just remembered, actually? Give me that gas can back. Wasn't that like a really nice sports car? Over here somewhere. Seed, bear and broccoli. Oh man. Need to try and remember to get them. Yeah, but we can lockpick now, is the point I was going to make. Yeah, this here, look at this. That looks like a tasty car. <laughs> I mean, the engine's not in great condition, but... Hey, it'll be fun to drive. Also that one over there. Hot wire it. Ooh, yes. If you thought I crashed before, <laughs> you ain't seen nothing yet. Get the bricks, bozo. Yeah, make sure to smash the passenger side, not the driver side. Ooh, don't go over them. It inexplicably flips your car over. Wow, already crushed it. Number here. Yeah, I don't understand where you've all come from, by the way. I've cleared this gas station about three or four times. Bunch of jokers. We seem to be otherwise okay. Turn on the generator. We've got a full tank. Got a full gas can. We're good to go. Let's hit the open road in our new sports car. Man, it was so sensitive, the steering.
This is a fast, fast car, in the words of Tracy Chapman. We have got some vitamins, I think we'll need them today. Oh man, this is scary quick. Damn, I'm so fast. I know, right? I should be a car journalist. This car is fast and blue. It go vroom vroom. Five stars. Right, we're over here. But what amount of propane already in my propane torches? I've only moved two cars. Next time, note to self. Bring propane tank. We made a start. Right, we're hungry. So time for the second can of oats. And we have some anxiety to kick. Alright, zombs. Oh, that one over there must be pretty hard of hearing. To not be able to hear this engine. We've got a few zombie friends over here. If we could loot a couple of places here, that'd be pretty cool. Oh, jeez. Came out of nowhere. Dismantling watches. Hey, shot blunt just leveled. I don't particularly want to use short blade around here if I can help it. Hang on, there was a zombie in here. I thought they would have broken down that door by now. Alright, you can break the window instead then. You do use zomb. Now that's where there was a big group last time. That's probably who we just took on. Those bunch of zombies just then. Well, it's weird just being in a big area of concrete like this. Feels kind of oddly barren. Oh, it's a gas to go t-shirt. That girl worked here. You come from the diner, I bet you did. Yeah, it looks like you did. Oh, there's some cops in gas to go. Right, get your axe ready. Hiking bag, eh? And a stone axe, well. Come on, out you can. It's like a survivor group, isn't it? It's really weird. Taking that hiking bag. Come on. Wow, where are you all coming from? With your big backpacks. I'll take the smoke, so. And nothing in that one. Nothing in that one. More smoke, so. Speaking of smokes, there should be tons in here somewhere. Yep. Sure, we'll have some chocolate cakes. Ooh, four orange sodas. Ooh, this is in red. Let's read it now quickly. We get back in there. More smokes. Flunkies, I guess that's like Twinkies. All right, well, gas station's done. Oh, we got some more zombies out here. Look at this. The zombie slayer's work is never done. We are tired, so this is not going to be as easy. All right, here's the window this guy broke out of. Doubt there's going to be much here. There's a pinball machine, which is a cool base decoration, but that's about it. Ooh, coffee. E-bag. I'll take them with me. Oh, I got two butters. Essential. How are we looking up here? Oh, <laughs> not good. Uh, this tiredness is the real pain. If I could clear that group there, that'd be amazing. Eat half your coffee. Let's go. Oh, 
Oh man, we're moderately exerted. Not good. Much happier with that as a day's work. We took care of some serious business. Now we may drive home. Oh, I don't like driving at this angle in this car. Feels weird. Because the handling's so sensitive. Feels like you could just spin out into a tailspin any second. Right. 120 miles per hour, here we go. Oh man. We hit a zombie then. I think it broke the window. <laughs> oh wow. That's the longest. I've gone full throttle in this car. Man, it covers some ground. But yeah, I've already smashed the window off it. That was fun. Really enjoyed driving that car. I'm just glad I made it back in one piece. All right, time for bed, I think. Right, exercise done. Let's grab this cooking pot of water. Let's do some cooking. There we go. Just quickly defrosting them. Okay, let's cook up this soup. Let's eat the corned beef while we're waiting. Like two bowls. Drink one. Very good. Are right, these two propane torches? Let me check something here. They're empty. Can I fill them up over here? How does this work? I don't understand it entirely. Okay. Yes, you just do it like that. Right, we're all good here. Let's go out for the day. Hey, look. Things have started growing up the walls. Uh, we just about wrecked that car last time. This one's just about wrecked itself. Let's take this car this time. I right, was just looking at this one here. The engine quality is only 39, so that's why it doesn't start so well. Let's check this one down here. 52. All right, so we're probably better off using this one then. Got a nice full tank in it, so that's fine. I won't drive so fast that I'll be out of control, hopefully, in this one. That's the dream. Right, to Moldra. Darn it! Came hurtling around that corner. I started turning so early. I'm such a bad driver in this game. I just want my cars to last. I'm trying my best to be careful. Stupid zombies right in the middle of the road. Two big hits already in this car. Well, hello there, girl. What have you got for me? Kitchen knife. Also, I think that was a guy. <laughs> Excuse me, come back. We're ridding the roads of zombies. It's a new initiative. Here we go. Up here. Oh man, I haven't brought the welding mask with me. This is getting really frustrating. I'm just always forgetting something. Propane tank, the welder mask, and keeping everything in the trunk. And one day, I'll be able to get rid of these stupid cars. Because it's not like... I wouldn't mind if I just kept plain forgetting to do it. I'm remembering, but I'm forgetting little things. And it's such a convoluted thing. You need a propane torch, a propane tank, a mask. You need to make sure you've got enough refills. It's just like, there's always something. And by the time I remember to do it, I'll be living over here. And with no need to go back down there. You watch. But hopefully it's good metalwork and XP... You left them there. Right, I do have somewhat of a plan. You saw somebody in the trees over there, I'm pretty sure. Alright, mate. What's going on, girl? I'll take your lighter. What are you all doing in those trees? Come on. Oh, that's a poorly timed break of the nightstick. Right. 
Right, we got rid of them. We've got Captain Pink Shoes up here. Oh, Captain Pink Shoes, come back. All right, we have some friends up here. Oh, yes. Hello, Sheriff. How can I help? There's a big horde coming this way. Like the migrating. I'd wager that's exactly what's happening. They're probably going towards some sort of meta noise or something, you know? The meta event. Alright, we've got a few up here. Zombies, zombies, please. Pay attention to me. So I believe I'm coming this way. Bump your brakes before turning in this cruise ship of a car. I think we're going straight up here. Howdy, partner. My name's Woody. I always get in the back seat of this stupid car. Not a fan of this car. Where are you going in that little dress? Come on, party girl. I don't think much of your date. Stacking them on top of one another. Watch it there, purple hoodie. Right, we're a little hungry. Bowl of soup, fresh cooked. Give it to me. Get rid of the anxiety. We've got another girl here coming down. Oh, she's got a key for something. Probably one of these cars up here, right? No gas. Yeah, this is roughly where I want to be. I'm thinking... That's got two stories, that building right there. Ooh, propane mask thing. Welder mask, that's the word I'm looking for. Nice. Alright, there it goes. Yeah, so I think I'd quite like to live here. Okay, I wanted that open. For the simple reason. They could spawn a key, basically. There it is. There's some good stuff here. We'll close it, though. We'll go home. Do you need to get a bed for in there? Hello, friends. Where are you guys coming from now? Ooh, I wonder if I could work on these cars right now. I wonder if I have all the required materials. These things need to move. Thread a needle. Look at that. Maybe 8pm is not the best time to do it, eh? Could be worth a little look, though. Should now somewhat of a clear run through it. Oh, that's so much better. Now we just need to move some of those cars in the middle of the road out of the way. And we're laughing. Wow. That's the best I've ever seen that road. Only one zombie. The whole way. 
That pile of corpses is ridiculous. I don't know why it makes the car react like that. Like I'm driving over a bunch of high-powered springs. Check out stuff in there. Well, let's just eat a bag of chips. Get rid of the anxiety. Sleep. Woken up by a gunshot. Lovely. Let's go get some veggies out of the uh, bridge over here. Oh, wrong thing. Serps. That in squats. Rest it off. While we're over here, let's check on the generator. 97 conditions, fine. I uh, can't be bothered cooking today. Let's just make salads. Oh, we've got those two ready to go for the road. Let's eat a can of chili for just now. We're not quite at the point of moving over yet. We're going to have to scavenge some things because I want to keep this place running. I need to remember to turn the generator off, but I want it here as an option. I don't want to strip it of its assets. Um... Excuse me. Can I help you? Didn't think so. Clown. There's a few zombies moved about onto the road and stuff, so... Wouldn't surprise me if we have to fight our way over here again. Got to learn from my mistake. Didn't hit that lamppost this time. Yeah, there was a few off to the side there, but that's fine. Alright, girl, what you got? Scissors? I don't need no scissors. Oh, I see a nightstick. Very nice. Come back, zombie. Wonder where they're coming from all the way out here. It's a curious thing. Yeah, if we can get a generator, I'm happy to move over here pretty much straight away. But we need a separate generator first. Onto the slip road. And up here. Beautiful. Let's attach the two together. There we go, that's those two out of the way. I know there's another one right here. Genuinely tried to avoid the zombies, just like the car was like a magnet to it. Excuse me. You silly zombie girl. Walking away from me. This guy's deaf. Come on. Butter knife. Yes, I say butter. That's how the British say things, you know? Alright. I think that's all the bad wreckages out of the way. Let's go to the anxiety there. Oh, we've got a big uh, grungy guy coming. Sneaky one from behind. So yeah, we're not going to get to do much over that today. Uh, we need to eat now. All oh, happening. Eat your vegetable salad. Nearly missed you there, girl. And then I think it's right again. As you can see, I've been here before. Easy enough to get past that car. And it's on a turn, so shouldn't ever be uh, going full speed next to it. That's fine. These ones are a bit more of a problem. As you can plainly see. Ugh. Get out of the car. I've got to steer for a second, then. Okay, 
Can I stick there? Oh, we've got another party girl here in a little party dress. Let's see if we can get this just moved ever so slightly. There we go, that's all I want. And we've got some friends over here. Get away from my new base. Let's see if we can get a decent bed out of one of these uh, trailers for the new base. Oh, jeez. A great way to make me jump. GG. Very nice. Well, that looks like just a mattress on the floor. It's better than nothing. But we can do better than that. Oh dear. Alright, come on. Fit him in time. Man, these are all stuck, these windows. Yeah, something like this will do fine. Simple bed one of two. Let's hope we get lucky with the next one. Two of two. Perfect. Ah, oh, man. Genuine question, where were all these zombies a minute ago? I'll take your hidden knife. Quite a simple bed part there. Here's the other half of the bed. Okay, we can't stay here. I really wanted to. Tried my best. We just can't. Too dark. I've got a bed ready to go here though. Let's go home. Man, this is hard to drive in. Stupid car. Uh, let's eat this other vegetable salad. Okay, you know, it might seem like a stupid high risk. Maybe it is. But I've never seen a zombie here. If I can just park this properly against this, we should be able to just sleep here because it's too far to go back really and this visibility is terrible. Okay, I'm going to take a risk here. We're at the uh, Muldra Crossroads at the moment. I'm going to take a risk and do my daily exercise here because I've never seen a zombie here. Ever, I don't think. Let's hope that continues. And take this silly risk. We need to keep these uh, exercises up of whatever gonna get a level in fitness to get rid of that out of shape trait here we go as i thought that was fine get this backpack on your back get this on the front high exertion but we're gonna be sitting down in the car now so that's fine all right back to it we're trying to clear out the warehouse and get a bed in there i'll have to come back again with the sledgehammer and more supplies we're gonna be slowly moving over time basically but if we can Put a hurting on that area today, I'll be very happy. Right, this is our turn just here. And then right here, watch out for those stupid trees. Miniature trees. Got this irritating car here. Right, push that back. I think that's going to be easier than just towing it. Because I have to tow it onto the grass, which would not be good, but that's out of the way now. That's nice. All right, getting flanked here. Unlucky zombos. Right, we've got a big pile of zombies there. We've got a very snazzy looking tank top dude here. 
looks like our exertion has gone. That's pretty nice. I'm gonna ease on up here. Because this area is a bit unknown. It was pitch black last time I was here. It's totally dark. So, right, we got some right there straight away. Is that a crowbar? Oh. Don't be coming out of the trees. Gotta be careful of that. Yeah, decent quality crowbar. We'll take it. Couple more zombies just there. Stop here. Come here, green shirt. Excuse me. I'm talking to you. Very nice. Right, let's have a look up here. Just saw a zombie there. Where are they gone? We've still got a fair few in this trailer park. This rain is hammering it down now. Right, that's where we want to live. Go check it out. There's part of our bed as well. Alright, nobody here so far. Let's shout into the trees. I'm hungry as well. I can immediately hear somebody. Eat a bag of chips. Oh, hello. Whoa, where did you all come from? Were you all inside? That's kind of terrifying. There's a lot of them. Light stick's broken. I'm going to the axe. And a knife. Where were those zombies? Right, get this night stick equipped. This one chucked away in this body. Oh, a big crowd up here as well, look. Oh man, it's so dark and I can just about see zombies coming through. Oh man, we've got more here. Okay, hey, nice. My man, how did you get it here? No, we haven't even been upstairs yet. Okay, this is maybe not the stronghold I thought it was. But we can have a bed up here, that's the main thing. If everything else is down there, that's no problem. Oh, we've got planks and stuff here, which is pretty good. I'm going to pick this up. Man, this rain. Little fridge there as well, that's interesting. There we go. That can just go there for now. That's a place to sleep. And look at this. Water dispenser. Right, box of nails. Well timed. Lots of planks here. Have I not got a hammer? Yeah, I have. Or open the box of nails, maybe. There we go. Let's barricade this. More planks. I'm now just disassembling some crates. So I can have a wall of storage at the back here. We made a good start here. We barricaded some windows. Put a bed down. Uh, maybe we... Should we stay here tonight? I think we should stay here tonight. And then we can work on this again. And then we can head back to the other base next time. Alright, let's see what we've got to eat here. Love a little chocolate. We'll get rid of the anxiety. Little makeshift barricade there. And let's sleep. It's 6.20am. We'll do some exercise. Get some rest. Yeah, that's the problem. You can just walk straight through that. We really need two filing cabinets. Well, we really need to get a sledgehammer and put some sheet ropes in place. As you can see, I've moved some of these to the back wall. Pretty nice. And then we just got a few of these to dot it about. This has planks on the outside. I planked these on the inside, but I'm thinking I might need to do them on the outside instead. Just for the reason that we can then put sheets in these windows. Any food anywhere here? Nope. That's fine, we should be able to get some from the trailer park.
Mac and cheese. Score. Then we have corned beef and spaghetti bolognese. All right, nice. We will drive back to Rosewood tonight. And we'll slowly start moving over here. I'm happy with the progress here today. Probably need to clear out that building right there, right? Or is there a self-storage nearby? I think there might be a self-storage up the road. It's not the main big one, but it's certainly one we can um, have a look at, you know? And then that should get us a generator for this place as well. Is what I'm thinking. This is it. Right here. Stupid rain again. The problem right now. You might be wondering why I'm persisting with short blunt in this scenario. It is purely so we can prolong our day. Because we tend not to get as tired or fatigued when we're using the old short blunt. Quite a lot of them over here. What's this? Offices. Okay. And we probably need to get rid of that crowd up there. Nice, working through them. Uh, yes, good quality nightstick there. Much needed for this run. Alright, we've cleared them out. Right, what are we working with around here? Oh, jeez. Have you seen that down there? Don't want all of them at once. We can help it. Quality so bad on this because it's storming. I promise you there's a ton of zombies down there. I know it's going to be hard for you guys to see because I'm struggling to make out things. And after it's, you know, compressed for YouTube, it's going to be even worse. I think we will need to come back here with our sledgehammer, actually, because we won't be able to get into any of these places, I don't think. Let's see if any of these doors are open over here. What the hell? Oh, man. Okay, we're in here. Key. Uh oh. Empty gas can. Tempted to grab these four planks, honestly. But that's silly. Oh, yes. I'll tell you what's not silly. How much we need this generator. Darn it. There you go. We have a generator there. If this stupid storm would just let up a bit. Alright, looks like they've broken a couple of lockers down. That's good. Uh, it might be time for the axe. Look at that lovely line of zombies. Right, let's see if we can manage. I want to get a key. Uh oh. Uh oh. No key after all that. All that effort. Oh man, these are mannequins. I thought they were zombies. That was a really good trick for the game, fair play. Bro, oh, where did you come from? Oh, I should have walked you into the thing, shouldn't I? Well, I've got a few planks here. That's some good barricading material. Oh. 
Gonna move these corpses out of here. There we go. Ooh, that zombie had a machete. Nice. Work in progress very much, but we're getting somewhere with this now. All right, so this is how I want it now, apart from the garbage all over the floor, but we'll fix that up. Oh, we got an antique oven. That's pretty cool. Happy with this. This is great progress. Uh, we need to drive back to Rosewood now, though. Can't believe we got a machete off that zombie. That's awesome. I've never looted a machete off a zombie before, I don't think. Get in the back seat for no reason whatsoever. Let's drive home. Well, let's drive to the other home. This is going to be home soon. Oh, watch out there, girl. I'll get you next time. We need to eat. I can't open a can while driving. Come on. Get a grip, man. We're back on the main highway. And finally, there we go. No! Darn it. Brakes are so bad on this thing. It's not the driver. A good workman always blames his tools, what I heard. Idiot. Now, I don't think I turned off the generator at the gas station last time. Yeah, there's a zombie hovering around right where it is. That would indicate to me that we did not... And the fact the lamppost is on down there. Run. Would you care to join me over by the street lamp? Yeah, not ideal. The zombies are being drawn to the sound of that thing. Understandably. No! Jeez, man. Turn off that generator. Don't want it breaking down. Get me out of here. Scary. <laughs> Genuinely on edge the whole time. Come on, you. Oh, thank goodness we're back here. Right, what's the damage on this generator? Yeah, condition 94, not bad. Turn it off. There we go, good as new. Let's get some sleep. Oh wow, we're starting to get this. Chilly. Time to stick on a jacket, maybe. In fact, let's do that now. Because I've been holding off wearing a jacket. Much better. Let's hit the exercise and we'll head out. Get a little rest. How are our gas cans doing? It's two empties. One half empty. This is fine. We'll be gone a couple of days at least. We've got two bowls in us, that's good. Well, we might as well start taking some stuff over, actually. I'm thinking the stuff we're going to need mainly is more melee weapons and stuff, you know? But we are going to need this sledgehammer. We're probably going to take this van. I imagine it's got the most capacity. I mean, that's probably enough right there to be getting on with. We can always come back for more. I only want to take the basics with me. Stuff that can stay, you know, will stay. Let's quickly make up these salads. Right, eat one of those. Rid ourselves of anxiety. We might not actually leave today. Reason being, I wouldn't mind just... Cutting down a few trees in this area, which I know is relatively clear. Broccoli here to harvest. Not bad, 39 fresh broccoli out of that. Don't really have room for it, so we'll throw that in here. It's own separate bit. Oh my goodness, there's a zombie right there. Girl, where did you come from? We good now? Oh, 
And where did you come from? I don't know, but you brought a night stick so you can come again. Right, rest off for a second. We're dehydrated, so have a quick drink. Fill our water bottles. Right, let's take this van. Well, there's 20 logs right there. And this is a McCoy Logging Corporation truck, so... Saw these logs. 60 planks. We can only take 27, but we've got more here. We just need to remember that. Get some veggies out for the morning. Let's get rid of the anxiety. Go to sleep. And then we'll head up in the morning. Three AM. What a wake up time is this? Hey, we've just crossed into fourteen thousand the fitness level. Eighteen thousand is the goal. That's pretty good. Okay, give me a couple of cooking pots. All right, good. A couple of stews here, or soups, I think they are technically. Oh, I'd put the extra effort in this morning. There we go, beautiful. All right, so what I'm gonna do? Is Ninety-four hunger. Gonna have all of that. See if it does anything for me. Nope, but it does make me very full. Then we're going to make these into bowls. We're going to make two bowls of soup for the rest of the day. Stick them in our backpack. But well, we can't. Oh, that's right. I've got these gas cans. That's fine. You random zombies dotted about here. Yeah, there's still cops coming out of that place. Let's shout them over. Hey, dummies. Well, let's go with our truck full of weapons and planks. Let's head back up to Moldra. And we're going to try and make a bit of a base over our situation up there. Man, is this pile of bodies ever going to disappear? The car flipper. There we go. We've got some gas cans for the new base now. Get rid of the anxiety. Let's keep pushing on. Oh, we've got a few here. Ooh, that one's got something stuck in it. I think it's a spear. Yeah, I'll take your spear. Keeping that population down. All right, here we are. The road to Moldra. This creepy zombie here. All right, we've seen a few more trickle over to this area. Whoa! What are you doing there? It's dangerous to stand in the middle of the road, especially on a blind turn like that. Silly zombie. We've got a few here. Let's test out the old machete. Been a while since I used this. Man, I love that thing. Painkillers? Yeah, I guess we'll take them. Looks like we're ready for a bowl of soup. Well, this is it. This is home. There's a zombie just here. I don't think it was you. Yeah, this area is not the safest. All right, looks like I've done a pretty good job of barricading these. Give me three planks. Get the machete. Been spotted. All right, are we safe for a second? There we go. Base is barricaded. We've just seen how likely it would be that any of these trailers had sheets on, because we need sheet ropes. The answer appears to be not bloody likely. Well, let's get these planks out. Actually, 
Right, we'll leave these few items in the truck. Okay, we are drowsy here. Yeah, we need a bunch of sheets. Where can we get them from? Oh, don't do this. I hate the way the vehicles react to the bodies in the road. Anything going on over here? Nope. We do need to get into them at some point. No, I can't see any sheets in there. Let's just drive up the road a little. Don't want any fights that are too big right now. Oh, yeah, this looks more residential. Also, a lot of zombies just there. Hmm, yeah, this is crawling with them. I think time to pop some vitamins. Right, most of our tiredness is gone. But also, all of our vitamins are gone. So, got to move quick here. Try and make the most of this before we get tired again shortly. Right, as long as those guys aren't spotting me, that's okay. Oh, it's a toilet paper house. Also, none of these houses have curtains, which is really what I need. I'm hungry again. Let's have another bowl of soup. Whoa. And where did you come from? Broken baseball bat. We'll grab the empty cooking pot. The tinned food will see me through tomorrow, hopefully. Right, no luck on the sheets, but at least we know up here is not too bad. Well, apart from all those guys over there. <laughs> yeah, apart from where it's really bad, it's not too bad. I got to do a bit of fighting here, but it looks of it. Whoa. You guys can all stay up there. But it's risky staying here. Until we can get the sheet ropes and stuff. But it is what it is. Let's sleep. Kind of a more reasonable wake up time, I suppose. Alright, sit ups are done. Let's make a salad. Let's make a fruit salad. Oh, the canned stuff here. Alright, let's eat that vegetable salad right now. With the fruit salad in the backpack. Alright, let's go back out and search for sheets then. We can put on the ground. A couple of zombs. I mean, this area is messy at the moment. It's just full of bodies. But it will get better. Come on, I see you, girl. Over here. I hear some friends in the trees, I can see. Oh, more on here. And even more here. Ooh. More of a crowd there than I realised. I think I'll be switching to the machete. Hmm. Tank top was in better condition than mine. See, I'm not seeing curtains on any of these houses. Right, come on then, zombos. More potato and corn. Ooh, a couple of um, cooking pots here for us, that's good. Oh, 
Why do you gotta be a lookout zombie? Hey, some curtains. It's a sheet. Well, we got one sheet out of these four houses. Got more to check out over here, though. Grab that spear with butter knife off this guy. Uh, they've got a tiny bit of vitamins, better than nothing, I guess. Over here, please. Another spear. Rubber duck. Has to be taken. Oh man, all this food. Oh, a sheet. Perfect. Right, eat that fruit salad. I'll have that chocolate, thank you. Yeah, the machete broke. So now we need to put the axe back on the back, I think. Man, that axe is killer. Oh yes, hello. Looking good for sheets. Oh, we're tired, apparently. Let's rest. More chocolate stuff. We're nearly underweight again, actually. Loads more canned food. We love that. Nice, another sheet. This house was the sheet jackpot. Now let's head back down the road here. Yeah? Oh man. Do that, those guys hanging about. Right, we have a sheet rope there. The interesting thing about this place is there's windows all around, so if I can just make some sort of walkway all the way around, we, we can put multiple entrances in. And we only need access to sleep in this one little bit here. We can have a base of operations down here, I'm fine with that. We also need an actual sheet here now. Alright, let's get some sleep. I was going to drive back, but we'll have to maybe do that tomorrow. Sleep it off. Rest it off. Let's take... Sledgehammer with us today. We're going to open cans of corn, cans of potato, cans of beans, peas. We're going to make um, a nice little salad. And we've got pineapple and fruit cocktail. There we go. We've got all these nice things here. Oh, there we go. The canned peas won't go in anything, so I'll just eat them on their own. And let's get rid of the hunger for now. We'll keep these in our... Oh, no. Okay, well, I can't cancel that now. We're eating the fruit salad as well, apparently. Which is 45 hunger, it's pretty good. We're all good here. But it's really foggy. What are we doing for water? Oh, we're doing okay. Okay, we've opened up all of those. Kind of what I thought. Go on this way. Finally, the key. Because right, there's one behind here. 
Wow, we both missed. All right, let's uh, start leaving this place then. Fitness contraption. That's gonna be curious. There we go, put the sledgehammer away. Well, there's a shovel, a bunch of seeds. More seeds and a couple of empty gas cans, not bad. These things make me jump every time. Any of them wearing anything good? Nope. More seeds. Oh, I've never seen a trumpet in this before. Box of nails, I'll take them. I love that pop. Gotcha. I'll take that generator. We need one for the gas station around here. Well, hello, girl. Where did you come from? Got a little horde coming in. At least the fog's let up now. Yeah, they're just coming in from those trees by the looks of it. Hmm, do we want this large brown table for the base? Alright, so that's what the fitness contraption was. There we go, the van's loaded up. Yeah, it's so full. We're probably best served spending the rest of the evening trying to sort out our living arrangement. Hey, what are you doing on my base, you lot? That one's just wandering off. Where are you going, girl? Come back. She's still walking away. Right, give me my large table. Right, let's have that vegetable salad, and I think I've got everything more or less where I want it right now. Alright, I don't know how much you can see, but but two wide flooring all the way around here. I'm gonna put fences up as well to stop me falling off. But good progress. Let's sleep. There you go, you can see it a bit better now. I'm gonna do this all the way around the pier. Get rid of these stairs, put sheet ropes out of every window. It's gonna be good. Oh, we have got more planks here, so we can do a few more. Kind of in the mood just to get this done. We are out of materials again. Get another. though. There we go. Some sort of salad of potato and beans. Sounds good to me. Eat it. Now we've got a can of open chilli there, but we'll have that whenever. Alright, we're getting somewhere. But we do need a lot more sheets for the windows as well. We've got a load of planks ready to go back at the old base, so we'll... Make sure we go back there tonight so we can finish that project at some point. Yeah, we were looting these houses up here. Kind of what I want to continue doing, if I can. Some big groups here. I think this is Axe territory. There we go, nice. Hey, we've got the key for this thing. Got a little bit of gas. Oh, looks like we got a backup car. And food, very good. Oh, that's soup on the ground. Nice empty cooking pot for us. Ooh, survivor house, nice. Well, that is what we're talking about.
Turn to knife. Beauty. Check out the back over here. Propane tank there. That's good. Come on, you. Up the fence, please. All right, nice. Man, there's two of them in there. Nothing but canned food so far. There's a military helmet. Wear these leather gloves. Two nice sticks, that's good. No, it wasn't too much in there. We've got a lot of sheets, though, which we need. Get rid of our anxiety on the walk back. Seems I've alerted some zombies. Turn that engine off. Yeah, I wouldn't mind getting these planks, you see. So I can do a bit more work on my floor. Alright, good. Well, let's see that kind of chilli. Ooh, vitamins. Full thing of them. Alright, not much going on here. Well, let's get back and see if we can't do some more work on our base quickly then. Whoa! Little crew out here. Let's see what else we can get done here. Well, I found a bunch of planks on the floor over here, which is pretty nice. Alright, we are out of planks. We're nearly made it all the way around. We just need to now get rid of some of these things. Put up our sheet ropes here. Got sheet ropes in all but one of the windows. Let's just add an actual sheet to that. That's where we sleep. Right, let's get rid of this staircase then. We're going to drive back to the other base, I think. We've got more planks over there we need to bring back. And we could do with just... Making sure the generator's okay. We do need to head back there every few days or so while we're moving between the bases. We eventually want everything set up over here, of course. Put the headlights on. There we go. That helps a little. Just realised. Got the generator in here which needs to come out. That's going to seriously hamper my room of boys. And that's where it's going to go, that generator. We got it for the gas station, so we might as well go there until we set it up. Right, we're on the highway back now. Won't be long. There's a zombie there somewhere. Oh, there they are. All right, made it back. Straight to bed with us. We just needed to be over here. You know the drill. Exercise time. Rest a Rooney. 14,823 out of 18,000 for fitness. We're really getting there. All right, so we are still in the process of moving. We have got a fire axe on our back, but that's kind of seen better days. We do have a crowbar we can switch to here, so it's not the end of the world. We got any mint condition fire axes? We got one right here. Another decent quality one right there. We'll take them with us, you see. Anybody out here? Not that I can see. Make sure the generator is okay before we go anywhere. Fuel 45, condition 88. 
100% fuel, 100% condition. We have to turn it on because it's keeping our veggies over here nice and frozen. So this gas can can stay. This gas can can also stay. Ah, oh, they can all stay. That's fine. I just open in a can of chili. Perfect timing because we're now hungry. And we've got another one ready to go there, you see. I'm gonna move this car into a space because it's right in the way there. I go back up right next to this pile of planks. Make sure no zombies are followed. All right, we're good. All right, there we go. All right, hit the road. Yes, gonna help you. Come on, hippie. And where did you two come from? That's right, come this way. You two go, come on. Right, I can't remember if I turned the generator off last time I was here. I remember I left in a bit of a panic. Yeah, it's still on. In okay condition. Considering. Might as well top up the van while we're here, eh? And turn it off so it doesn't explode or whatever. Hello, Zombo. There goes my strength going up for no reason whatsoever again. It just seems to go up and down randomly. Hey, girl, what's going on? Not much, you say. Right, we're hungry again. We'll get in the car. And we will eat this. Whoops. Apologies. Did not mean to hit you with the van. It's really nice driving down this road now. It's so clear, you can just put your foot down and just pedal to the metal. And if you do hit somebody, it's probably only going to be like one zombie on its own. It's so cleared out. That's exactly why I put the time and effort into clearing it, you know? Down the slip road, and off to Muldra we go. This is where we probably start seeing some zombies. Right, NQ. Got this guy and old pink pants over here. All right, back home. Go on, Zomp. Quick walk around the perimeter. Yep, seems to be fine. Right, I've got as many planks as I can grab. Try getting up this. Drop them. Right, it's so dark, I think I'm just gonna... Uh-oh. Well, it seems like my sheet rope's been pulled away there. Okay, yeah, we're over here. Sleep. Yeah, I can't believe my sheet rope's missing from there. The swines. That's why I put multiple. Oh, the fog's coming in now. Wonderful. Let's get this wooden floor finished here. There we go. So we have the floor in. It all matches up around here. The only thing we haven't got is a quick way down from here. Planks and nails are on the floor there. All right, it feels like we're getting somewhere. But we're about to drop to underweight here. All right, fruit salad gives more hunger, bizarrely. So we'll get rid of more hunger, I suppose. We'll have that. Now we're full. Let's just down this maple syrup, eh? See if that does anything for our weight. Nope. We do have this ready to go as well. Pondering how best to use it. Let's go on a little adventure then. Let's go... Do something. Man, we've been busy over here. Always surprises me. This way, Zombo. Uh, let's push up a little. See what else is up here. I'm 
sort of storage place. A very small storage space, isn't it? Ooh. Okay. Well, there's some friends. Right, this girl sees me. Ooh. Gonna load more of them. There's definitely no one in here. Okay. Girl, where did you come from? Oh, goodness, this is bad. Ooh. Quick my feet there. Goodness me. Oh, she broke out of there. Okay, well, that could be an idea. Somebody's trying to break out of that one right there. Darn it, no key. There's a key. In fact, you come with me. Keep up, come on. Oh, man. Not one of them have got the key. Jeez. Hey. Well, there's some fishing stuff here. Ugh. Where'd you all come from? Nice. Box and nails we'll take. Oh, nice. Very nice condition axe right there. That's a good find. And another box of nails. Some more wood glue. Bit of deck to tape. And more wood glue. Well, not the best ever, but a couple of really nice things there. The axe really made it worth it, I think. Woo. Zombie, what are you doing? And a knife. Yeah, a vegetable salad. Woo. It's always harder with those ones. You never know whereabouts they're going to be standing. Already red. Okay. Potatoes. Let's check that duffel bag. Just a blue pen. Take a little wander over here. Yeah, they've broken this down. Look at this. Whoa, big, big crew up there. Look at that. We were here. Oh, let's have a quick look around the church. Okay, we're collecting quite the crowd here. Okay, nice. Yeah, no wedding this time. Well, hello, Zomp. Looking very smart. Been to church, have we? Nah, nothing going on here. Gonna grab this water dispenser. Let's go. Hmm. I just saw something that could have been a katana. I have to go and see now. One of these looked like they had something in them. No, I guess not. Okay. Gotta always be on the lookout for that. Oh, man. 
We're over and over here. I've got the water dispenser on me and I can't get rid of it. Thank zombies. I have no choice but to clamber up this. Right, away from there. Well, please get away from there. I don't want them to break my door. Well, that wasn't good. Okay, the door's still on. Just about. It's another sheet rope gone. Man, these zombies are just menaces. Get to sleep. Let's get some exercise. And rest. Right, I wanted to check something here. Whoops. Stop hitting my garage door. Okay, now I've put this window here. My question is, can I put a sheet rope out of this? That's something that we're going to be testing. My goodness, guys. Get off my garage door. It's not for zombies. Right, eat that kind of chili. Right, let's go out. We need more sheets. Oh, I got... Get rid of that anxiety and let's go for a drive. Whoop, didn't see you there, Zomb. Man, I'm struggling to see anything here. I see a couple of zombies, though. A bread knife, a kitchen knife, a fork. Come on. Where are the katanas at? Or at least machetes, you know? Even a hunting knife. Another bread knife there. Oh, you're kidding. Always the darn way, isn't it? That'll be this area difficult to deal with for a while. I'm gonna go this way. Yeah, yeah, zombies, you all heard the sound. Wow. Hey, a football pitch. Or a soccer field, as you probably call it. Jeez. Hmm. Right, zombies, get out of my way. Is there uh, some sort of motel around here, I seem to remember? Yeah, this is, I think, what I want. Turn. Yeah, motel. Perfect. Actually, drive. Because... There's just a few too many. I need to ease my way into a situation like that. Right, it's going to have to be the axe. That's a lot of zombies.
Well, that was a big, big crowd I was not expected to take on today. Jeez, that was pretty nerve-wracking. It was pretty close a couple of times. They nearly got me. I nearly messed up my timing. Yeah, pretty pleased with that. I haven't got much food. Making sure there's nothing great on these, like, you know, vitamins or something. There's a random level of strength I get every day. But it drops down to nine and back up. Okay, let's have this bag of chips. Losers. <laughs> gonna hear something funny. We've still got all these by the van. I need to rest if I'm gonna take them on. I don't know if that's enough rest. Oh man, my axe just broke. Good thing I've got another one right here. Nice, new nightstick. We are getting tired. No nightstick from him. Right, I think I'm going to do something a bit odd. I'm going to come around this way and take this back road down and go around because I just don't want to stir them all up in the main highway. Uh, maybe get a smoke out. No, I just unpacked them. Gosh darn it. Now I can't repack them. Pat fingers. This is where we want to be. I was contemplating coming here to um, hook up the generator, but I think we're maybe a bit too tired. Oh, we'll see. Oh, we have a gas gun here. It's connected now. Right here, zombs. Right, this is connected and fueled. I guess we could turn it on. Just to quickly... Flip this gas can. There we go, that's something off the to-do list. Just need to remember to come back. Going on. Come here, girl. Yeah, we just need to remember to come back and fill up the gas cans at some point and then we can get the generator set up at home. Home sweet home. We never did get any sheets like I wanted. Oh, these gas cans are all full. Quick kind of spag ball. Oh, let's get some sleep. 5.20 a.m. Oh, and it's storming. Our favourite. Time to do our other favourite, some sit-ups. 15,400 out of 18,000 from the old uh, fitness skill now. Getting really close. Is there a way I can remove this sheet rope from here? Yeah. I'm going to pick up the nails in case I just need them. There we go. It's add escape rope. Okay, that really works then. So, if I just grab however many planks I can carry. Wooden wall with window. Then if we add a sheet rope to that, then we've got one right by our bed. Pretty ideal. That's nice. Got to go outside to come in now. I think we're more or less ready to head out in the big bad world. Let's eat this fruit salad. Well, these bodies are starting to clear up out here. That's good. All right, let's see about going back towards that neighborhood. Or do we go back to the motel since we cleared a lot of that out? That's going to have so many sheets for us. Now, I'm feeling residential because... There's a chance that we could get a stick of butter then. As weird as that sounds, that's something we desperately need. We've got some work to do around here, looking at this. Yeah, there's a few over here we could just do a taking out. Some additional smokes. The Backstreet Boys have spotted us. Oh, 
I love getting them in a line like that. Really satisfying. Yeah, reason I wanted to get rid of all these zombies around here is they've got a chance to migrate down to my base, so might as well clear them out now. And I am still loving this nightstick. I think I remember this big office building, and I think it's pretty rough, isn't it? Ooh, jeez. I don't want to wait around for these guys all day. Nice, and a knife. Zombie trying to break in there. Holy moly. That's a lot of zombies back here. Vitamins, that's a good find. Still a few back here. We're getting exerted easier, and I think it's because... We're underweight. We're officially underweight now, so that probably has something to do with it. Grabbing the water dispenser. Here we go. More delicious water for us. Oh, you're not dressed for the weather, are you? In your pink mini skirt. Oh man, now this is getting alarmed. I'm having rotten, rotten luck with these alarms. It's gotta be said. Yeah, I'm not here for you, Zomb. I was literally just breaking in there to have a rest, is the irony. Thank goodness I left the engine running. Holy zombies. Yeah, it's been stirred up something rotten over here, hasn't it? And you know why? Because of the previous alarm, yesterday. Deja vu here. Wow. That is crazy. Oh, that zombie had something big stuck in it. Oh, man. Could have been a katana, you know? The further up I go, the less likely it is I'm going to be able to obtain it. Let's see if we can spot him again. No, there's just too many zombies here. Yeah, this one here. This one here. I think that is a katana. Oh, man, that's kind of worth fighting for. I stand your ground then. I see the zombie. I think it might be a pipe now I see it closer. It is. It's a pipe. It's a pipe. Oh no. I took a wrong turn. I backed myself between this van and this car. And then I was like, oh no, I've got nowhere to kite here. And I tried to run through a little gap, but kind of messed up the controls. Ah, oh, man, that's a shame. I was really enjoying that run. Really, really enjoying that run. All because of this zombie here. I thought that was a katana from a distance. Jeez, man. Well, there we go. These things happen, especially in this game. We'll be back with another series soon. Thanks for watching. Leave a like if you enjoyed. Subscribe if you're new. And I'll catch you next time. Bye-bye.